Oh my god, we're live. Ah. Hi, chat. Are you muted? Maybe. Are we all muted? Oh. Uh oh. Uh, oh, they just jump up. Oh, yeah, no, no, yeah, he, okay. he's not gaslighting. There we go. Not this it's time. working. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> Streamlabs likes to do that really cute, fun thing where it's like, what if we just like picked a different microphone? The one that, like, a microphone that doesn't exist. What if we made that your microphone? It's so much fun. Anyways, hi, hello, everybody. Congrats on getting first crim. Congrats on getting second stitch. And congrats on getting third Daddy. Welcome in. Hi, Tough Tony. Hi, Aster. Yeah, I'm excited to get back into this, too. I was planning on making this a whole week of just inescapable, but I was like, no, I want to do your turn to die stuff. <clears throat> Hi, Puppeteer. Uh, I'm glad you... Wait, do you mean the stream title or do you mean the, the video title, V-Daddy? Because that could really go either way, because both of them are a little bit gremlin behavior. And thank you for the congrats, Stitch. I'm so glad it's working out pretty well. Um, I think I got to everyone. My brain is still a little bit broken. I mean, it will be three streams in a row of Inescapable. We're going to do it kind of like what we've done so far. They're also going to be long streams. The video, yeah, fair enough. The video, I I had a lot of titles in the works for that video. Like, there were a lot of options that I kind of cycled through. One of them was, like, I think the working title for the longest time was, um, well, I can find it. Because it's what it's it's what the, like, project name is named or, like, the folder. It was just called, I did a study about how gullible Overwatch players are and I'm making that your problem, I think. Yeah. I figured the gaslighting one was funnier. I don't have a will written out yet. I don't need it. He's not allowed to die. Not while I'm here. <laughs> I'm the reason other people need wills. Specifically, the developers are inescapable. Okay, that's different. They need they need a will. No, actually, first they need to. They have to uh, give you compensation for the yeah, they uh, personal damage. I need to be in the will. I need the yeah, fifty dollars. I need fifty dollars. My brother who bought it for me needs fifty dollars. I think they like owe it to charity too. <clears throat> but yeah, so we're gonna. Last time we did this, where did we? We got up to the point where, um, and I guess this is your spoiler warning in case anybody is watching this and somehow is also concerned about spoilers at this point. But we just had uh, Alice get uh, his guts blown out, which is unfortunate for him. Did a reverse belly bolt on that man. Yeah, I wanted I wanted to ravage his hole, not that way. Yeah, now he has new holes. But yeah, apparently. <laughs> yeah. And then I went and looked and I was like, huh, so I didn't have to go that way. That was a different outcome. Yeah. Alice is the uh Alice is the prisoner. Wait, hold on, I can show it because I I started using a new thumbnail. Weird one. Oh, I actually need to hold on. Let me uh because I I uploaded the new thumbnail, but I didn't tag Jono in it, and I want to remember to credit him because the art is very, very pretty. Oh. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, ba 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 ba. Because yeah, I've changed up the thumbnail now because I now that Puppo is joining me, I feel like at this point Puppo is part of these streams, so it feels kind of weird to just have him sitting off on the side. Yeah, the one with the the fake severed head. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. God, can you tell that it's been a hot minute since I actually did any sort of streaming? <laughs> I also just realized that putting this on my safe for work account is maybe I'm gonna have to crop it a tiny bit. That works. Oh my god, I am the emotional support puppo. Uh, I think I have it right. God, I hate that I can't... Like, I follow this person. Let me just find their name. Yeah, it's my emotional support puppo. <laughs> also, yeah, Alice seems great. I am really sad that he's not with us anymore. Because <laughs> he's, he's very... He was fun. I liked him. Let's, make well, sure let's talk about, him. like, who alternately would have died, right? Well, I know that it was Reko. Oh, okay. Because yeah, I was just sure if you wanted me to say... <laughs> I mean, at this point, again, everyone's gotten their spoiler warnings. Um, 
Yeah, alternatively, it's either Reko or her brother that dies. Uh, I feel, I've seen a little bit of both routes up to this, only up to this chapter. I don't know about chapter three as much, um, but um, I've seen both routes. It doesn't really change much. Alice is nice to have, but I, I feel like Reko gets a little more time to shine, especially because now it's the real Reko, not um, clone Reko, you mm-hmm. know? Uh, Alice kind of had his yeah. reconciliation with his sister in a weird way. I do really feel bad though that like, like um, what was I gonna say? I can't. Oh yeah, no, I feel bad for the people who are responsible for making this game because like having to cover those divergent paths has got to be an absolute monster. I'll say here's what the new thumbnail template looks like. Yeah, look at us. Yeah, it's very pretty. Okay, anyways, sorry that took way longer to do than I intended for it to. But anyways, so. <laughs> I also have the music turned off. I probably could have turned that back on, but it's just the background music in this menu is so loud. Okay. So, chapters. We're, we are at uh, chapter two, part two, right? Yes, I believe so. Because we just finished. Alice just died. So, I think that that was. That should be the part where we're at, right? I can't I... think of where yes. else we would be. Yeah, Alice died, and I think. I just don't remember which exact point we're at. Hmm. Yeah, they're both. I like them both. They're they're both interesting characters, and it was it, it like. I respect a game like this that doesn't try and do the like. Like you guys watched The Walking Dead way back when that was like popular, and you'd always be like, "Hmm, I wonder if this side character is gonna die." They've gotten four episodes dedicated just to them. Like, what's her name, Beth? Where it's like, huh, this character who's had 12 lines in three seasons is suddenly getting multiple full episodes dedicated to her. I wonder what's going to happen. Or if a queen gets multiple confessionals. Yeah, all of a sudden. Drag race. Yeah. It's like, like I, I appreciate when a game is willing to be like, no, you don't get a completed ending. Like, kind of like what V3 did, but V3, I think, overshot it a little bit. Anyways. How you doing? I take you down a stroll, or on a stroll down memory lane, recap the story so far. Be great. Didn't you die? I'm pretty sure you died. Hmm. Oh yeah, they did get shot, but uh, they got better. I guess back for this. They got better for the storyline. And right. can you stream it for me, please? Oh right, yeah. Sorry, I forgot to do that. I am Thank cool. unprofessional streamer. I forgot. Okay. Well, I mean, you're already you're streaming the important one. I, I'm less important. I mean, to be fair, my microphone wasn't working when we started. So, okay. <laughs> Are you able to see it now? Yes. Surprise, motherfucker. Yeah. All right. Let me hear it. Right, get down on your knees. Okay, well, you know what? Ooh. Sometimes we can just be normal. These guys are Sarah Chiduin and her best friend, Joe Tazuna. Also, okay, I need to say this right now. If you guys hear me mispronouncing a name, please tell me. I'm not doing it as a bit. I'm afraid to pronounce the name of the man in Buried Stars, who's my husband, because apparently I've been saying it wrong for like a combined 30 hours, and none of you assholes told me, even though, like, the person who finally did DM me and was like, hey, it's like, are you doing that intentionally? Or like what i was like no someone told me that that's how it's supposed to be uh, so to be yes. fair, korean names are hard well because part of it is that like i would usually just try and listen to it in the conversation but korean is one of those languages that's like very very fast and its structure i think is a little bit different than english so it's hard to pick up exactly where it's being said okay. i don't know if somebody could tell if somebody did <laughs> somebody did call me out and then they kind of said like i'm not sure exactly how to say it i just know you're wrong <laughs> Anyways, these guys are Sarah Chidwin and her best friend Joe T- uh, Tizuna. They're a f- pair of dweebs who waltz together into the death game, all friendly like. Also, if I'm struggling over words, please forgive me. I have done so much. I've been wearing his out- mouth out a little bit too much. God I apologize, damn it, chat. What? That's unrelated. No, the video is so long. But glad it's over. Is that was that in there before? I feel like it must have been. Anyways, yeah, so without having a clue what uh... was. Because I'm guessing that must have been yeah, this. Yeah. Yeah, it was. Without having a clue what was what, their first trial began and they cleared lots more. And they chose to cooperate and survive with all the other participants. But their cooperation was for naught, and a high school teacher, Kazumi Mishima, died. You know, I'm... I never want to be that person... Like, I'm sure you had this experience too, where it's like... The, like, vice principal who's, like, calling out names at, like, the year-end assembly at school, and is just, like, completely unwilling to try and gets every name wrong. Yep. Like... I am always worried about coming across like that. It, it's just, it's why I always ask people when they come into chat if I don't know, like, hey, how do I pronounce your name? Just to make sure. And they'll be like, oh, whatever's fine. And I'm like, no. Um, you can't say whatever. Answer. You have to give... Yeah, there is a right something. answer to this. 
<laughs> Anyways, the next student now at Egokoro went into this hilarious panic over it, see? So the self-described homemaker Kaisato made use of that to instigate her. And she stole back the laptop that job hopper so Hiori got his hands on. The laptop concealed proof that Kai was colluding with the organization. Ultimately, Kai died in the main game, all because he grabbed the Sage card. And Joe, too. He got the Sacrifice card and died. He sure did. Uh oh. Yeah. Seems no. hallucinations are just eat away at Sarah. I mean, that one was the most telegraphed anything has ever been. Mm -hmm. The second stage was the sub game, where everyone traded tokens amongst themselves. Oh my god, Puppy would be so good at a sub game. Oh, uh, hey. During all that, an AI of the dead Mishima showed up. And sort of a fake doll that looked just like Reko. It was one huge calamity. Amid all that, Kitaro Burgerberg discovered the laptop again. He was nearing the heart of the death game, but... Lured by tokens, he handed the laptop over to So. Man, ain't Double Crossing just the best? Hi, hey, Joshua. Yeah, it is, it's... Definitely has... It pulls a lot of inspiration from Danganronpa, but improves on it in a lot of ways, too. Plus, I welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Kitaro gathered the most tokens, and Gin Ibushi didn't get, or collect squad. I did also call him Jin for a little while. It's like another one. <laughs> I was looking to forward fair, to him dying. Sorry, what? To be fair, I don't think they've ever pronounced his name, so... Yeah, you can really just say whatever, like, I guess. Because both are oh, both are names that I've heard in anime, so you can do whatever you want. That choice. is the thing, too, is like, the letter G in particular, the Anglic or Anglic <clears throat> Anglicization of like a lot of uh, Japanese names that use G, it feels like they, like, a hard G and a soft G are used, like, in ways that I wouldn't expect them in English. Like, K-A-G-E is a name that, like, feels like it should be pronounced Cage, but it's Kage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I, there is somebody in my community who is K-A-G-E, but pronounces it Cage. Anyways, okay, hotshot, pop quiz. Which of these two was the one to actually die? I love that we could just change it up, but no. Did Alice Yabasame die? Yes. Correct, Mundo, good for you. It was Alice Yabasame who died in the end, caught by my lies, in fact. Man, you guys are seriously stupid. Having feelings when you're killing each other, it'll only hurt you, you know? Oh, oh yeah, that's right, there we go. What I didn't know is that I'd be killed too. But I... I should have been Dad's masterpiece. Now, everyone, if your memories are all in order, allow me to invite you once again to the main game. Eight remain. <clears throat> hey, you know what a majority vote is? One vote. Another vote. I like these voting cards are like this weird logo that I don't think shows up anywhere else so far. Huh? You didn't know they'd die? <laughs> oh right, we saw some shit was so here. Fuck, I remember this was freaking me out because we had to see a little bit of it. Also, I should yep. put this on performance mode. I don't like that his mouth is like visibly open. Anyways, we're gonna just... Well, I got used to majority votes yet? Yes, no, shut up. Oh my god, it's a loony. It's a fruit and chat. Loony. <gasps> loony. Drink the drink. Go follow by in. Go in. Yeah, okay. Go in is the mistake I was making with the character from Buried Stars whose name I need to like go on Google Translate and figure out how to pronounce it properly. Because I was saying like Gai Hayek, but I think it's supposed to be like Gyu Hyuk or something. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways. I could ask awful. Are there, any, to... yeah. are there any correct or incorrect answers in this section as far as you recall? Uh, I don't believe so. I think the it was definitely the last one, but I'll double check. I'll look at a guide real quick. I don't think this one is the wrong one. Oh, I just realized his expression is changing. I don't like that. Uh, oh, damn. Uh, it doesn't up. look like there's any in the beginning. I just don't want him to keep changing his expression because that's making me scared. Are you getting mad? We'll keep it up and vote for who you hate. Kill decisively so you can survive. Kill the people who get in your way. No big, no big. It's not like it's your fault. Aren't I right, Sohiori? Oh, your countenance has really changed. Funny. Do your best. I don't like this. I know this is just going to scare the shit out of me. I need to tear all these off and throw them out. Mm. Oh! Right, it's the eyeballs. Dispose of all the documents in that shredder. Uh-oh. Uh, what do you do with this one? Uh, to move to.
I don't think you would have known that yourself, that's why. Collapse on the floor. Important laptop. This. I remember it's Kai's laptop. Oh, are we in his nightmare? Uh, I don't like know if you dream. remember where we are. It's gone. It was stolen. I miss now when she... Collapse on the floor. Uh, let's... Oh, I guess we can't leave yet. That's fun. I think it is his dream. I'm dead. Oh. Hmm. I see. That time must now attack me. Every remaining trace, all of it. I wonder... Oh. I don't like any of this. Oh. Normally, I like having a hand. I am simply putting my hand over this. What's this? Obtain a frying pan. Oh. Oh, yep. So gloomy. Dead men tell no tales, right, Kai? I don't like it. Oh, we're Kai. How far are you going to run? Run? Me? No one needs you. Why do you live? I'm astonished by everyone just refusing to ever doubt that you're right. Isn't this enough? Here, I'll kill you. I don't like being scared. We're starting off on a bad no I was like, I thought for a second at the beginning with the Joe thing, I was like, oh, okay, cool, I'm getting better at this. No, you know, that's your true nature. It's your turn to die, so... Oh my god, she said the thing! Ooh. <gasps> Sarah! Ooh. Is it going to turn out that we're all AIs? We're all the dolls? Yeah. The dolls are the dolls. No, please wake up. Okay, am I, I'm going to turn up the volume again. I think you're fine oh. now. This is my room. Don't startle me all of a sudden. You're all I have left, so... Please don't... What about... What about Sarah? Sarah has tried so hard, Kana. You don't suddenly collapse. Uh... Sorry. Just relax. If you're obedient, I'll tell you how to survive. Kana, don't you betray me. Okay. Well then, let's start our strategy meeting. Oh wait, didn't we find him knocked out? No, that was way earlier in the chapter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me too, Kitaro. This is gonna be fun. We're getting to be fun. Oh my god, they're doing the title again. Oh my god, really ending. Hey. Is playing an instrument fun? <gasps> I forgot about this! They're so cute! This is... Oh. <laughs> what, you interested, bro? Watch, he makes me want to play, Echo. You're too clumsy, bro. Don't even can. I will say, one of my least favorite things in media is when they're, like, using bro and sis to refer to their actual siblings. Like, I I have never met anybody who calls their sibling bro or sis. So mean. Don't whine about it. All right, I'll teach you. You mean if it? Someone is an only child. I don't know. But I know my I know my one friend actually calls her bro bro. Oh, she calls her own bro, so I don't know. Yeah, like, people, like, nobody uses it specifically to refer to their brother or sister. Yeah, like, it's bro, like, as, like, a, an insincere, like, okay, bro. Like, interchangeable with dude, not interchangeable with brother. Anyways, if you get bored of it, I'll kick your butt. Of course I won't get bored. Hey, Reko, what's up? Someday let's make a band and have our debut. Wow, that's so specific. For real, I'll make songs and you'll sing them. Doesn't that sound wonderful? Ha ha ha, sounds great. Don't forget it, bro. Aww. Don't you ever forget. Don't you... Oh, oh. Forget about me. God, Sarah's going through it. Reko has just been staring at the unmoving Alice. Not even noticing me behind her. Mm. You dumbass. You broke another promise. Aww. No, maybe mm. I broke it. Saying, like, what would you know? I wouldn't even face you. Aww. Was I the mistaken one? Maybe you're not talking with me. Maybe even going and killing a guy. It was all my fault. It's my fault. It was all my fault. Hey, Papo, you just played a game that did this to you, too. I know. <laughs> <sighs> really the amame of this game, huh? Oh, oh, <sighs> just come back to life. Shit, I had so many chances to forgive you. What can I say? Oh my god, now are you going to be an ally? Guys, I know how you feel. But the main game will be very soon. Okay, well, how have you not learned how to be at least a little bit more helpful here? God damn it. Sorry, I just have to check something really quickly. Let's go. 
I see the the mommy thing works except uh, at least at least uh, uh, she wasn't the one that that offed somebody. Uh, yeah. Anyways, leave me alone, damn it. Reko. We were told to assemble, right? I know that. If I see one of those kidnappers' faces right now, I know my fists are gonna fly. Yeah, true. Siblings are like. It's also kind of interesting because I feel like the sibling dynamics in this one are interesting. I don't know. That games sometimes handle that stuff sort of weird. Can't do that. We can't lose you too, Reko. Right? So please, just leave me alone now. I understand. Sorry, not quite in this thing. I think. Oh god. Um. I think we just want to leave things be and let her mourn in peace for a little bit. Uh, a lot of the choices in this area don't really matter, just so you know. Okay. Nothing I can do. So do whatever your heart desires. No. <laughs> Wait, now! Yes? Never mind. For just a little bit. Stay at my side. Aww. There I go. Um, Sarah. Yeah? Please, leave this to me. Can't support everyone like you, Sarah, but I think I can support Reko right now. <laughs> Understood. We'll be right there. I'll make sure Reko will get back on her feet. I'll trust now. Off to the medical office. Head of Rio Ranger, just a doll, just like the fake Reko. Joe's hair clip remains in his hair. I'm guessing we don't want to take that hair clip. Probably not. I would say no. <laughs> yeah, let's maybe just... Let's just not do that. What is this? This is the... I go to the medical office, everyone should be waiting there. Big Sister Sarah! Again, you haven't moving already. Yeah, I'm totally better, Wolf. Poison won't scare me anymore. Okay, well... You're allowed to be scared of things that are genuinely scary, kiddo. Guess the Andrew <laughs> KG brought worked like a charm. Don't see no weird, af or weird after effects, neither. Good showing from your friendly policeman, eh? Okay, what the fuck is your deal, dude? Really ha was a close call. If KJ hadn't found the antidote, Gin might have... Thank you very much. Same to you. Your reasoning saved us, Sarah. Not to mention your decisiveness in that moment. <laughs> yeah, when we fucking pushed that doll into the hole. <laughs> you and now are really something. I allowed the fake record to die. And also, even Alice. And look at me, Sarah. You've lost a lot of allies on the way here. Alice, he may have looked like trouble at first, but I don't think he was a bad guy. But see, Sarah. You got the lives you saved right here. Isn't that right? <laughs> Our salvation. Gin smiles helping to save us all. Bitch, where? He's wearing a mask. You can tell he's smiling. You can see if someone's smiling. Yeah, I know. Mask. You could say like, oh yeah, like I can see it in his eyes that he's smiling. It's weird to be like, his smile specifically is so funny. <laughs> Thank goodness, you've gotten all better. Big sis now. Big sis Reko. I'm glad, Gin. Reko gently stroked Gin's head. Aww. You just love the little detail change, too? On Reko? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, the eye makeup. Yep. Oh, interesting. It's very pretty. I kind of... I was getting used to her having the eye makeup, but like... I like... I like it without it, too. Anyways. I do too, yeah. What are you crying for? You're a big kid. Sorry, Meow. I couldn't do anything. So, Alice... Ain't nothing for you to apologize about, Gin. But... They sure scared you, huh, Gin? I think it's also so interesting, like, the pose she's in. Like, this is such a different vibe from how she's been before. <laughs> Sorry the real me couldn't be there when you were in a pinch. Oh, big sis Reko. So all of you have assembled. I will now begin explanations for the second main game. Mr. Kinabushi, how are you fear fe fearing? Fearing? But yeah, no, she, she looks, like, different kind of pretty. There he is now, Uncle Crab Sash. Get his ass. I mean, yeah, some fucked up facial hair. More like a squid, but you think we're just gonna li sit here and listen to your damn explanation? You guys are always pulling tricks. I won't trust you, woof. Mm. What the heck, don't come any closer. Fantastic. Just amazing, Mr. Ginabushi. Astonishing resilience. Why, you're the picture of health already. And Uncle Crab Sash. It's an honor to receive such a charming nickname. Are you screwing with us now? Fantastic, simply fantastic! 
I feel sick. Oh dear, so there's yet some venom left. It's not that. Um, when are you getting to the explanation? Gashu? Pardon me. Well then, I shall explain this main game. That said, the basic rules are the same. It is a voting game making use of four cards, the Keymaster, Sage, Sacrifice, and Commoner. The Keymaster is the Keyman of Destruction. Should they be chosen, the one who carries it bears great responsibility, but it also serves as armor. I read that wrong. The Sage is a superhuman who knows the one in possession of the Keymaster role. But once exposed, it's hard to protect oneself. The Sacrifice will die unless chosen. They are the sole person who can turn defeat into victory, or victory into defeat. And the commoners have no power at all, but thus they fill the role of guiding the discussion in the proper direction. However, this time we will use data in place of paper cards. Data? Card data has already been distributed at random to the voting tablets you possess. All that remains is the permission to access it. Why did you have to make it so roundabout? Very sharp indeed, Mr. Kitaro. Because this time, you are able to make trades. And forcibly at that. We can trade our cards. Indeed. Now then, let me show you. Come forth, ring up box. A phone booth came from the floor. Oh, sorry, I just need to... I don't know why I don't have this set up differently. I can really tell that I have not been streaming for a little while. Anyways, phone booth came up from the floor. You may trade cards by making a request at one of these ring-up boxes situated in each room. That seems like overkill. They are simple to use. Simply insert 50 tokens and grab the receiver. 50 tokens. Of course, just like the sub-game, you cannot use your own tokens. Hi hey Ben, welcome in, how are you? What a ridiculous rule. Oh, I had thought you'd be delighted, Mr. Kitaro. It's an awful rule. People without tokens don't even have the, or get the right to trade. Trades are one-on-one -on -one with who you select. Please treat, or trade freely with whomever you wish. I'm doing good. The video came out today and is doing well, so I'm in a good mood. You have a time limit of approximately three hours. When all have returned to their bedrooms, that will signal the start of this trading phase. Do not, or do not wear such gloomy looks, everyone. Win and survive, or you are all born to win. What is he talking about? Then please return to your rooms within five minutes. If you do not... You understand, don't you? Just... No, Bobo's in my bedroom for now. Well, The atmosphere is unpleasant. We look at each other's faces and try and judge how we're feeling. What should I say? Mm. Well, let's just go to our rooms for now. You're easily impressed. Oh, thank you for the follow, Ben. And after that, we'll definitely find a way to escape. I won't let them have their way. Then I'll head back first. Don't want to get killed for being tardy. Let's get going, guys. I just save really quickly. I don't like. Wait, are hallucinations still a thing at this point, or have we like moved past that? I think we. You don't have anymore, but I'm pretty sure you're not supposed. To, you weren't supposed to. You know, like the hairpin thing. Like, I'm yeah. pretty sure you're still not supposed to touch that. I'm assuming- well, yeah, because, like, I'm assuming that, like, we're still gonna have to avoid doing things that'll be bad for our mental health, but, like... <laughs> yeah, because the hallucination, like, the... the marker thing is gone. Anyways, glancing at each other's faces and seeing looks of anxiety mixed with trust. Big sis Sarah! Hmm? What is it again? I hit it because the suspicious loner was there, but I might have found a way out. Woof. Huh? I don't want to trouble you guys anymore, meow, so I'll do my best. Woof. Again? I feel so uneasy. Is everything going to be okay? No, it's not. A ring up box has appeared in the back of my room. It's quiet. I don't like this. <laughs> huh? My hands are shaking. This. Back there, I tried to cheer everyone up so I wouldn't be uneasy. I told myself I couldn't give in around them. But when I'm alone, I'm so cowardly. No. No, I can't get timid. What the? Suddenly the tablet began making a sound. Could this mean... Begun? The trading phase of the main game will now begin. Now accessing your roll card. My roll. Fateful moment. My heartbeat is loud and out of control. Subconscious I was praying. Don't do it. Anything but the one that killed Joe. That's an awful notification sound effect. 
<laughs> Commoner. I see. Huh. He's just boring. God, it gets me boring. Or I knew it, I dropped to the floor. Relief. I stayed there motionless for a few minutes. Thank. Uh oh. Oh god. Hey, Sarah. Is that KG? Um. Oh, sweet. Oh. Oh. No, I think that's. Oh. Did I do a bad thing? No, 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 no. You're fine. You're fine. Are you sure? Open up. Can yeah. you talk in there? Should I open the door? Do I invite him in? Yeah. Oh, I'll open it now. For the content. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Thanks. What exactly do you want? I'll get straight to the point, Sarah. Sarah, you're the sacrifice, right? Well. <laughs> One obvious reaction, Sarah. Thank goodness. If you really were the sacrifice, I'd have been pretty worried. I haven't confirmed anything yet. Denial is sounding like a proof positive. I'm afraid you gave yourself away. You make it obvious, but you won't confess. Sure enough, you're clever. I don't know if that's clever. But you're still a bad liar, huh? Well, I'm the key master. Not gonna trust me with my word, though, are you? Excuse me for a second. Huh? Okay, you slip by me into the phone booth. What are you doing? Presenting proof, I guess? Is he giving it to us? Page one answering token after token. Ahoy hoy. Don't tell me. That is. Can you imagine having an app on your phone that had that sound alert? I would die. <laughs> Wait, no, I'm imagining it's like. On, you know, on Grinder, if you pay for the premium version, you get like different app faces for it. It's like hide that it's Grinder. Yeah. I'm mm -hmm. imagining that's one like an alternative sound alert that you can get on Grinder. Also, yeah, the way he leans. This man. I was able to do that for free. My role changed. First trade has just been performed. A trade. Yeah, come on, Sarah. You're the only one who knows that this was happening. No, so you're a commoner, Sarah. You just trade your keymaster for my commoner. Proves it to you, right? Your friendly policeman's the key. Master. What were you thinking? Uh, that was a valuable chance for a trade. Why did you go and waste it on this? Hmm. You're mad at me? I'm not mad. See, I'm imagining her say it in the way that uh, Jamie Lee Curtis says, like, Crypt Keeper in Freaky Friday, where she's like, Oh, I look like the Crypt Keeper! <laughs> Just wanted you to trust me. You only got three hours. No time to waste suspecting each other over rolls. We're gonna make our escape. Mm, you don't think we're gonna escape, otherwise, you wouldn't have traded the card. I understand. Actually, I mean, maybe he does think he can escape, and that's why. You must have an idea. Tell it to me. Right. <laughs> he just goes and sits down. Not mad, it's very clever. It's not... Hey, Sarah, what sorts of methods could be escaped by, you think? Methods? Um, I mean, we need to destroy the death game. Oh, Ideally, yes. You're gonna end up being a doll too, aren't you? I'm not shouting. All right, I am. I'm, wait, actually, don't I have that as a? I think I have that one somewhere. Hold on. Yeah, that is soundless. I don't know if I have it on here. I mean, will you be able to hear a? Sound, like, if I play a sound file on my computer, will you hear it through the stream? Also, God, Probably my computer not. is fucking chugging right now. Let's see. I think it's one that you have to pay bits for on the sound alert. I'm shouting! I'm shouting! I'm shouting! I don't have the full one because it's a long one. Anyways, destroy the death game. I heard it on stream though. Oh, yeah. Wait, do you have stream open too? Yeah, I always do. Well, I mean, are you listening to stream? That's awful. No, I, I, no, I mean it. Okay, because I was about to say that's a. No, I, I, I use Vivaldi so I can mute my tabs. But it'll still call me as a viewer. Well, I know you can do that on, um... Oh, wait, does Firefox still count you as a viewer if you mute a tab? Mmm, I don't know about Firefox. Mm. Anyways, you cause a stir to the point where they're like, the death game is neither here nor there. Hmm. Then what? Should we make a time bomb? Yes, please. Sure enough, the thing we need is information. 
Where is this place? What sort of building is it? If we had just a floor map, at least, we'd have half a chance. A floor map? Which of us would know something like that? Wait, is there someone? Uh... So, I'm guessing? Like... Unless he's saying he ha He was saying, uh, we need to find somebody who has a floor plan. But I'm assuming that we don't want to pick any of the dead people. Hmm, probably not. I don't even think they have them, even if he did choose them. Hmm. You know, we're gonna guess it's KG. It's you, right? I don't know a thing. Please, just fess up. Okay, I'll confess who I was thinking of. Kai. I had one? Kai was connected with the baddies. Even if he didn't know the details of the death game, he might have known something about this facility. But Kai's gone now. Okay, because I was thinking, like, yeah, Kai would be the one who'd have the most information, but I was, I'm was i still a little bit paranoid about doing the, the mental illness things. But also, like, you can't exactly assume that he had a map. Like, sure, he had a correspondence. You know, like... Who knows what it, if he actually knew anything about this place. Kind of like a Junko and uh, her sister moment. Well, I think... Mm, more like a... That would be the right example of that. Like an infiltrator. I don't know if there really was an infiltrator in any yet. I guess more like a um uh Rantaro in terms of like potentially having access to more information. I don't know. Anyways, yeah, there's still info we haven't checked on that laptop. Utar got his hands on it once, but it ran out of battery. And now it's back in So's hands. So I guess I'm probably gonna guess So too. It'll be hard to get it back. And that brings us to... Hmm? You remember the place we found it? A room full of rubble? Well, I did a little detectiving there. You got a sex, Sarah? What is it? Keiji whispered in my ear. And I came to that room. What? Well, let's move. There's no time. Hold on, Keiji. I was in that room. But before we even came to the third floor, Kai was already... I'm terrified to click on anything at this point. The hallucination thing that happened has certainly... It, it's... I think we're good for the hallucination, but I'm just trying to remember if there's any more jump scares. Yeah. Also, I got back some really, really good art today that somebody was making, that uh, Haya made for me. And I sent it to you, right? You did. Yeah. You literally sent it to me like five minutes before stream. Okay, you know what? My brain is small and my <laughs> head is empty. Also, that reminds me, I need to get the... Um... He forgets who he sends his ass to. I see how it is. I see how it is. God damn it. <laughs> I think I've why Firefox is like not responding whenever I do. Like, for whatever reason, it is not handling mouse clicks well. Oh. Weird. Yeah. Want a bunch of tabs open or like. As far as I'm aware, no. Hmm. It's all over the screen. There's like some. It... <sighs> God, it's gonna turn out that I have like the most horrendous virus anyone has ever seen. Like, what would you have downloaded? I don't know, but it just feels like like it's like randomly not letting me click on certain sections of things. It's very weird. I'm assuming I just need to like restart my computer. Probably. Also, the members' choice voting is so god. They're I'm really surprised how many of my viewers are apparently very invested in resource extraction or drag queens. I kind of thought, given my audience. left a comment that was pro rowling which i'm just like bye i don't care what your defense of her she's a bad writer bad writer and a bad person what's the matter oh, i just figured i shouldn't be sitting still i thought i should be thinking about ways for us to escape too i'll tell you right away if i find anything sarah strange Hi, thank you, Nisio. Welcome in. I'm glad you enjoyed the video. Last or last run I did the study, I advertised it a lot more and was very aggressive about that. I wonder if we can use Keiji's partner ability. In fact, should be at least a little useful. Touch the icon to activate your partner's ability. I wonder if I find anything. Oh, interesting. What's going on here? 
Is something wrong? No, it's nothing. I'll be going then. Yeah, last time I did one of the studies, I like advertised it really aggressively because I, I didn't get very many respondents for that one, and a bunch of people didn't fill it out properly. So I like only had I think it was fifty something. Uh, and so this time when I I was I had a whole list of like tweets and community posts I was planning on making for it because I was like, there's no way I'm gonna get enough because I was like telling people up front like there's gonna be so many rounds to this survey. It's gonna be there's gonna be a lot, and then I got like three hundred signups basically immediately, and I was like, okay, we don't don't need to advertise this anymore. I left the sign up open because I told people that it would be open for a certain amount of time. And I was like, I really cannot handle more people. So what's that sensation? Hmm? You see something too, Sarah? Huh? You had the same eyes as me. The eyes of a shrewd detective who never overlooks the heart's unrest. And you sense something shady about now. It must be the result of spending time with her. You mean now is hiding something? I know. Unfortunately, we don't exactly have time to confirm that right now. Let's do what we have to. There's only ever one option to take. So the room of rubble is past the ruin corridor. Let's go. Also, I will say I know I can't do voices. I'm well aware. I promise. I'm only doing them in the extent that it's like necessary to distinguish different voices. Oh, oh what are you doing in here? And I was thinking, I was thinking too with with uh, Alice that you can't do your fruity voices. Oh yeah, no, I can't. Can't do I, a sick voice. Huh? Looks like we're not alone. Yeah, it's Gin. We're f Gin is the most visible person on the planet. You're fine. You don't know that. It could be his brother, Gein. Or Jin. Or, or, or Gain. Hi, Gin. That's Gin. Uh. Are any of these a jump scare ending? Um, none of them are a bad ending. That's it's not the question I was ending. asking. A jump scare ending. Well, jump scare out. You know what? We're gonna call again. I'm gonna try to call him. This is it, meow. Oh. A passage appeared. A, well, I mean, there was a passage that appeared in here before. See, I can... Oh, little feet. Not good, he's going alone. Mm. Let's tail him unnoticed. Let's tail him. Why did you know about this room? If you just happened to find it, that's fine, but if you actually knew something... Or it's a suspected kid, huh? Okay, fine, Christ. I'm guessing that means we should probably save. Probably. Rarely a bad idea. Yeah. Okie dokie, but promise me one thing. Mm -hmm. On the off chance of something dangerous waiting up ahead, you'll be able to run away even if it means going alone, won't you? Yeah, we already did that once. <laughs> that's a record. Yes, and you oh, too, Katie. True. Also, I just realized I should shift your Fugi just a little bit over so that he's like... There we go. Oh my now god, I'm like... touching the ball now. Yeah. Yeah, roger that. The passage is lit by a dim light and gently slips down. It's one hella red flag there. <laughs> what do you mean, Stitch? This all seems perfectly fine and normal. The further we advance, the steeper the slope gets. Careful not to slip. Yeah. Again, how far did you go? It's a dead end. Keiji, isn't this... There's a whole, like, a trash chute in the floor. Gin must be through here. Let's drop down. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, the kitchen. Not a fan of that music. What room is this? Huh? It seems somehow familiar. Yeah, it's the kitchen. Come on. Where we came from. I think it would connect to here. Well, now I remember coming here. If I remember right... <laughs> Right, this is when Now was going through it. This is the first floor kitchen. The place where Now was hiding out and holding Professor Mishima's head. It's pitch black. Was Now sitting in the dark like this too? All alone, talking to Mishima's head. Now is despairing, and Kai used that despair. Let's take the laptop from So. I still need to get a red flag emote at some point. Amazing how she could recover from that. I don't like that his eyes are red when I'm in detective mode. That's not I'm not a fan of that. I don't know if that's because we're in detective mode or what. We're all getting a bit stronger. What, what color would you rather his eyes be? Normal. The color they were. Def hmm. Exactly, Tiny. We love some red. Fun. Red flags are lovely. Yeah, but at the same time... No, forget it. Hold on a sec. Did no one notice the secret passage? Maybe... 
I mean, Miley would surely know about it. Now... Kai, maybe Kai. I wonder if Kai noticed the secret passage. Yeah, that's the feeling I'm getting. There's even more red flags. Look. Sometimes a red okay. flag is just beckoning you forward. Whether you knew it from the start or only noticed while searching, I don't know, but I'm thinking that's the fundamental reason the laptop ended up in the room of rubble. Kai came to the third floor and placed the laptop there. He's right, it's possible. And that's convinced me personally. KG, you're supposed to be a detective. You should maybe do more than that. Cafeteria. I don't like this even the littlest bit. <laughs> Fuck, where would he be? Uh, hey, just explore. See what you run into. Fuck around. I'm gonna out. lose my mind. Oh, wait. <laughs> Large blackboard with nothing written. Empty shredder. I'm so scared, Popo. You'll be fine. I don't know if that's entirely true. Also, Stitch, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not gaslighting, Viv. Yeah, Papa would never do that. There's no jump scare coming up. No. I'm just a little guy. <laughs> I don't deserve it. Faintly make out some erased words. Abandon yourself. Hmm? I don't like being here. Guys, I'm so scared. Where are we supposed to go? I'm just gonna turn uh, down the volume. I'm like trying to avoid looking at the screen while I'm doing things. It's in the back of the cafeteria room, isn't it? Yeah, probably. Mm, small writing under the doorknob. Input the number of kiddos who can't drink. Oh, fuck. Oh, are we about to get it's really scared? No, it's just from the beginning of the game. I just don't remember the number. Uh, the bar. Oh. oh, nope. That was not something I should have clicked on, huh? Well, it doesn't say that that one's supposed to increase anything, so it just happens. I think you're fine. Mm, I think you're wrong. You're What's up, Sarah? <laughs> oh, it's nothing. It's fine, I... See, Sarah says it's fine. Sarah's a fucking liar. Here's to be a blackboard, there's a list of names. Oh, they did this part. Okay, sorry, I thought we had to remember it. My bad. Um, let me just grab a pen. Uh, it's just the number of people two, that can drink. I know, I'm just writing down the number. I need to find something else to write on. That's not a good idea. See, it sort of feels like KG has like x ray vision. The number of. Oh, are you. You're just trying to figure out what an old note says? Yeah, I'd been, from back when I was doing Buried Stars and I was trying to write down all the notes manually. Oh. Kids who can't drink. Sometimes. Can you just have to say there Oh no. I'll say thank you for the follow, Tiny Ruler. I appreciate it. Sorry, I'm like in a state of perpetual fear. Names of all the participants in the death game. And I think about it, this could be pretty important info. Do we need to write down the names of them, do you think? Um, I get, I don't think you needed the names, but write them down anyways. Yeah, let's just. Cause I remember it was. I thought you just needed the number, but. Can't tell if it's a G. I think it's a G there. It's. I'm pretty so, sure it's just the number, but. Joe, I can't see the ones behind there. Now. Uh. Pinico. Uh, Ron Mario. Uh, there we go. Now there are people waiting for him to come back. Okay, this is just our tragedy. Or this isn't just our tragedy. Okay. Central Hall. Um, let's... I don't like this. Oh! Let's just not engage with that. Someone's on the floor under the painting. Obtained victim disc E. Oh, oh come on. Why not? Come on. Why do you hate me? Red door is tightly shut and can't be opened. I don't hate If I hated you, I wouldn't be here. Yeah, but you enjoy seeing me suffer. Also, I suppose I my model is like severely asynchronous. So, give me one sec. 
Is it because you put your hand in front of the camera? No, it was because I had to lean down to get a notebook. Oh, that's we've gone everywhere else, so... I think you have to go back and, uh... I'm pretty sure it's just the number. Locked one open. Is it always locked? No. Taking a close look at the door now, I found a dial knob on the side. Looks like it's set it to a number from 1 to 9. I have to dial lock. There are little holes on the knob. Holes. Might pop out poison needles. Then I can't get this wrong. I mean, we'll save. It's 9. You should try putting an 8. This seems mean. Are you telling me there actually are eight? And this the list is wrong. I don't know. How many names did you have? Wasn't there eight? There were nine. You need to get better <laughs> gaslighting. <laughs> now it turns with a click. The door opens. I feel like that was right. Hey, I'm going easy tonight. <laughs> Video say now we can enter the pink room. We could also enter the hidden room. Hmm. Lamp lights at the top of the desk. Okay, just wanted to see if maybe that hand would reappear. All right, pink room. Do you want to, you want to know what actually would have happened? You would have gotten a game of once. If what? Oh, if I clicked under the desk? Did no, I only click on the top? Uh, no, if you click a different number. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. I figured. A heart-shaped vent. Door is open. It's big enough for a person to fit into. Hmm. Pitch black, though. Might lead somewhere else entirely. What should I do? I mean, I'm assuming we kind of have to. Even knowing the dangers, let's go. My arm is hurting. Nervous. Astra, I'm not I promise I can I can see through some of the gaslighting. <laughs> oh my god, it's a 999 reference, so true. Wait. You know what? Wait, do I have that music saved here? I can't remember if I was using that for anything. Hold on. Uh I wonder. It'd be very loud. Let me just. What'd I do? I have the 999 music. Make it less scary. Never seen this room before. Watch your step. This time I got it wrong. Fair enough, Aster. Everything's on the desk. It's too dark to see anything. There's something here. It's almost like a person. Person? Just as Keiji reached out his hand. Oh, the lights. Hit the lights. Let the music move you. Smiley. KG, get away. Oh my god. No. Smiley said I was drunk. Oh my god, it's fucking uh, Jojo Siwa on her Miley Cyrus arc. Oh my god. What does he mean? I'll sort of pause this now. It's just a powerless doll, not moving an inch. You mean she's not the real one? Wait a sec. She called herself the Laughing Doll, Sue Miley, but she must be human. Why'd you figure that? Think back on what's happened so far. Dolls don't bleed. The Doll Ranger proved this fact with his own body. And... When Miley was struck by Kai, she was bleeding. And that's why I figured Miley was probably human. Great memory, Sarah, you're exactly right. And this doll is probably the first- or probably the Miley we first met. First. After the eleven of us came together. Our first mission was to search, or search for the scattered parts of Miley's body, wasn't it? Come to think of it, we searched for the parts and then assembled her. And then after a white gas filled the room, Miley suddenly started to move. White gas? That's right, the room that filled with gas is connected to this room by the ventilation. Oh, I turn the volume back up now. That's when the human Miley swapped herself in. So that's what happened. Yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the doll did not bring itself to life. Come on, Sarah. All's going to line up, isn't it? Now this room still hides some interesting truths. So let's keep searching. I wonder if Miley is still on this floor somewhere. Okay, never mind, I don't like the silence. I'm turning back on the 999. Well, on computer screen. Also, I'll, be, I'll be right back with it, by the way. Oh no, you're, something scary is about to happen. I know it, that's no, why you're have, leaving me. I have to go use the wash. Do you want me to piss right here? No, go we'll piss, girl. I'm okay, video playing. I just... I hadn't seen your muted thing before. Devin, that's so cute. Okay, help me please! It's... Oh. I didn't know, I didn't know anything. You're listening there, aren't you? Help me! 
going on over there? Can you hear us? Hey, say something back. I won't tell anyone, I promise. Is this a video recording? Uh-oh, spaghetti -o. Why is this all necessary? I thought it was decided she... She... I got no qualms, I just want to live in peace. <sighs> Don't tell me. Were we all gathered for her sake? Sarah Chinoin. What? <laughs> Damn you, I'll kill you! All you organization members and Sarah Chinoin. I'll curse your name from hell. Don't look, Sarah. I don't really think you get an elongated scream after you get your head cut off like that. I think that's usually like, and then it's over. Footage of the person who died in the first trial. Hi, Lunex. Thank you for stopping by. I hope your card tournament goes good. I have no idea what's going on. I was a mask because he's currently muted in Devon. He has his AirPods in. He went to the bathroom. I have no idea what's going on in this video. But he said your name. I don't know why. Sarah, you might just have an intimate connection to this death game. No way! But I really... No use. The more I say, the more suspicious I look. Just what am I? Please believe me, KG. How amusing. Um... Are you gonna be our goddess of victory or our angel of death? Doesn't sound too bad to bet my life on that. Your life? Hmm? That's been my plan for a while now. Can I trust my life to you, Sarah? Uh-oh. I mean, that's a heavy burden. Too bad. What if... What if I am an angel of death? Let's see now. Would you die along with me? I don't intend to die. That's a good answer. Okay, let's search around a bit more. Right. Rust. I've always been a bit suspicious of him. KG never wants to talk about himself. X detective There must be a past he can't talk about. A truth he can't say. KG is incapable of being normal. KG bet on me. Can I bet on KG? I... Machine parts scattered around. I feel like those are similar materials to our collars. Or computer screen. I don't like that I can like, hear movement. I'm not really sure. Take a look through. This one has a label on it. 1F security camera footage disc. Security camera? Well, no. We might have just been getting filmed. God damn it, stitch. I mean, valid, but god damn it. Not so strange. There's too many of us for the, just the floor masters to watch over. We think about it, maybe so, but. There's someone here watching. I wonder if there's an observer in this room. Don't see many traces of there being multiple people here. You can probably view the footage on that computer. Should we watch it? I'm hating this, like, ambient audio that just has, like, the little, like, psst. Like, it sounds like someone's walking around behind me at all times and I'm fucking terrified. There's just so much to be scared of in this world. I'm waiting for Popo to come back a little bit. Like, you guys can hear that shuffling noise too, right? I don't like it. What items do we have, actually? We also have that blue disc, but for whatever reason, that's not showing up here. Shows their past action. So witness Kutaro placing their... I feel like we're not supposed to be able to know that yet. Mm -hmm. Hi, I'm back. We picked up the disc. And then I went into my items because I was stalling, waiting for you to get back to tell me I'm going to be jump scared. And uh, I we haven't watched this disc yet, but it's telling us what it's doing. So I know that there's medical shit going on in there that I'm not a fan of. Computer tower, better make sure not to kick it. Can I? I'm going computer screen, I'll put in the disc in the drawer. Computer began loading the video. This is when we all first met up. 
Sure enough, we were being observed. Hmm? This video doesn't have sound. Uh-oh. Yeah, I saw that one coming. For whatever reason, that one is not... I think it's because they've used that one a lot of times at this point. Although I will say there has been more than one occasion where I've been like at home and I'll be like walking to my bedroom or whatever, go to bed, and then I'll just, it'll pop into my mind and I'm like, okay, well, I guess we're doing something else. We're going to have to, we're going to have to distract ourselves. Sarah? I'm okay. What is it? This video is pretty long. We should probably skip to the important parts. All right. Are you prepared? Huh? You could see things you don't like. The other sides of your allies. It's true. What if some distrustful act got recorded? Keiji's still suspecting that there might be a traitor. Will you be okay? You didn't do anything suspect, did you, Keiji? Defiant, aren't you? Let's watch the rest, shall we? Keiji began to play the rest of the video. Our actors- wow. I like how this one security camera footage thing is, like, really going everywhere. Skip through, checking for anything suspect, and... It's okay, keep it going. Sure are strong, hmm? What in the central hall? Someone placed a card? It's one of the roll cards used in the first main game. Who... who just placed it? Kutaro! And now someone picked it up. So... That's some unexpected footage. Yeah, we're getting some really cool close-ups from the security camera. I think Kitaro was the one who set the roll cards in place. Oh, hold on a second, think back on earlier. We had a discussion like this before, remember? The one who set up the cards should have been So. So executed a strategy in the bar so he could use Kana. He played the sacrifice card he had. Had Kana pick it up, and traded her a commoner card. Put this in his- or put her in his debt. And then So had Joe pick up that sacrifice card. All of it was a trap laid by So, I thought. But from what we can see in this video, it's Kutaro who placed the cards first. So just saw him and adopted, or adopted it, that's all. No way! There's not much video left. I'm trying to sort my head out, I push play. Sure enough, Kutaro was shown again and again, secretly placing cards. And So picked up a few of those cards. And indeed made a trade with Kana. It was all true. Some mystery solved, others added. Keeping my ha hazy feelings in check, I let the remaining bit of video play. Oh... This... Are Joe and Kai talking about something? Such enigma or enigmatic faces. Is what were those two talking one-on-one -on -one about? Joe never told me anything like this. If only we could hear their voices. We didn't even know in the footage. She look up some time. We should leave here soon. Hold on to the disc, Sarah. Planning search for Gin. Work towards escape. My computer screen. Should we view the other victim disc? Yeah, why not? Because well, one of the things is, if you don't view them now, you'll never get to view them after you get to the main game. Okay. I'll watch Vis Victim Disc E. Are there others? We've only seen the one. The computer began loading the video. Yeah. There are more, for sure. Were they things I should have been able to find by now? Like, that I've missed? Do I need to go back? Mm, no, I think this, no, I think this is where you start seeing them. Right. Damn, this is awful. Why did this happen to me? Is there someone there? There is, right? Answer me. Am I gonna die? Ass. Seriously? Sure, my life was pretty boring. I didn't care about the future. You're certainly <laughs> telling your backstory while you're bleeding out of the gut. But now... Ain't it strange? It doesn't hurt at all. When I'm bleeding this much from my gut? Why doesn't it hurt? It doesn't feel like I'm really dying. Hey, am I still alive? Hey. Uh-oh. I don't like that. Okay, video ends here. It's as if he fell asleep at the end. He's probably a high schooler, a human, at the same age as me. Maybe he was one of the happy ones. What am I saying? I just felt a twinge or a tinge of envy, that's all. People killing each other, allies dying, being able to die without having to experience those things is happy. Oh, okay, don't think like that, Sarah. That's not a good thing to... Don't go down that route. For his sake, too, I... I truly hate the ambient noise in this section. Just the little shuffles. Okay. Behind the thick glass, I can see a figure that appears to be sleeping. Keiji, there's a person! I'm not showing any signs of movement. Did they not notice us? Can't imagine there'd be a new surviving participant at this point. If they're an enemy, we better not let them realize we're here. Well, there doesn't seem to be any way getting through the other side either. 
Leave quietly once we're done searching. Door shut fast, no handle, probably can't be opened manually. Refrigerator, it won't open. Okay, I think we've done everything in here, haven't we? Lights suddenly come on. I mean, somebody knows we're in here, obviously. Jesus. <laughs> Can you bitch? Uh, we've only seen victim video E. That's the only one that I have. And we watched the security footage. That was Kin. Do we want to call out to him? I don't. I think it other matters. Yeah, you can. You're putting us in danger too, you know. What should we do? I don't hear his voice anymore. The situation's changed. Thinking safety wise, we should probably head back for now. No, you want us to abandon again? I refuse to give up. You're right. Let's look around, Sarah. No more losing anybody. Right. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't know where else I would find one of them. Was there another one? Did we just not find it? I thought that was all you could find at this point. Is there one more? Not in here. Oh. Okay. I mean, it doesn't look like there's one in here. Hidden room or the blue room. Um. Oh, there it is. Oh. It's on the bookshelf. Obtained victim debt or disc F. Okay. Let's head back and check that one really quickly then. My bad. I thought you got everything. <laughs> How? Oh. I don't like being in the hidden room. I don't like any of these rooms, but like, the hidden room is especially bad. Okay. Glowing computer screen. There's another disc I found while exploring. View it. Uh, we already viewed F, right? So E is Yeah, that. I think it's E. Victim disc E. Computer began loading the video. Oh. No, oh. it was the other one. My bad. We'll just skip ahead. Okay, so we want to go with F. Victim disc F. Everything about it terrified. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Master said, this is my least favorite first trial, not gonna lie. Like everything about it terrifies me. You're loading up the video. No one no one's isn't full on jump scare, you know. It's just well, like it's the just whole section feels like a jump scare. Yeah. Uh -huh. Why? Why does this have to happen? How can I possibly know which one's right? I can't do it, I can't fire these things. Ow. The collar is tightening. Stop it, I can't breathe. Fire, so stop it. Mm, the video ends here. This is from the first trial too. It's just too cruel. How could you think of such a thing? I knew entirely well that our enemies were practically demons. Even so, being shown this, can we escape? Can demons make us do things like this? We'll escape them all right. Her dying regrets, I'll... Okay. Pink room. Back at the cafeteria. Cafeteria. Something on the table. A key. It wasn't here before, was it? <sighs> Taking the key. Okay, oh, someone's coming from the central hall. Oh. Uh. What do we do? What do we do? Maybe just hide for now. Right. So likes the kitchen and hide. Okie dokie. Close, keep quiet. I don't know who you are, but don't notice us. Let's stop near the door. I see two. Okay, this feels like not a jump scare thing. Dang, I think I'm jinxing it. <laughs> that not a now. jump scare. One of them is Miley. I can hear them talking quietly. Did you let them escape? I apologize. The key that was here is gone? Seriously, give it up. This skin's safe. Who could the other person be? Listen, don't let Gash out of his way. He's trying to destroy the death game. What? I'm just kidding. God damn it, Stitch. Just, you just, fair enough. I understand. The monitor room should have a surveillance mode, correct? Connect the blue wire and keep a careful eye on Gashu. Why do you know about... And one more thing. You must retrieve the chip in Ranger's head. The chip can destroy this place's security. It's a menace. 
Right, it's dirty. Please be quiet. What if someone heard you? And then things would get quite fun, I suppose. Oh, and... Are our tablets going off? The tablet, this is not the time. Who's there? Yep. We have to run. Don't you just love that she called the tablet sound being atrocious? That was a close call. The Guinness still didn't look like those who had captured him, at least. Think about what we can do. What can we do? Check our rolls. Apparently should we check our rolls. Annoying noise earlier signal of trade. Right, someone's cards must have gotten traded. Do everyone's signal when that happens, or...? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's everybody. Second trade was performed four minutes ago. Still the key master, and I'm still a commoner. Between people other than us. Glad to add any extra complications. Okay, now about that conversation we overheard. Those two mentioned some very interesting things. Yeah, something about a chip in Ranger's head. Plus the surveillance mode in the monitor room. I don't know what kind of functionality it has, but if we could watch the security cameras on all the floors. Sounds loads better than sneaking back onto the first floor and getting caught. Let's go! Uh, we did the key. Room of Lies. Head of your ranger. It'd be bad if the chip got damaged. How should we extract it? I'd like to take the head for inspection, but if we get caught, we tip them off for sure. I'm ready for again. Let's go to the monitor room and check the surveillance system first. Oh. Okay. Okay, well that answered that. Now spacing out, didn't seem to notice at all. What's wrong now? So we don't have time. Ugh. I should be using that more, I keep forgetting to. Okay. Uh, monitor room. Now loading? That's concerning. Nothing in here. Search under the machine. We know by the ground various wires are connected to the computer. It was the blue wire, right? Let's try connecting it. Connect the blue wire to the computer. Bingo. This is a surveillance system. Is get on any of these? Leave no on the top left. Something's odd about this bedroom. The loading screens are concerning me. Oh! Oh, Mishima! Huh? What's going on? That's the Mishima AI. We made it back. Now! Is this really for the best? Indeed. Well done, Miss Now. I'm glad your safety was ensured. But he'll... Professor, what should I do? Believe in me, Miss Now. For I was miraculously revived so that I could protect you. Do just as I say, yes? Right. Oh, no. Now put on a smile. I like to see you cheery, Miss Now. Yes. Fantastic. What a good student I have indeed. What's going on? This isn't good. Yeah, Now's acting strange. It looks like Mishima put her up to something. Maybe that card trade earlier was Now. It takes 50 tokens to trade. Now shouldn't have very many, I thought. What in the world? Mishima just said he'd been revived. Wasn't he just always just an AI that record destroyed right here? Yeah, Alice's body is just on the ground. We're not we're not doing anything for him. Wonder if he's really the same AI. Only now's room having a monitor in it is pretty suspect too. Maybe the floor master is plotting something. No way. Now. Bottom right shows the room of lies, Alice's body, Rio Rangers remains. Someone is standing in front of a bedroom. Itaro. Is he talking to the owner of the room? Checked all the monitors, Gin was nowhere to be found. The surveillance system is only for floor three. Should we have Ginsel on floor one? Uh oh, somebody's coming. Oh, gosh, I'll set up the security system. You're easily impressed. Thank you for the follow, Rish. Welcome in. Oh dear, just what are you two up to? Sure, nosy, we're having a moment here. Oh my, pardon me then. He's gonna be the fruity one now that we don't have Alice anymore, I think. While you're here though, tell me something. Are there AIs on all these monitors? You're precisely right. Here are assembled AIs of all candidates who cleared the first trial. Hmm. Gotcha. You can go. We've got a thing to get back to here, see? Yes, I shall leave you to it. There are only nine, and that is too few people. Now what to do? We should recover Ranger's chip. 
Okay, not going after Gin. Of course I'm worried, but Gin isn't just a child anymore. I'm sure he'll escape and return to us. And when he does, we should have an escape plan worked out to surprise him with. Maybe that's what believing is. Let's go to the Room of Lies. Honestly, it's just wild to me that anybody would, like, voluntarily just start wandering around like that. Like, if I was in this situation, I'm staying in my bedroom until someone makes me leave. Rekko's calm. Pretty normal. But Bin Gin is a, is a dog child. A yeah. dog cat. Since someone's hard, you have to spend time together. Okay, well, I guess... <sighs> uh, long stairs. Where are you two headed? I felt like telling some lies to the room of lies. Uh, you can't! Right now, it's... You're not allowed in. Come on, Saplin, can you just decide that? But, you see, we can't leave the bodies there any longer. We need to hold a memorial service. No buts about it. Let's leave it for later, Sarah. Understood. Let me in. Okay, so... Oh! I miss Sarah. You came at a good time. Go. So, don't give me that displeased look. I just wanted to talk for a bit. I don't want to. Said it outright. Boy, that hurts. Anything bad, Sarah, won't you listen? Yes, please. Kutaro and Kana. Have the three of them been working together? I mean... Oh, I don't like that they blinked out of existence there for a sec. Kana and Kutaro seem kind of happy. Can't read anything, so... It's too crafty. Thank you for your help! Man's like, yeah, no, I can definitely like read everyone's emotions except for the people who are like mentally insane. Well, the people who would be really useful to get a grip on what the fuck they're thinking. But to so even understand what so's thinking. <sighs> Probably not. I just I don't want to talk to him. <laughs> Tired of this child. I'm gonna hit him with my car. I, I, Hit him with your bumper. Hit him with your little bumper. Yeah, he's just a little guy. He's gonna get hit by my little car. Will you listen? Fine. Thanks, Miss Sarah. So, on to business. Um, I want to reconcile. Reconcile? I don't understand. What do you mean by that? I don't understand. We've quarreled a bunch, haven't we? I realize, you know, we can't go on like this. I mean, our real enemy is the kidnappers, right? I mean, that's true. I want to put an end to this ridiculous death game. I want us to escape. And of course, I mean all of us. What a moving speech. I'm serious, KG. So how about we all share this laptop? It's my bad for taking it from you, but... In the end, I couldn't see what was on it because the password had been changed. So that's how it is. That explains why you suddenly feel like joining up with us who know the password. Huh? You know the password? Enough with the bargaining, there isn't time. We have the password, so is the laptop. Reconciling means we share. I really do just want to reconcile, though. Well, whatever. Okay, as a proof of rebuilt friendship, let's shake hands, Miss Sarah. Fine. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I appreciate the attempt to warn. It's not really a jump scare. It's like it's basically the Joe jump scare. Yeah, it's just less common. Here, Connie, you make good with Miss Sarah too. Anna. Are we gonna get this with each of them if we shake their hands? Come on, give me your hand. Then I grab Connor's little hand. Kana betrayed you again and again. Stop it, Kana. We're friends. Green twink. Yeah. This green twink can't be trusted. And me? Here you go. Ugh, you? Oh, well, thanks. Damn. Okay. Yo, Sarah, Kana, I've been watching you guys. Yeah, you've just been standing there kind of awkwardly while the rest of us have a conversation. But okay. I don't know what happened, but if there's no ill feelings, that's great. Yes. Uh, Rekka, will you look at it with us? At Kai's laptop. Oh, can I? Of course. Okay, then I'm turning it on. Uh-oh. Whoa, it's open. Are there any clues we can use to escape? 
Again, look, I do hate this thing with these kind of games too, where it'll be like, oh yeah, we've got to find a way to escape. I wonder if this item that was very clearly left here by the bad guys has like, might give us the way out. Like, no, bitch, this is a trap. Hi, Aiko. Thank you. I'm glad you like the Overwatch videos. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good day. Yeah, so has got a vibe to him. Not a good one. Are there any clues we can use to escape in here? Trash can for discarded data. I mean, yeah, that's what I... Okay. File named Sarah's Taste. Ooh. I think it's File himself. And Sarah's favorite thing is Sweets Edition. Strawberry jam, jam in general, mashed sweet potatoes with chestnuts, coffee and toast. It's right on the money. Nothing but pace, huh? Next week things. I'm happy I understand just one bit more. It goes on and on like this. So, uh, Kai was Sarah's stalker? I think about it, there's always something paste like at the dinner table. Oh. Pal named Backdoor Smut. Excuse me, read it. <laughs> hey, quit with that! I'm oh. not exactly excited myself, but... Well, it's not an image file, right? Huh? Nervously open the file. Inside, there were long strings of texts and symbols I couldn't make any sense of. I <laughs> can't believe Kai was into this. What's my call? It's some kind of programming thingy? We can't decipher this. A file named to Miss Sarah. <laughs> I was just turned on by code. Oh, god damn it. Well, this part <laughs> All right. Hello, Miss Sarah. I am Kai. I'm truly sorry you had to get involved in such an incident as this. Written during the death game? Miss Sarah, if you were reading this, there's something I want to tell you. I, Kai Sato, was an agent belonging to a certain vile organization. In addition, I was raised as an assassin. An assassin? However, I could not carry out the assassination orders I was issued in my youth. I could not kill another human being. My father was disappointed in me, and my standing in the organization was low. Then, one day, I was appointed to a certain task. It was to guard and care for you from the shadows. I say this, but it was not a task. Er, I say this, but it was not a task I held in high regard at first. Not until the plans for the Death Game were beginning to approach a reality. I myself do not know the Death Game's objective. However, while this is merely my impression, Miss Sarah, it is possible this is all revolving around you. Of course, I do also believe that you are merely a victim, Miss Sarah. Still, the organization needs you, and they will take any means necessary. The organization's name is Asunaru. It is a secret organization possessing superb technology in a multitude of fields. Oh, Jesus. Asunaru, startled me. What's the matter? That's the name of the orphanage I'm from. Okay. Wow. You don't have parents. Goddamn, we really are going just eye the Somnium files now, huh? Little down, let's keep reading. Oh my god, what if he has a twin? <laughs> or a sister? Yeah, he has a clone, but not really a clone, a better one. Weird orphanage. Yeah, there's a <laughs> lot of... This death game is not for pleasure nor revenge. The organization it is an inevitable mission. That is what my father believed. Father? The organization drove my father mad. There may come a time you must confront him. At that time, please defeat my father, Gashu. I have collected all the data I have researched in the Sar Sarah file. If I'm already dead, please make use of it. The password is your mother's name. I hope it can be of some use. I pray you will not be swallowed up by the whirlpool of deception and slaughter. Please survive, even if it must be you alone. Kai, we're all working together now. Hey, so, don't you think it's clear to Sarah's suspicion? Huh? Weren't you on about that saying Sarah, Kai, and Joe were the masterminds working together? That was a little tit for tat. I wasn't exactly calm at the time. Sorry, Miss Sarah. I'm glad we could reconcile. Be yeah. right back. Just save when you can. That's all I can say. Hee hee hee. Uh, BRB. Why do you do this to me? How bad are things about to get, guys? The puppies abandoned me. Uh, I have a laptop and smash it. Alright, you know what? Order 59. Hi, the Death Game Project is finally taking on tinges of reality. At last, your time has come to be useful to the organization. Guard Sarah Chidwin until the planned day and ensure she remains healthy. And as much as possible, keep an eye out for her close friends Joe Tazana and Ryoko Hirose. We can't add anyone else. Understood. Fulfill your duty, Kai. Even Joe and my best friend Ryoko are mentioned here. The file contains investigative reports on and photos of Joe and Ryoko. Don't tell me, was it planned for Ryoko to get involved too? File named Order 8. Kai Sato. Kai, good work guarding the Chidwin family. Seems the Chidwins have been looking for assistance as of late. Good timing. Kai, get them to employ you and slip into their midst. The organization has prepared the necessary documents. They're all kept in this file. It's a forged resume. The photo should be authentic at least, though it seems pretty old. 
I knew he had an assistant when I was a kid, but they only worked while I was at school, so I never saw them around. Was Kai really there at my house? I don't like the vibes. The vibes are bad. This music is too... I mean, all of the music makes me feel worse. It's like we've gone through everything. Folder name Sarah. Lock of the password. The password is my mother's name. Slowly typed in my mother's name. It opened. Miss Sarah, a personal or a file named Personal Thanks. Hello, this is Kai. Apologies, but this mess or message has absolutely nothing to do with the death game. Miss Sarah, I wish to express my personal gratitude as Kai Sato. I owe a great deal to the Chidwin family. Your father hired me as assistant or as an assistant to help out with his job and housework. Of course, this was also a job for the organization to keep watch of you. At first, I felt disgusted with your father, who treated me as if I was family. I was trained as an agent from a young age. I had never experienced anything such as affection. I was afraid. Afraid I might be changing. But over time, I came to want to protect your family. I wished to see you grow to maturity with my own eyes. For the first time, I had a reason to live. I'm truly glad I could meet the Chitterans. Thank you very much, Miss Sarah. Hi. Aww. Bubba told me to save often, so we're gonna do that, I guess. File named Important Background Check File. Hello, this is Kai. I was able to use an old ID to successfully access a very small section of the organization's database. There, I discovered data pertaining to participants in the death game. Unfortunately, data on most of the participants was protected in such a way I could not extract it. But there was one man in particular for which that protection was removed. It appears his file was, at one time, deleted. For some reason or another, it was restored. Who could this be? Bitch, three guesses! He's literally wearing the same scarf. This guy's... What's the matter? Everyone's acting strange. Do they all know this person? Bitch, do you not?! Sorry, I gotta use the toilet. Guys, someone grab him, please. Begging you. Oh, fuck. Keep reading that- I try and alt-tab to, like, check through things. Uh, do not even know his name. However, there is only one reason the organization would delete a file on someone. Namely, death. I mean, we know this. Go piss, now so go piss. Namely, death. If he passed away before the death game and his file was then restored, perhaps that means he was revived. Revived? I know. I know I've seen this guy somewhere or another. Why can't I remember? You neither. Guys, it is clearly so! He's wearing the same scarf! Guys! Does anyone know this guy's name? I do! He's wearing the same scarf as so- Thank god, Kana. Somebody fucking picked it up. Could not solve the riddle concerning him. And there's one more curious aspect. There should have been 20 participants in the death game, but there were not enough files for everyone. My supposition is that. Uh-oh. There's been a trade. What the sound? Been a trade? Oh, this ain't the time for that. Someone who isn't present initiated a trade. Focus on the laptop. I'm pulling laptop more important than cards right now. I can't not look, right? On the other side of the tablets. Fine, we'll just have to check our cards first then. Let's boot up the tablet. Okay, I'm the key master. Now back to the laptop. Huh? Uh oh. Aw. Sacrifice. Third trade has just been performed. There's no mistaking it. Someone traded cards with me, and of all things, they pushed on me to sacrifice. Inconceivable. I mean, I... I'm fighting for everyone. Uh, I'm suffocating. I can't bring it, right? Let me just... Part of me feels- Oh, you are back. Hi, Popo. 
I just got back. I was literally just about to say, I think that Puppo has been back for a while and has just been watching the stream. Something bad's about to happen. No. No. What's the matter, Sarah? How's it feel to have my card? Calm down right now, the laptop. No worries. It's not like that card means you definitely die, you know? Laptop. Of course, you did kill me. Sarah. Calm down. Feel a touch on my shoulder. It's warm. But the hallucination won't go away. Yeah, that's not good. I'm assuming that that's a scripted thing, though. I don't think we could have avoided that. Yeah. Yeah, that's part of it. I need to trade cards. I have 50 tokens. Right, with my wallet in my bedroom. I need to go get it. My body moves on its own. I'm not care what anyone watching. I'm starting. Start running. Someone's stolen my wallet. Where's my wallet? Wallet isn't on the bed or next to it. Where is it? I've looked everywhere, but I can't find the wallet. Why? I know I couldn't have lost it. I don't want to die. Is there any other way? I don't have lies if I take Alice's tokens. Oh. So I can probably collect the body for the sake of my future. Now loading. Uh oh. No. Alice's body's been completely cleaned up. You're kidding! Wait, no. Now I'm going to. What do I do? Miss Sarah. Cephalon. I just finished cleaning. Of course, I also carefully transported the bodies. Here's my last chance. Hmm. To do. Is there a wrong answer here? You don't have to tell me the right one, but is there a wrong one? No. I'm assuming tricking Saffron just doesn't work. I believe that's the one. Are my tokens around here somewhere? Huh? You lose your wallet. I haven't seen it anywhere. Oh, I don't mean that. I entrusted my tokens to Alice. All of them temporarily for a certain plan. I plan to take them back, assuming survival. And we didn't hear anything about the dead's tokens being forfeit. So could you give them back? Miss Sarah, I'm... Alice didn't have any tokens. Huh? Sorry, I'm busy, so if you'll excuse me. Come on. Alice didn't have any tokens? Alice is one of the high placers for tokens. Someone else did this to trap me. <laughs> Why am I laughing? Hey there, having fun, Sarah. Yeah, I can't muster the energy to think of. Okay, well... In the end, I guess you weren't seriously thinking you could escape either, huh? Is that so? Just the hunch I got. You find hope for everyone else, because those without hope die. Is that how you thought? You're wrong. I was the one who needed hope. wrong. But that was Kaede's lie. As long as I'm looking forward, I can look away from the reality of killing you. Future you're waiting once I return, I can only imagine it as pitch black. The hell, Sarah? You won't die that bad? Maybe so. Somewhere in my heart, I... <laughs> Uh-oh. Joe, finally, I won't have to run from you anymore. This is where it gets dark. <laughs> oh, it's getting dark? <laughs> Interesting. This is where we draw the line on it starting to get dark. <laughs> oh, sorry, I have to check this yeah. out really quickly. This is the worst part about... And usually, I guess, whenever I'm streaming right after a video comes out, usually that's on a Friday, so it's like I'll just check it between Overwatch games, but like... I just want to make sure nothing is falling apart while I'm not looking. The video is actually doing better than I thought it would. It's too long. I don't know why I did something like that. That was silly. <laughs> uh... Okay. Thanks, Sarah. Stay with us, Meow. Again? Big Road Joe isn't here, Meow. Don't give any attention to anything weird. Why are you here again? Why am I here? So I can cheer Big Sis up. Obviously. Again? Aww. Please come back to your senses. Believe in the real Joe. Please, big sis Sarah. Believe in... Joe? You're not the only one who couldn't do anything now. Me and all of us. We've regretted. We've suffered. And yet big bro Joe put on a smile to the end. And everybody else who died, they were thinking of the ones who'd be left till the very end. But I'm sure what he really wants is for everyone to get home alive. That's why you have to believe in the real Joe, big sis Sarah. Oh, real Joe. I don't know. I feel like I've lost sight of him already. That guy who was always by my side. 
Do I have the courage to face him head on? Do I have a choice? This is where you save. No, you don't. <laughs> So how bad are things about to get for me? Mm, mm, Red Joe Tazuna. What? Red Joe Tazuna. Wee. See? Red Joe Tazuna. Sarah, you aren't Joe. I mean, it's going to get worse than that. When you push aside the evil clutches reaching for me. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, no. This... Yeah, you have to push those. Oh, God, no. I tabbed out. Fuck. I accidentally clicked a different screen. I was reaching for it, but it, I think I might have accidentally moved your Fugi around. No, I look like I'm still on the screen. I don't know, that's just the scene that is currently being activated, or the element. Oh yeah, it didn't move. Oh no, did it move? I don't think it did actually, but I can't look too closely right now. I don't like I would... it. Come on, you don't want to be robbed in my man hands. Uh... You're already broken. It's impossible to get rid of me for good. See you later. Bye, Joe. Love Thanks. you. Okay. Oh, fuck! He just, just said thank you. I need to stop pressing Alt-Tab. Let me just see. Okay, I, I don't know what, Okay, I didn't move anything around too much. Nothing is, like, on the wrong layer, it looks like, either. Okay. So I, like, flung my mouse to the bottom of the screen to try and catch the one hand, and I fully missed it. <laughs> Because it's like windowed right now and I have it sitting over top of where it is like on the actual screen or like on the, the preview thing that you see in Streamlabs. Mm -hmm. So I was just like, I started clicking on the actual game for it. God. Did you just like bump your mic? It scared me. Yeah, I thought I heard a noise. Oh. God, maybe I am hallucinating. Thank you. Sarah, is that you? <laughs> I had forgotten something important. I'm just getting into character. Back to normal? Yeah, let's all return alive together. I'll let anyone else's lives be lost. I won't let the kidnappers have their way. Oh my god, I love that she got rid of her, like, under-eye bags. It's such a sweetheart. I'm bringing her with energy. It's more than just my life. I like everyone, I'll move forward. It makes a sound. Let's go. I mean... Oh, what's your power? It's basically the same thing. He barks! Aww. <laughs> It's, it's like I'm with you. Hi, Kill. Thank you for the jacket, Redeem. I'm surprised it took this long, honestly. How are you doing? You're, you're okay, don't worry. I just kept getting myself scared. For now, where are we headed now? Let's see. Wait. I just realized, where the fuck did we find you? Bitch, you were missing. I'll explain later. Oh, this is the Room of Lies. He has the power of sniffing. That's so funny. Mr. Melon said a lady, but an exit now. We'll make her cry for real with your chorus of Woof. Come to think of it, didn't Sovelin retrieve Real Ranger's body? She found the chip, we should probably hurry. Are we really gonna make her cry? Something on the ground. Look at this now, a video. Seems familiar. A video from the prize exchange. This is the victim video now. Oh, right, we could have bought those. Oh, okay, never mind, I'm dumb. I forgot about those. As I recall, it showed a woman in a police uniform tied up with chains. And in front of it, oh right, yeah, in front of a man looking at a death trap attack. Viv killed him. Uh oh. And Big Sis now drop this. Right here. Wolf. This is very cute. It just brings me joy. He's not detecting anything so far. Um, I don't know where we'd want to go. Medical office, I guess. Because you're looking for Saffelin. Oh. I don't know if that's something we'd want to engage with. I like that I'm making 8 million saves and I have not really walked back on any of them. <laughs> it's all weird smell. Oh. Give me some time now. Okay, so we just like can't interact with that right now? I think later. Okay. Saren again. It's just now. What are you doing now? I was looking for Saffalin. Why? Uh, no particular reason. She wasn't here, man. I thought I could see her enter the medical office. It's like blood mixed with something burnt. Woof. What? Are you two okay? Well, he's having a stroke. Smelling burnt toast. He's coming from that glass door behind this door. 
There should be that doll of him. We'll open it up with again. Mm. There's nothing okay. inside. Something's odd. Where did that doll disappear to? Thanks to Sarah. There's a path in the back. Wolf. Say hey, what? Maybe Saflin is through here. Should we go in? If you're going, I'll come too. Hmm. I mean, I think. How bad is this? Not that bad. I mean, it's a decision I'm assuming we have to make. I need to stop being such a coward. You, you he's gonna know. have to do it. <laughs> oh, there's some... Who are Ooh. you in the purple back there? And this kiddo here. Ooh. You. What in the... What you? Ooh. These are all dolls. There's even one that looks just like me. Do we want to interact with any of these? That feels like a bad idea. No, you can. Also, I love that Gin's, Gin silhouette is literally just a triangle with legs. He looks like a fucking a snow runt. It is very suspicious. Oh my god, he does. And they're right, send numerous dolls, including ones of Gin and Alice. Looking at a mural. Talk about cute. Wow. You can't say that to a boy, big sis, Sarah. Sorry, I meant to say cool. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I, was, I thought it might let me, like, specifically... Like, her rights are being respected anyways. On the left side, numerous dolls, including ones of So, Kitaro, and Professor Mishima. Even the loner gets a doll meow. Makes me peeved. Kill. No, it's evidence. You can't fuck it. So, huh? Person in the photo on the laptop. He was wearing the same scarf as So. Just what relation do they have? Big says, Sarah, what do you think of the loner? Eh. I lie. I no, I'm just kidding. You don't have to click that one. <laughs> I don't know. What so wants? What's he, what do you think? What he's thinking? I feel like there's something within him I still don't know. Meow. In the middle stand numerous cells, including ones of myself, KJ, and Kana. Looks like they'll start talking to me any second now. I don't think they're gonna start moving. Even dolls of people we never met. Probably those who are already made victims. I don't know if it, oh. I saw something further back too, Meow. Keeps going. Once we've searched here, I guess we'll go there. We've searched everything here, haven't we? I don't like this static noise. This shit fucks me up. Nose like a dog. Okay. I'm trying to... I think you have to be out of... Yeah. Oh. Oh, doll storage. There you go. The dolls are the dolls. Ranger's head is sitting on a table. It's here. Ranger's corpse. Let's look for the chip. Yes. Wait, what's this chip like even? I don't know anything about complex machinery like this. Ranger's head. Bad. What? He talked. And don't shout. Doll oh. dominant. Yeah, this is Jade So's influence. You have not eliminated me tonight. You have eliminated yourself. Because I am you. Wait, that's Jade So, isn't it? Oh fuck. I just if I hit Alt-Tab one more time. Miss Jade So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. I am thinking of the right person. Let me just... Let's leave it one stuff like... Miss Sarah. Melon Soda with the lousy taste. What's up with this? Woof. Goddamn. You regain consciousness, Ranger. Saffelin? God damn it. Why wouldn't you let me just die? Yeah, well, you just leave a bad guy like this alone. <laughs> yeah, don't tell me you want to fix him. What? I'm being fixed? There's no fixing you. Oh, okay, well. Come on. Important parts of you have been destroyed. You have about 10 minutes left. Don't play games with me, bastard. Then why would you... In order to complete you. Complete? How much do you know about yourself, Ranger? I'm Dad's masterwork, Real Ranger. That is not your real name. You are an incomplete creation. What? Gosh, you strongly imbued you with a certain emotion. 
certain emotion. It's the superiority, isn't it? Or no, it's mm -hmm. the inferior. No. Think about it. Well, because he acted superior, but I think that was a reflection of his inferiority, isn't it? Mm-hmm. So it's an inferiority complex. Mm-hmm. You don't sound very convinced. He was, like, okay, he was jealous of the humans. Mm-hmm. So I guess, I thought jealousy would be the one, but, like... Mm-hmm. Oh, boy, sorry, God. <laughs> Am I right with inferiority? There's no right or wrong answer, just choose it. God damn it. Inferiority? Yes, which gave birth to jealousy and hatred. It could be said that it made you more human. And he discarded what you originally possessed. Discarded? Kindness, compassion, happiness. Nearly all of your positive emotions. Posteriority. Yeah, I wanted to just posterior. <laughs> yeah. That's why I didn't have anything resembling posterior. Even with the mechanisms <laughs> to create expressions, you can't create a heartfelt smile. Because he's got no heart. It was originally my job to insert it. Girls, you just forget. Bashu handled the negative emotions and myself the positive. That seems like such a weird division of labor. I don't really know why you would do that. As you saw me claim that imperfection was more human, he arranged you into or rearranged you into a warped doll. No way. Now, I will return you your heart. I will perfect you to your true form. Stop it. That seems a little cruel to give him a heart ten minutes before he dies. I'm working on a machine. Stop it, Safwin. Stop it, please. I don't need a heart. Not now. I just need to die. Did you? They're flowing in. All these unwanted emotions. No, this isn't... Forgive me, just... You must know the extent of what we took from you. I don't want to know that. Now you will be perfected. From the heartless doll, real ranger to the human with the heart. Real laser. Realize it? Such a stupid pun. Yeah. Oh my god. It's a stupid pun. <laughs> mm -hmm. well, uh, okay. Rip Ranger, I guess. You mean laser? Mm. <laughs> if Konami Date is still Date, it's still Ranger as far as I'm concerned. What have I done? <laughs> it's ended. You're cruel. Yes, I suppose so. This is just my obligation. That one began rustling around in Laser's head. This is the chip. Huh? I obtained the chip. You came looking for it, didn't you? Okay, so clearly it's not that important if you're giving it to me. If used well, this can nullify security. But to do that, you must find a secret room only Gashu knows about. That is all I can say. Now go. Laser's head sitting on the table. I... Oh my god, Taka, welcome in. Hi Taka, how are you? It's Taka with the nice tibbies. Yeah, Taka with the nice tibbies, exactly. You're not detecting anything new here, are you? No? Okay. That's right, there was a trade, huh? Check my tablet with my, or behind my back so again now wouldn't notice. Your turn to die? Yeah! We're, I'm struggling so hard. Still the sacrifice, I guess that figures. Should look for that secret room soon, yeah? You know? Right, we need to find that. Um, I might have an idea about it. Do you really? Why would you- why you now? A uh, certain someone told me about it. Mishima. I struggle too? Oh my god. Relatable content. Yeah, I hope you're doing good, Taka. I'll tell you who, but please believe me, Sarah. Okay, let's go. Yeah. First to the lobby. And she's going to hit us with a brick. Just, I can't get over that barking sound. It's so cute. Oof. Also, the fact that he gets like. Cat His eyes. ears perk up. And, yes. Ears perk up. He's literally, a, he's literally a puppy cat. Literally. Yeah, like even the shape of his eyes like goes diamond. Like, uh It's sniffing. so good. Final sniffing. Sarah? Good, you're looking better already. Angie. We're in a little bit of a hurry, so. Okie dokie, see you later then. Gashu is watching us, leave without drawing suspicion. Towards the ruined corridor. So 
Sounds like a fancy house, yeah. It's definitely much as you'd like. I've had enough already. This is just so cute. Gin is such an adorable little baby. I'm worried that he's a fake Gin. I'll be very sad if he is. Uh, no one's around, right? Yeah, nobody but us. Didn't we sniff KG? Yeah, we did sniff KG. I did. I pressed on him and it didn't do anything. Oh no, do I... Hey, once we go in the room, we might only have one chance. I missed it. Oh. Because I did have him activated, and then I clicked on KG, and they were like, we're, we're in a rush, we don't have time. Would you let me check the chip first? Check it. Yes, if it's broken, this plan will be a failure. Please, Sarah. Um, Thank you for the jacket redeem kill. Uh, no, I'm not handing it over to you. Sorry, now. Something's wrong. Sorry, now. You won't trust me? I mean... Oh, that's it. I see. Can't trust you. Why not? I just feel like you aren't your usual self. Sarah, yeah, fix this now. I want to believe you too now, but now it's hiding something. Close my eyes and take a deep breath. I'll look at now again with a clear head. The way I did when I was cagey. I don't like how Mini this game is... time. Oh. Is this going to be like the last one with the hands? Uh, something similar. I think it's just the heart, though. Oh no, I don't like this. You'll be fine. Yeah, I'm gonna move her. Touch her heart. You just gotta touch her heart, that's it. So, uh, if you have epilepsy, this is not the one for you. Look away. Papa has played your turn that, that's why he's here. He's my emotional support buffalo. And I'm his king gaslighter. <laughs> now please tell me everything. What are you talking about? We're not just strangers anymore. We're allies. If you're going to trick me, I'd rather we stand together and share our worries. You saw right through me, didn't you? Yeah, Papa admits it. <laughs> I lied to you. I don't know anything about this secret room. Ally. This is now. But... I do know how we can find out. What do you mean? Uh, I'm sorry. What? Ah! Uh, I think this chip was stolen. Now! Now is stronger than she fucking looks. So... Uh, so... What are you planning now? I'd love to know what your plans are going forward. What do you mean by that? Come on, have you thought about how you'll use this chip? We know how to use it. Put it back. What a liar you are, Miss Sarah. Me, I can analyze it with this laptop. Analyze? I'm the worst now. You use Big Sis now for that? She's a good kid, unlike you two. Alright, Miss Now, hand me the chip. Miss Now? I'm sorry. Are you gonna punch him too? <laughs> now grab the laptop. Yas now. Yas! He's so so. But she is right here right now. What's going on now? Hang on, the chip in the laptop. Where are you going with those? Thanks, Sarah. Let's go after her. She went to the lobby. <laughs> now. Now slays. <laughs> Don't interfere. We're in a hurry. My apologies, but it would be dangerous if you tripped in your haste. Or perhaps we're trying to stall or something. Absolutely not. I simply spoke out of concern. Go ahead. For now is bedroom. Hmm, that's concerning. Now! Don't come in, please. Oh, do we have guests? Ah, uh, this isn't Miss Sarah and the others. The old guy's monitor. Didn't Reko destroy that? The professor's been brought back again to protect us. Guys, please stop believing that anything that is being given to you by these people is here to help you. Please be easy, everyone. I will guide you towards escape. Like how? As an artificial intelligence, I possess the security data for this facility. There's no way. Please trust me. You require a map of the facility, do you not? Map? Let's see the facility's layout. The laptop is now is brought, I can send over the data. That's why Big Sis now took the laptop. Need the chip? I don't think Laser's chip has anything to do with this. I can analyze it as well. I just thought I would do both at once. Mmm. That's suspicious, that's weird. It's 
Quite alright, miss, now. Now, connect it quickly, there's no time. Please, wait. Something's fishy. What are you saying? I won't forgive you for doubting the professor's generosity! Come, miss, now. Miss Sarah and her friends are tired. Just connect that plug. Don't do it now! There, is this fine, professor? Oh, no. Now! You are, miss, now. You truly are easy to manipulate. Professor? This laptop. This chip. They were major nuisances for the death game. But now Master Gashu can rest easy. Master Gashu? Now give us the laptop and chip. That's not Professor Mishima! Too late. Both are already connected to me. I will destroy all the data on them. You will never so much as dream of escape again. Don't run from the main game, filthy humans. Beep boop. No. Go. What? What is this? An error has occurred. An error has occurred. An error has occurred. Damn it! Why? What on earth is happening? Looks like it went well. Seems that way, Miss. Now. Now, what did you do? This is. Don't get front. Oh my God! Now you'd figured it out. Ah! Don't you dare say my name with the professor's voice and face. Don't tell me from the very beginning. Do you think my bond with the professor was that flimsy? Hey, Miss Sarah, do you remember a mysterious program on the laptop? Oh, the backdoor file. Exactly, hilarious, right? It was named backdoor.smut. Well, that was a last resort Kai prepared. A file named backdoor that was really a hacking program used to get data from the organization. What is the... Oh my god. Again, the music in this game. Oh, this... So good, isn't it? It has such a, like... A retro vibe to it, even though it's like very clearly not. <laughs> Look, I'm very glad that Kai has turned out to not be at least the creepy, awful stalker that I thought he was, because at least it means that I can find him a little bit hot without feeling weird about it. It's nice that they made now not as gullible as they made her believe. Yeah, made I'm, you believe, I mean. I'm so happy that now actually is the only one who's getting deleted. Yeah, now is girl boss on her way right through it. I. Forgive me for what I said now. Artificial intelligence vanished. Also, she put on a hell of an act. Also, so were you in on this the whole time? Was this like the beginning? Uh, taking his hand is going to get us another hallucination, isn't it? No, there's no hallucinations. There's no more hallucinations. You're a little heavy. Shut up. Let's get straight to analyzing now so you do your part. Gather everyone in the lobby. I'm counting on you. Huh? Paying no mind to me struggling to keep up, so began fiddling with the laptop. So, do you not talk to me right now? You're making me mad, Mel. Except for leading to it, I guess. This smells gloomy, Mel. I feel bad for him. I'll give you food if you go away. Don't treat me like a cat, Mel. <laughs> Sorry for tricking you, Sarah. That was a good act. I'll give you credit now. Did you figure out the whole thing? Amazing. There are parts I don't get. I'll explain. You see, when the trading phase began, we were given our roll cards. The fake appeared on this monitor. I believed it only at first. The, the professor had been revived, but I quickly came to my senses. The fake ordered me to collect the laptop and Ranger's chip. And he said to do it alone without discussing it with anyone. When did you team up with So? It was a while ago, before I saw you in the medical office. At first, I immediately thought of discussing it with you, Sarah. I thought the fake might have anticipated that too. If they found out I was wary, I'm sure the fake would disappear. So I thought I had to extract as much info from it as I could. So you talk with the loner? Right, the fake wouldn't expect me to discuss it with the... With so. And continuing to act like I was a fool, we sent the fake the hacking, what's it? I think now I was capable of that. The best way to get the fake to believe me was to antagonize you in front of him, Sarah. And that was all the loner's plan, too? What? No. I guess I'm a gloomy sort myself. No, Big Sis now is the chipper type. I really don't think I am. Getting help from so of all people, however you look at it. I'm gonna believe in so. So mentioned a plan for escape, didn't he? Gather everyone in the lobby. What do you smell like? Am I sweaty? Yeah, you smell nice. Aww. Aww. I love Now. She's one of my favorite characters from this series. I feel bad for Now. Uh, gather everyone in the lot. So I guess we have to run around and find everybody? Basically. Jennifer Coolidge ad? I, I, where? There's a Jennifer Coolidge ad? For what? <laughs> for like the Minecraft movie? Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, medical office. Well, I don't know for sure. I've, I haven't seen any Jennifer Coolidge. Ah, oh, the lights are off. Someone in the darkness. Let's see. Your heart may be rather wounded. Mine is. 
Not just yours, necessarily. Everyone's is falling apart. Everyone's? Sometimes it's better to forget memories that are simply too painful. And in reality, the human brain is made to do so. All of you are too strong, so you can't erase your own memories. So you want to erase them yourself? The memories of Alice. Only the painful memories you understand. Those fun memories as brother and sister. Those will remain, and you can just forget the bad ones. I am the only one who can cure you. No. Sure enough, I can't forget Alice. I don't have too many memories with them. If I lost the bad memories, there'd hardly be anything left. So I don't want to forget even a shred. Miss Reko. Understood. Huh? Sarah? Reko. So you wouldn't use the machine? Yeah. Maybe I took the hard choice. I'm in the lobby, Sarah. Talk to me if you need me. It smells really sweet near her head. It actually is as delicious as it looks. Would you like to have a bite? That's gross. I'll pass. Get See, I like to believe that they actually have food on their head. What do you smell like? <laughs> Don't be a copycat. You smell like a Shiva again. <gasps> really? Aww. Aww. Okay. See, um, I am again. Monitor them. I'm your, I'm your emotional port sniff snorfer. Uh, prize exchange? Did I say port? I meant support. That's so mean of him to do that to Alice. So, nobody in here, I guess. Relaxation room? Where the fuck is everyone? Um, not the monitor, not relaxation, medical office. My bedroom? A little weird, but okay. Ruined corridor, I guess. You two! Finally done escaping, Sarah? Yes. No? Will you please come to the lobby? Did you really? So he's attempting something right now. Oh! Okie dokie, I'm half believing, but I'll come to the lobby once I'm done here. What are you doing? What are you doing? It smells like a lady killer, meow. A lady killer? That's interesting. Uh -huh. Oh, really? Oh. See, like, I can understand that, though, because... Alice's last memory of Reko is the memory of her, or like the one, like smashing the, isn't it the bongos? Yeah, the bongos, and basically it would be her dying. Yeah, so I can imagine, I, that makes sense to me from Alice. Yeah, like these, that's a, I'm, uh, this game's good. There's only a word like that, huh? What are you doing? Oh. Can we not interact with her directly? Also, why are you standing like that we over the can. child? Which time we have left? Room of rubble? Oh. Strange device on the ground. Tablet. Oh, Kitaro? Is he asleep? There's blood coming from his mouth. Huh? Muscle gorilla? It's okay, he's breathing. He's not conscious. Why in the world? on TV now. It's a thumb gun. Yeah, what? If it touches you, you get zapped and can't move. And also, it's got a label saying one use. We need to knock out Kitaro. No power anymore, so I think that's it. What happened here? Tablet on the ground. I'll pick this up. This Kitaro's. Oh, we're going to be able to swap our tablet for his, aren't we? Why is this on the floor? You can't leave him like this, but can you carry him? I'll call for someone. Keiji was out in the hall, right? Kitaro, what happened here? Wait, no, Kitaro's okay, right? The law before he regains consciousness, it looks like. Let's see, we'll meet up in the lobby later, Sarah. I'll give him a piggyback right if I have to, because you're on a way, or you're on to a way to escape, right? Yes, to which you got all right. It's gonna turn out that you were working with the bad guys all along or something. I'm so confident that you're a villain. You need a little bit of a burnt smell from his clothes. I mean, I guess that's fair. I mean, he was kind of electrocuted. Just a little bit. Are we missing anyone still? I think I've called everyone now. There's not that many people left, I guess. Sarah, when are we getting started here? Oh, Kitaro is heavy, alright. <laughs> They're really next to it. I, I love his little sprite. They're so cute. Oh, yeah, Kitaro actually is a giant of a man. Let's believe in so. Everyone's gathered. It's 
fresh, like just waking up. Oof, good smell, right? Wanna wear it too again? I'll think about it. I was like, big sis now. It's a good thing, isn't it? <laughs> don't sniff me, please. I'm not doing it because I want to either, meow. Don't treat me like a pervert. And you don't have to sniff her to tell her that Kana smells nice. Jeez, what's with- Aww. Aww, he's blushing. It smells like a gorilla, meow. It's because I've got a gorilla on my shoulder. <laughs> this guitar is also woken up, it's like in a deep sleep. Yeah, no, let's just leave Kitaro. Oh, okay, that too. It's fine. If it comes down to it, we can try slashing water on him. What is this, gym class? And Sarah, so we're gonna get us out of here, right? There's something up, feels not good. Also, I think we got help like homophobia. Yeah, KG just says Evelyn from. Ooh. There's a thing that I'm 100% certain doesn't exist, but would not be upset to see. That's what artists are for. God, I wish I could draw. Exactly. We're finding ourselves depending on so, but I'm sure he'll do it. Kinda so you believe in him. I hope the floor master can find out. If Gashu saw us, that'd be bad, wouldn't it? After the incident with the fake Mishima AI, there might be some or they might soon notice something's going on. Be very cautious if so. Oh yeah, wait, why did you leave so alone? So still in your bedroom? It seems you headed to the monitor room. Don't tell me the secret room's there. It may just be. I ought to check over the monitor room. Aping for real. I've got to say, I just can't believe it. It's the truth. Hi, Nafrios. I see you're getting gaslit again. This time it wasn't me. Why does that stun gun look a little sus? It has a flared base. I... I don't think this is on the stun gun. Although it does remind me, remember this is an 18 plus stream guys, if anyone is under 18, do not be here. It's a team plus by, by default. Yeah, it's by default, but, like sometimes Overwatch streams won't be, but they're marked as 18 plus for a reason. I'm sorry, I make things 18 plus. <laughs> oh, okay, that's what that is. Sorry, the Discord. I don't think we get anything new from sniffing them again, do we? Wait, I, no. I think I just the same. Saved. We did. Like, yeah. twice. Okay, well, maybe I'm nervous. <laughs> Shut up. You're always nervous, oh. baby. There's a ladder behind the monitors. Even Sarah, let's check it out. This is going to be the, the path to the main game. Climb the ladder. Push the button. Don't push the button. Change the station. This. Portrait of a man. Okay. Metal of inauguration. I can't think of who that reminds me of. Huh. Are you thinking of a VTuber or a character? Like a video game character. I can't think of who. Is this you gaslighting me or is this you just being like, I don't know? No, I'm, I'm being... I'm not gaslighting Jesus. What are you doing? Is there again? Using Ranger's chip right now to neutralize the security. Can you actually do that? Yeah, this chip's amazing stuff. But a lot of important data could probably be misused. Almost seems like Ranger was intended to inherit all that data. Is he gonna be a successor or something? Successor? In place of his son? Well, not that it really matters. The hacking is still gonna take some time. Keep an eye out below for anyone coming. I'll keep watch now. Big Cesare, you watch the loner wolf. Sure, watch so you say. I'm random titled That Incident. Sure. Quite some time has passed since then, but even now those hellish memories are scorched into the back of my mind. In the first trial, I killed a person. First trial. I would never trust others. That was what I decided. In the Russian roulette that followed, I didn't participate. It's describing the same things we had to go through. At the end of their argument, the challenger was chosen or the challenger chosen was someone most surprising. A 17-year-old schoolgirl. With overwhelming charisma, she had a talent for getting people in order. In the first victim conference, she was a central figure as well. But there, she lost her best friend. And then, the second victim conference, a boy even younger than her, and the man whose views most aligned with hers. 
Those two died. I mean, a boy even younger than her, and the man whose views most aligned with hers. Oh no. Yeah, Sarah has charisma, you just nerve and talent. So I'm guessing this is indicating Keiji and Gin, isn't it? Not necessarily. A boy even younger than her. There's no other boys who are left in this who are younger than her. This is, is this unnecessarily Sarah? I mean, certainly analogous. And is it the same people? Or is it different people? Maybe Sarah was chosen because she matches up closely enough with what happened. Who knows? Seeing her so exhausted, I felt pity. You look like So. Are you the original So? For the first time, I spoke my true feelings. By the time we were done talking, I'd acquired an admiration for her. To the point that I'd be fine with even my own death as long as she won it all. But in the third victim conference, she died. I told her to fall to actor age and bitch. She died. It was the first time I'd shed tears for a stranger. Even now I see hallucinations of her. As many women as I try to love, I'm never satisfied. Even now, to me, she is... The message ends here half-written. What in the world was this book? It was titled Floor Master's Code. Floor Masters, let's carry out the death game with pride. 1. For trials that require explanation, give one to the participants in advance. 2. Floor Masters must not directly kill participants. 3. Floor Masters cannot lie with the intent of deceiving participants. Or, if there is misconduct during the main game, it either proceeds with the transgressor's death or must be retried 24 hours later. Uh, I don't know if you can really retry a uh, main game, given that, you know, there's not really a survivor of that, but sure. Well, I mean, if it's a person that just messed with the game. 5. Treat the participants with love. Misconduct during the main game is the first I've heard. If a participant transgresses, they die as a penalty, and if a floor master dies, it's a 24-hour extension? Wait. It's a weird implication that they imply that it's a floor master. Yeah, I don't know if that's how I- yeah, that's not how I would interpret that. I would unfair rules. I was expect- I was inferring, like, participants, but... You know. Yeah, I, I didn't suppose. I didn't expect the game masters to be or the floor masters. Wait, I can accept your translation thing. It just says an operation. Monitor reflects the computer screen. So it's filling with the computer setup. I did it! I did it, I did it. It went great, Miss Sarah. I'm in the depths of their security now. You did it! Don't celebrate just yet, Miss Sarah. Things are going to get a little difficult from here. There's more. It'll be fine. Just wait there. So I stooped over further and began to work on the computer. He seems so... lively. Uh-oh. Whoa. What's the matter? A little problem. Miss Sarah, can you help me out? Huh? See the four monitors in this room. Uh-oh. Going to be red arrow screens appearing on... Okay, so this is just, again, the hands thing? Uh, similar, except this is just red screens. Let me see one. Tell me right away so I can fix it. Understood. Tell me when you're ready. And for some reason, they have a lot of interest in red in this chapter. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, I'm sure there's no reason. I'm sure it's not foreshadowing for anything. All right, so. Leave this to me. Good job. I'm a gamer. Hey, Emmy. How are you? Welcome in. Um, it worked. It worked, Sarah. You succeeded. Of course. You probably can't tell at a glance, but things are getting really outrageous. Let's save this outrageous for later. Let's go, Sarah. Uh, where? I just have to follow him, I guess. You're kind of tired. Fair enough. This way, you two. Don't leave us. Don't leave you behind. I wouldn't leave you behind. Why are you stuttering, buddy? 
Uh oh. Oh. oh my god, they're alive. What? What's this? They're showing everybody. What's the matter, everyone? You want to talk about something? You're awfully busy, it seems. Huh. Oh, interesting. Looks like the AI control system broke too. Ooh, nice. That sounds like a good day. Sure enough, the hacking was a complete success. Why are we leaving him like this? I say farewell, make it quick, I'll be in the lobby. Ugh, if it isn't me. That bag's under your eyes, you're not sleeping well. Wonder me is looking a lot healthier. Seems pretty noisy around here. You need something from me, Sarah? He seems different somehow. Sarah, won't you talk with Kana? My sister told me this the other day, but, um, no time for that. It's like a bustling fun time. Let's drink. Feel like having a party? Hmm, it's you. Alice. What's the matter? You need something. Can't let Reko see this. Yo, hey, Sarah, what's up? You're looking pretty busy there. No time to chat. Why'd you wake me up, big sis Sarah? I'll talk with you if you'll play with me, meow. No time to play. Oh. Uh, let me see. I'll, I'll, I'll play with Eugene. I'll play Fetch. Right, Eugene is just so adorable. Alright, everybody, let's head for the exit. Hold up, I want to hear the details. Explain later, there's no time now. Everybody, let's trust so. Whoever wants to escape, come to the stairs. If you want to stay, I won't stop you. Fine, I'll come with. Here are the long stairs. We need to put in 200 tokens or something, don't we? And then he's going to be like, So you all came. Is there a way to escape over here? If you don't, me, check whatever looks suspicious. This vending machine opens. Passage appeared behind the vending machine. So that 200 didn't? That's concerning. Uh -huh. You got it, Miss Sarah. As far as I can see from the map data, the exit is straight ahead from here. The only doors keeping it or er, keeping us from it are this vending machine and the last exit door, and both those use the exact same security. So then there's no reason it shouldn't open. Let's go before the floor masters interfere. You know, guys, this feels too good to be true. Also, yeah, I guess. I know I'm saving every five seconds, but you kind of have to with this chapter because there's a lot of like the random like, are you ready? Just have to grab that hope. <gasps> hope, despair. And the passage is an endless flight of stairs. Hurry, yet careful, we advance step by step. Does that indicate there were 200 steps? Stay close to me, everybody. So and Kana walk in front. Along the way, we notice doors on the sides. Lots of them spaced some distance apart. I suppose these connect to the other floors. They are probably the victory stairs that only the survivors are allowed to climb. Must be built so they can access these stairs no matter when the death game concludes. I think that makes me hope whether I want or whether or not I want to. An exit. An exit. If there really is an exit, like so says, have we been saved? This death game. Hey, big sis Sarah. What is it, Gin? Even once we go home, will you still see me now? Oh. You're gonna die. Things are gonna get bad for you, kiddo. I mean, they've kind of already... They've been bad for you, I guess. That's not really a new... Yeah, things are going to get bad for you in the same way that, like... What do you mean? We got to play around with him. You know, we got to have him. But what do you mean? I'm sure it'll make you remember. Do you want to forget it all? There's no way I could forget now. Gin. Ah. Aww. Don't cry, Aww. Gin. The things we lost, the despair put it... God, Dongro really has ruined the words hope and despair for me forever. <laughs> I just realized I had my volume turned down this whole time. A lot of them will go back to normal, but we'll get it back. Peace, our normal lives, that's real victory. Big sis Sarah. I'm sure it'd be impossible alone. Even I know my own weakness. That's why we'll reclaim it together. Yeah, you're right. Our connections can't be cut easily. They're lasting bonds. Um, everyone? When you go back to life as usual, what will you do? I hadn't been thinking about it. What do I want to do with it? Oh my god, hi Tommy. Hi, hello, how are you? Oh no, and I oh. okay, but wait. Oh, shit. <laughs> what do I want to do when I get out of here? Or the ad is running right now, I didn't realize. I want to finish that painting. I want to play video games at home, meow. Big sis Sarah should come too. First. Oh, I want to hold one hell of a concert. My band's got to be dying for me to come back. Can I come see it too? Me too, me too. Well, duh, I'll show you some amazing stuff, Gin and Kana. Oh. That's not fair, I want to see it too. Hmm? I have to think about that. Welcome back, hi Tommy. Welcome back, Tommy. Uh, yeah, this game is... Uh, your turn to die. It, it, if you like that kind of visual novel, it's that sort of... It floats around in those circles. It's not one of the big ones, but it's around. Same thing as that escape room. Yeah, is it giving the... 
uh, what's that one called? The road to, or, fuck, you know the section that oh. Stitch is talking about, right? Like, in V3, the, like, little mini game that you can play to try oh. and get out of there? Oh. Uh, like, oh, the despair road really or something? Oh, hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> but yeah, also, I know what I'm talking about. this is our caught friend, Tombi. He is... is that, uh, a death road to, of despair. Yeah, that's it. This is giving me that vibe of false hope. What do you want to do, huh? You don't have anything, Mr. Policeman. Mm. You should satisfy your desires. Since you're being set free and all, you should satisfy your desires. Maybe we'll go eat some meat. I mean, that's a desire you can meet. They've drawn out of that, I'm sure. Your desires are so dull. Sad, isn't it? Maybe you're going to have your dreams big again. Okay. Hmm? I see something. I'm still so angry that they didn't recognize that this was him in that photo. God damn it, Stinch. Huh? The exit? It's a traditional Japanese room. According to the floor map, this is the winner's room. Winner's room. Two low chairs, white sliding door. Corridor continues further. Up ahead is the exit, Miss Sarah. Let me just save first. Again, I know we're saving 8 million times, but like... Somehow, I get the feeling that this is where some stuff's about to happen. Let's go. Right. Yeah, that's... Oh. We proceeded First down the KG corner. Meter. My heartbeat growing faster and faster. Hope. Future. Normality. Leaving all of this light just ahead. Dun dun. What oh. awaited us was a solid wall of rock. It can't be. What the heck is this? This? I saw it on a rock. This is the exit? It's nothing but rocks. Almost like they're gonna landslide. Ridiculous. I mean, this means the exit is blocked. He already had indeed been neutralized, but without a door, there was no point. <laughs> no, there's no hope. No. Shit ain't what I signed up for. We can't go home? It can't be. This is all a lie. It is not a lie. Yeah, you guys. That's Gashu's lie. <laughs> like, look, I don't want to blame you guys because you're kind of in a tough situation. But on the flip side of that, how did you not? How did you really think you were going to get out of here and that no one, like. Yeah, they don't have their security so system. They can still watch you do stuff, they're still there. Also. Also, so of all people, so is one of the smarter people in this game. You know what I mean? Like, you I don't know how you didn't see this coming. An external explosion was used to make a physical lid, long before the death game began. You bastard, Gashu. Oh, frick, I'll kill you, you're gonna... That act has no meaning. What? What's going on? That thing on your neck. We are held captive as well. Until it is all over, our fates are intertwined. Oh! So that was the thing with the four masters. Even the floor masters are. Shit, what the hell are you guys? Now, everyone, it is time to stop dreaming. You must win. Only for the victor will the path open. You have only a brief time left. Spend your last moments before the main game well. We're still stuck with that fucking card. It's, over. it's, all it's over. also. It also makes sense because no one, none of the floor masters had their neck visibly exposed. They always had like a. I guess. Like a turtleneck or like a thingy. All that's left is this card. I guess so, huh? Having hope, having it broken over and over. Hi, Red Joe. Sarah. Yeah. I think it's time you face reality. There's always only one choice. Which do you choose? Gee-ho. Mm. What would you do, Viv? Which one would you choose if you were put in a situation like this? You, is that what you would choose? Yeah. Oh, that's your choice. okay, fair enough. Well, good luck. Oh. So Look, remind me not to play a death game with you. At the end me. of the day, I still need, like... I think I'm more of use alive than dead in a scenario like this, aside from getting scared by a lot of things. But I'm smart enough to figure my way out of it. Well, or at as least long as you don't kill me, I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> I love that Kutaro is just... Before I knew it, everyone had gone off to do their own thing. He's this final time granted to us meaningfully. KG's clearing rocks. Just 
just can't find it in me to give up. It might be futile, but I'm gonna struggle. KG. Yutaro still passed out. Oh, right. I forgot he was still passed out. I thought he was helping on the ground. No, I, I figured that he was probably just knocked out. Unless... I do feel a little bit bad for So, because it, do, it does feel like he... This is where one of the few moments where So, he, his facade is actually, like, this is the real So. So he's deeply focused on the laptop, continuing to fiddle with it. I don't think I'll end up replaying it. Don't give any spoilers for anything that, like, might happen on a replay, though, just in case I do decide to go back and look, but... I'll probably figure it out in conversations and stuff, but we'll see. Anyways, So... Please, save us. Words came out unconsciously. There's nothing more I can do on my own power. If anyone else can do something, it's so. I don't have enough time. I have Ranger's ship right here if I just had another hour. I don't want to spell what Alice does. Oh, okay, you know what, that, yeah, if it's the Alice stuff, you can tell me like those differences, that's fine. Because I am kind of curious about those. I don't know. Mm. A lot of it is just dialogue and like, um, slight path shit, but it's like roughly the same story at the end of the day. Like they keep the same thing. All I might do now is hack the Volt card, the Volt card data, huh? If I had tokens, I could have used it. I wonder if he's about to hack it, figure out what everyone's cards are, and then like move the sacrifice to someone else or something. It's all over, isn't it? Now. I don't even have the energy to move. If I'd known about this, I wouldn't even want to see hope. Find the words right now. Rekka was looking at now and not saying anything. This is Sarah. I went looking around, Meow. Can you find anything? There wasn't an exit or anything, but I found a smartphone on the stairs, Meow. Huh? Well, anything like that when we came up. What exactly is on it? Oh. Don't care about that girl. Aww. That's so cute. Alice is an interesting character. Now, a card trade. I have a sacrifice, right? What in the world is this trade? It's gonna give me the sage or something, isn't it? Or am I just back to a commoner? Yeah. What? What happened? Why did my sacrifice become a commoner? Is this Sarah? I think it. Yeah, Alice has a bit of a weird vibe of like he's simultaneously obviously a bit of a pessimist. Like he isn't like, like he's like yeah things suck. Why are you trying? But he's also like, I'm still gonna try. I just need to. It's like he needs to like publicly reckon with the fact that things suck before he can bother to do it. I mean, I think it all stems from the whole Reco thing too, right? Like, mm -hmm. <clears throat> it's just harder. Like for him, it's always just looking at like the class half empty because it always has been for him. Like realistically. What is it, Ken? You said a scary smile now. Sorry, it's nothing. More importantly, Ken, about the phone you found. Now, Ken. Sharp pain on my neck. The moment I felt that my senses cut out. Uh oh, who tasered us? Oh. No, please stay with us. I'm done for. Hey, there ain't there some way we can save him? There's so much bleeding, I feel nothing can be done. No, you can't. Miss Vaughn, please. So we've played the game before then. Or are we just all the way, we just skipped ahead that far? Uh, must have some kind of dream. Please. We got a turkey. Everyone, how are you feeling? I truly thank you for once again participating in the main game. I will omit detailed explanations, but I have one point of warning this time. It appears one of you lost your tablet. Due to the need for fingerprint identification, others cannot misuse it. But, as it is a disadvantage to not know your own role, a spare tablet has been placed on your table. 
Please use it if you are the person in question. That is all for my warning. Proceed with the rules, please touch the screen. We're in a second main game. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Extravagant feast. Autumn, well, allow me to explain the rules of the main game. The basic rules are that one person has to be sacrificed, or th that one person to be sacrificed will be chosen by majority vote. I'm going to register once again my frustration with the fact that they call it a majority and not a plurality vote because it has not been a majority at any point so far. The vote. Oh, okay. Look, it's dumb. If you're going to call it a majority vote, you need a majority to vote. For a game that is so specifically emphasizing majority vote, you'd think they'd prioritize that more. Yeah, he's he's done with a lot. I kind of wish I could have gone to the bottom of the killing that he was in jail for. Anyways, in the first round, the preliminary vote, half the total will be chosen as candidates. As there are eight presently alive, this would be four. I don't know if that's the right number for where we're at now. Oh, no, we, yeah, we started with 11, but then we added Alice, and then we lost four. Okay. The <clears throat> final vote will be held using these, deciding the ultimate victim. In other words, the sacrifice is decided by narrowing it down from eight to four to one. Of importance are the four roles. First is commoner. Normal role which has no powers. The second is the key master. As one would expect, they hold the key. If chosen as the victim, all will perish. The third is the sage. The power of holy divination, they know who the key master is. And the fourth is the sacrifice. This is a card of reversals which lets its owner live only if they are chosen as the victim. But meanwhile, if not chosen, they will die. So it is also an accursed card. In exchange, the sacrifice can vote twice, and if they win, they can escape together with one person of their choice. Incidentally, in the event that multiple people are tied for first, if the sacrifice is in the tie, the sacrifice wins. If the key master is in the tie, all perish. I wonder if that's a plot relevant point. If both the sacrifice and key master are tied for first, the key master takes priority and all perish. The distribution is one key master, sage, and sacrifice. All others are commoners. Best of luck, and may you avoid total destruction at all costs. What's that saying? Well, everyone, please wait for the game to be. Uh, hey, Gashu. Miley. Gashu, are you listening? You really gotta muck things up. You made a flagrant transgression, one that shakes the very core of the main game. Are you trying to appropriate the main game for your... S There's a 24-hour penalty for that, too, isn't there? Mm -hmm. Apologies for the video malfunction. The main game will now begin. Please enter, everyone. Hi, Dits. What's happened there? Hi, Dits. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good evening, too. I need some food. I love how we've chosen an assortment of seafoods to be Gashu's mustache. We got octopus crab. What's next? Lobster? Starfish? Maybe oh, yeah. some red snapper? I need to run to the bathroom really quickly, but first... Okay. Theories about who it's gonna be. Your first yen? Oh my god, I finally get some yen if I survive this. They're finally gonna pay me. <gasps> Y'all. I got pennies. Yeah, okay. I think... My theory is that my theory right now is that so when he ran away from us in that room when we found the like the card with all or the thing with his information on the laptop that no one could fucking identify as him for some reason. I'm still angry about that and I'm hoping that that gets addressed in this trial. But he ran away and then immediately I got the sacrifice card. And I'm not sure if he meant that as either. I, I feel like that was probably so doing that to me. And I think there's a good chance that somebody, because there was another trade or two that happened in there. First trade was with us. Second trade didn't involve us. Third trade was the one that happened while we were spying, and that one didn't involve me at least. Fourth trade was the one that gave us sacrifice. And then the fifth trade took it away from us, I think. Or no, fifth trade was the one that happened when I was with when we were in the doll factory. Sixth one was the one. I'm like trying to think so hard here. Sixth one is the one that the sacrifice got taken away from us. So I think there were only six trades. And my guess is that that last trade was so hacking the system to take, like, to take the sacrifice away from me. And I'm assuming he gave it to me right after he ran away. I'm not really sure oh, why. Who do you think? Who do you think has the sacrifice then? If we don't have it anymore. If we don't, because you can only trade it to yourself. You can't, like, so couldn't take the sacrifice from Sarah and give it to someone else without initiating a second trade. Why would he want it? 
because he thinks that people are going to be suspicious of him, or possibly because he doesn't want to sacrifice uh, Sarah at this point. Like, maybe he's, like, changed his mind. But also partially because maybe he is thinking that he's going to be suspicious right now to people. So they're going to want to vote him out, so he's, he's trying to... He's playing it cautious. Or maybe this has always been his plan, but I feel like probably not. I don't know. Um, Interesting. Because there are a couple of people who we know also went down the stairs, but they don't have any coins. Like, Gin couldn't have done it, and Gin would react the way he did. Someone also tasered us. Which, I don't know if that was them just kidnapping us to get us ready for the game, or what, but... Also, thank you for the hydration check, Dits. So interesting thinking of your hearing your theories. Did yeah, you? I've told you what my theories were for V3 early on, right? That I texted to Squidgy. Like, I read yeah. you out that conversation. <laughs> so you... And I, I know... I know this isn't a spoiler, but someone is gonna die. What do you mean? It always does die. one thing. I don't know. It's kind of in the title. If anyone were to be off in this chapter, who do you guess it's gonna be? Thank you for the Jackie Redeem stitch. Um, I kind of want to see who you guess. I'm trying to think about who probably is safe. Because I feel like that's the easier process of elimination. I feel like So is gonna be up. Again, because he always he's too much of a main character. Gin will probably be up too. I don't think Reko will be. I think Reko's sticking around for a little longer. Jutaro, I don't think any I feel like it's been such a, like a non-chapter for him, like at least in the last little bit, that like I think he's probably just not gonna be involved enough to like unless he suddenly gets really active, in which case I might be worried that he has a sacrifice. Oh, I just realized KG gave us the Keymaster, trusting us to stay safe. He knew we wouldn't trade it away, and he was hoping no one else would trade with us, and we didn't tell him anyone did. And maybe he tried the last minute trade back for the Keymaster to keep it, and has just accidentally died, or sentenced himself to death. That feels like that's also very likely. I'm gonna say, so KG and Gin, I think, are the three where I'm like... If none of them make it into the like final four, I'll be genuinely really surprised. Anyways, I'm gonna run to the bathroom really quick, and there's also gonna be an ad running, and we get some water. So I'll be right okay. back. Enjoy the lovely music. Oh, also, hi Lunex. Sorry that I'm running to the bathroom. Hi Lunex. Okay. Well, I don't know if you can hear me, Lunex, but thank you. I appreciate it. Cause he has an ad. I think he said he has an ad running. Oh, you can't? Okay, yeah, I don't, I don't know. He said an ad was running, so I'm like, I don't know who can hear. I, I have... I am I am subscriber. If you guys, by the way, aren't following Viv, go follow him. And if you guys aren't also already subscribed to him, please give him a subscription. Ah, there we go. Ah. Here I go, trying to show. You know what will help you get no ads? Is if you subscribe. Uh, here's me trying to show him out, and then minutes I try to, we get a fucking ad. Oh well. Well, just let me know when y'all. I'll just keep talking, and eventually one of you will be back. And if someone can tell me when the ad is done, then I'll do that. Otherwise, I'll just keep going. Now it's over. Okay, good. Yeah, I was, I was literally trying to chill out. Do you know how you can avoid the ads? Do he get a subscription? <laughs> but apparently that didn't work. Anyways, how's everyone in chat doing? Lunex, Aster, anyone else? You're the most recent one, so I don't really know who else is currently currently hiding, currently doing a lurky lurk. Okay, I'm back. Hi, welcome back. Okay, I wanted to say, I think I have a theory for why I am... God damn it, are you trying to, are you trying to get people to subscribe? <laughs> Do you know what, the moment I was already started saying the subscription, like, you know how you can, I know, so, like, um, Viv is going to be playing an ad soon, and then I was like, you know how you can prevent that? And then the ad starts. I'm just That's like, so fuck. Bad. Oh my god, the timing is so comic. Um, so yeah, congrats, Linux. Congrats, Linux. Yeah, I, um, also, okay, I was talking about this on Discord. I truly, truly wish that YouTube would allow me to make that a perk of a YouTube channel membership. So I would fully have like a, a two dollar like just ad free tier for people who are like, yeah, I just want to support you, and I don't really care about the voting stuff. Because that like, I mean, obviously it would also be for the higher tier, but I feel like that would be like an, I don't know, for people who don't want to pay for like full on premium or something, it'd be kind of a nice thing to offer. Also, I feel like it would actually genuinely make YouTube more money than the ads. 
Because like in order to generate five dollars worth of revenue for YouTube from ads, you'd have to watch like eight hundred videos a month or something. So seventy thousand, bro. Yeah, no, Lunax, I'm the same way. I'm, I always want to do it. I feel bad because I have no money. But yeah, no, I, uh, I do think it is very funny that one of the things about being a streamer and having streamer friends is that it's just everyone passing around the same $5 and giving half of it to Twitch over and over again. Just subscribing to one another. <laughs> but anyways, I was going to say, um, no, yeah, Twitch, Twitch is, yeah, it's like 50-50 or whatever. I love this game. I'm excited to get to be here. I'm glad you're here. It is good to have you. I like... This is one of my favorite things about playing like smaller games too, is that I feel like it's like it's just like how artists are. Yeah, exactly. That, that's where I got that. That's the original meme is like it's artists just passing the same twenty dollars back and forth forever. Um but yeah. Aww, isn't that sweet? Popo. What? Being silly. I didn't do anything. Mm -hmm. I don't know what you're talking about. Unfortunately you have been doxxed by chat. Thank I you, Popo. Did nothing. And congrats to time. Nice. Yeah, okay. What I was going to say is that I had a revelation while I was in the bathroom. Because I was thinking about why does this game scare me as much as it does? Because it really feels like it shouldn't. And I was thinking, like, when I was playing Lethal Company, yeah, I got, like, startled myself. But I've watched, like, a bunch of content warning stuff, which also, uh, Mitty got me content warning, so I'm going to end up playing that. I'm very happy about it. But I, um, I watched some streams of it, and I was like, this doesn't scare me really at all. Like, obviously, it'd be more scary as playing it, but, like... And I was thinking about it, and it was like, as I was walking back from the bathroom, I realized... The thing that I use to not let myself get scared, like, when I'm in my house, is like, I'm not important enough for something like that to happen to me. I'm just a regular person. That's main character shit. But in a video game, you are the main character, so the scariest shit can happen. And any defenses I've built up are gone. And I think that's why I get scared by this stuff. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to mention that theory before we continue, because I feel like it helps exonerate me just a touch from all of the... ...being scared of everything like a little baby. Also, I love that the video is... Oh, no, it's 3 out of 10 now. God damn it, it was 2 out of 10 for so long. Anyways, moving on. Let's play game. I kind of wish that if you stayed in there for too long, they would just kill you. It'd be kind of funny. No. Not a sneak peek, is that? Sure. You can DM me, Lunix, if you've got a little sneak peek. Yeah. Before me, you're strange, familiar yeah, death. Yeah. You're here. You're early, KG. What was that earlier, meow? Gashi, what's going on? Explain yourself. It kind of feels like this won't be a normal me. Bitch, a pattern isn't established till it hits three times, so you don't know what a normal main game is. For all you know, the first one was the exception, not the rule. It's starting all over again. There's gonna be no sacrifice. Maybe that's what he did when he hacked it. Just removed the sacrifice roll. Or he traded it away to Kutaro. Oh. Oh. So hacked me. He knew that I had sacrifice. He gave it to Kutaro. Because Kutaro doesn't even know. Reiko doesn't have any eyeliner. That you lost her. Oh no, does she have it back now? Uh, oh, she think... does. Oh, she does. Oh. Maybe she. Maybe she just found some more. You. What's this transgression Miley mentioned? Transgression? I'm afraid I don't know what you mean. Don't tell me about. It's about the wallet. That reaction seems indicated to not. Understand that if there truly is a transgression, it should become clear in your discussion. Supposing one is discovered, it will be addressed. Hmm. I wonder why she has the makeup back on, though. That is weird. Because she's gone this whole time without it. I mean, it could be another doll. But, I don't know. Oh, shit, wait, the sound like Oh my god. Aww, Thank you for the Prime, or uh, Twitch Prime, Esther. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh, so shit, that kicks off a. God, Hype Train really does start off with basically yeah. nothing. Yeah, you can literally, they used to not be able to from like raids anymore, but now they do. So like raids, even just like a singular gift sub, like within a gift sub, uh, like another sub. I don't know, it's just really fast. I think it's two events happening close enough together that like initiates it maybe. Anyways, thank you, Ask. I do really appreciate it. Look, Twitch is like the most, there needs to be like a little video when you log on to Twitch for like the first couple months that you have it. Where, you, like, it'll just be like, hey, by the way, if you need, like, some tutorials on, like, the basics of how this website works, we'll help you. Because this, nothing about this website makes any sense. But yeah, thank you very much. I really do appreciate it. I don't know if it counts as a hype train if emotes will offer up here. Also, I like, I like that Twitch still says uh, emote rewards are offered for milestones all the way up to level 100. But that's not true. 
Because now they have a new one if you get past 100. Or they gave a special one to anyone who was in uh, Pirate Software's one. Or... Because he got to like 106 or something, which is also insane amount of money. Anyways, insane. All I have is before the first main game. Oh, wait, is there, wait, is there a manga for this? I don't know, I mean the... Oh, that is very cool, Lunex. Oh, I didn't know there was a manga. Did I ask it? I didn't, wait, is there actually? Oh, shit. Yeah, I didn't know that either. Hold um, on, that's news to me. I'm trying to die. Oh, shit, there is. You can get it on Amazon. Oh. Damn, I want to know which route they took. Oh, I guess the first route, uh, it's technically never changes. Oh. I'm I wondering. think it is just the events of the game, it looks like. Huh. <laughs> Although, I am not a fan of these illustrations. What the fuck have they done? What have they done to KG? Hold on, let me just... Let me just what save this. Let, I need to they, put this on chat. Oh, that's, that's they, the horn They butchered my man. The things they've done to my husband, they will not be forgotten, and they will not be forgiven. Because, bitch, what the fuck? Oh... Maybe some they other just, characters look good, but fuck ass KG. Why does, it, why does it so looks younger in one of the pictures I'm looking at? KG looks like the most like you would see this art on like the page of a bar artist who's like 95% of the way to being amazing, but he's gonna just have some fuck ass drawings. Like, what is this? Like he, I, his face is a little bit strange. I need yeah. answers. I need explanations. You like, know I don't know what they did to KJ. <laughs> also, they have Ken dolled the shit out of this poor man. He has, like, a negative bulge. It is a reverse bulge. It is going inward. His proportions are so weird, too. Like, his tits look a little bit more... Flat. I don't know, they just look strange. Yeah, they're flat on, flat on the top, but rounded at the bottom. Like, it's enough to get, like, some peck, but then it's like... I still can't get over the fact they've fully just castrated this man. They have yeah. given him the flattest groin. Although it does look like he's wearing a thong. Like and I know pants. his eyes I know his eyes are already a little beady, but like come on. Also his hair is Don't yellow. Give this man some purple shampoo. Be an ally. Also yeah, his abs are showing through like also like the muscles I don't know what all these muscles are, but like he's wearing a shirt and a vest. But also like he's not It's not it's clearly not a tight fitting shirt or tight fitting or the pants are kinda of tight fitting, but the shirt is like loose on it. His hair is like a, his hair is yellow in the game, but to be fair, in the game, that's like it's fitting with the stylization of it. Like So's hair is green in the game, but it doesn't like. Oh God, Joe too. What the is, fuck? KG's oh. hair is giving the piss blonde hair that Shakule wore on the on the Lady Gaga runway. Shakule, what did the edges she snatched today? But literally, like they literally called her out for being piss blonde, and that's literally what it reminds me of. This is such a... Let me just... Joe, this looks like one of those... Like, you know when people draw, like, hyper detail... Or, like, try and do, like, a... Uh, what is it? The, um... The fucking Stardew Valley characters in a different art style? This looks like someone's attempt to do the jock character in that. But, like, with a twist. Oh, um, Alex, right? Yeah. I just look like... Oh, fuck, no, you're... Stitch, you're correct about that. He does look like this is Jinpei during like a rebellious oh. teenage phase. Oh, I'm unhappy. I don't. Mm, I, I'm. I. Mm, I don't this like manga. Is, what's wild is that they felt the need to change away from the style the game currently has. Is if the game doesn't have a style that would be pretty easy, to just one to one move over to manga. Like, oh, or at least for the cover art. How many other issues of this are there? Hold on. There's another one with So on the cover. The one with So they made looks so mostly look... fine. He looks fine, but they, they made him younger. Because if the cover of, of So is fine, but I looked at another one with the manga, and they they made him look so much younger. Like, hold on, I'm gonna send you this picture. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh no. It's nothing bad. It's just. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where is it? Where's Viv? Where is Viv? Where are my DMs? Bitch, I'm like. And the person have you been talking to so many other I people know. no i mean it wouldn't open Damn, talking to all the other boys i get it no you're actually you're Listen. actually first on my list bitch you're first on my list you he know does this. look a lot younger there yeah he looks 
Because in the game, I feel like he looks like he's like ambiguously around 20. This one makes him look like he's like 14. He looks like he's basically looks like he's getting inside age. Like what yeah. the fuck? Anyways, we've gotten distracted enough from the game. The main game. Gosh, you Colin Miley or Colin Saffalon? Saffalon. Please call Saffalon so we can hand out a judgment on any misconduct. Very well, if that will satisfy you. I mean, we should have called in Miley, I guess, because Miley was the one who was mad. Please be our impartial judge. What are you laughing at, asshole? I'm joyful. Such determination to have a fair slaughter without having to worry over misconduct. You goddamn. Now, let the second main game... Hang on! Oh, you're... Are you doing alright, Kitaro? Very good, everyone's assembled. So it's starting after all. Indeed, we have talked long enough. Now we shall begin the second main game. Uh, Saffalon hasn't said what she was supposed to say, but sure. Party, I guess. New background. Look what they did to Reiko, what the fuck? Oh no, did they do- it was... Eh, Reiko doesn't look I... that bad. But what? It's-, it's... Mm, I feel like she looks- off. I mean, it's a little bit off, but at least it feels like it's like within the correct family of style. Anyways, extremely heavy air dominates the space. It's starting again, this horrifying game. Keeping quiet's only making time pass, guys. Let's at least decide our fate by our own hand, okay? It's okay, we've walked this road before, haven't we? Then and now, it's totally different! Yeah, there's no way that you were not given the sacrifice card. We're allies by now, we spent more time together! Will you die? Let's find our resolve. You said that in the first main game, right, Kitaro? Okay, Akane would hit that kind of- I don't- mm, Akane has bad judgment, she might. Damn it. Everyone, the card designs have been displayed in the rulebook this time, so be aware that you cannot judge using knowledge of the designs as in the first main game. The designs of the cards? Gashu quietly sat down in a chair, and once again the main game began. The designs of the cards have changed. Signs. Interesting. The, the cards don't mean what we think they mean then, huh? Interesting. So figured that out, didn't he? He figured out what each- because all we've seen so far is one Keymaster, one Commoner, one Sacrifice. Sacrifice. There's no we reason to- sage. We haven't seen the Sage, but we also- just because it's written on the card doesn't mean that that might actually be the role we have. They might just be fake-out panels, which would be kind of bullshit because then it's like- then none of it meant anything. But that does seem like something that this game might do. Anyways, let's talk to you. First, let's discuss to get four candidates. Who should survive and who can die? I mean, I guess we have to. Okie dokie, seems you're ready. Hold up, KG. Unlike last time, there's been a bunch of card trades. We logic it out, I'm sure we can figure out who has the sacrifice and keymaster without going around suspecting each other. If everyone speaks honestly. Would they lie? At the very least, the sacrifice can't tell the truth, now can they? So it's fine to start with finding our four candidates. Mm -hmm. Because those who aren't candidates can be honest. Yep, and also, if we can prove what everyone else's cards are right now, voting is going to be hell. It'll be pure blame throwing. That guy should die. This guy should die. It'll be cruel and leave no trace of any bonds we've got. Fine, I get it. I'm on board, KG. So I'm gonna say it. So you are the most suspicious in my book, huh? Wait, Reckler out. out. <laughs> Call him yeah. out. <laughs> Wait, Reckler so contributed so much to our escape. I know that, but then who do I vote for? Uh. I can't possibly choose anybody else. If I'm gonna vote, it's gonna be for So. That's how I really feel. So, get a grip, be honest, and clear our doubts. Seems I just don't click with people who speak from emotion. Shut up. I'm telling you. Say what you really... Then I'm fine with being the first candidate. Ma? Huh? After all, I... What? And the sacrifice. Uh... Were you even listening to us? I'm taking the time to say your role. Was there a rule against confessing your own? So I see. You know. For sure, thank you for stopping by again, Lunex. I really do appreciate it. Have a good night. Hi, Lunex. And congrats again and on thank you for sure. Yeah, and also thanks for sh for sharing the little sneak peek. I'm yeah. excited. It's very cool. 
Sorry, KG. I just didn't feel comfy letting you take the initiative. I know. I'll nominate the next suspicious person. How about that? Got some no-good idea again. I kind of want to agree just to see what he's going to do. Do it. We'll advance the discussion. Go ahead. You're so calm, Miss Sarah. I nominate Kana. Uh, that's not what he's saying. For sure, thank you. Can't wait to see it. Everyone should, everyone should already understand this. She's easily tricked, timid, and lacks ability. What does she even have besides sympathy? Wow. Shut the hell up. Ain't it you, user? I'm using her so cruelly. Is so trying to betray her? So you're giving time, or Kana time to vindicate herself. No? Huh? Sure thing. Let's have a discussion about Kana's actions during the death game, so that we can trust her. Kana, first she just holed up in So's room. They've generally acted together, so it would be the one who can prove her worth, damn it. Kana was dead weight the whole time, what a hindrance. Hindrance? Kana looks like she's pretty shocked to hear that. I couldn't blame her. I'm sure you understand, Sarah, you can extract statements from them. And also, you've got a new weapon, too. Huh? You know, from when we were searching together, your shrewd detective vision. When someone makes a statement, you might notice someone else having a reaction. You do that. Now let's get to it, partner. She has the detective vision. She has the question mark, which makes me think that Kana isn't a hindrance. Kana. Oh. Kana was deadweight the whole time. What a hindrance. Oh. What? Her right. expression changed. Well, yeah, I saw that. I'm getting fed up with having a useless helper, too. Because now, I felt like So's first statement caused someone else's expression to change. While their expression changed, I should check on them. Oh, that's how that works. Okay, I see. I thought it was like, you can just tell that you should maybe engage with this person. Okay. Kana, are you too shocked to speak? It seems like she's trying to say something. In that case, it's such to inspire Kana's heart. Oh, we have to do that. Heart time. Oh, that's... You don't know what this means. This might have been cool as a rhythm game. Yeah, I... Maybe want to keep used to Danganronpa. Kana, are you fine with him just saying that? That's... It's fine, you can get mad. Let's let what's in your heart come right out. Kana, Kana, she isn't a hindrance at all. I was saying mean things just because he can do hacking, but wasn't Kana the one who did hacking first? Yeah? Uh, hold your horses. How do you mean that? Um, Kana oh. did hacking? You never make yourself clear. Please tell us about this in a little more detail. Okay. Progress. Kana did some hacking way before so did any of his hacking. Uh, what kind of hacking was it? I figured out a password. Breaking into someone else's things, that's called hacking, right? You mean Kana has a debt with computers too? You can't call something like that hacking. Don't misuse words you only just learned. Alright, Sarah, let's advance the discussion like this. That's extract statements to expand the discussion, present items as evidence, or have statements so you could have to find yourself. Okay. Your eyes just like twink. Oh, I think that was just the sparkle from when I clicked on her. And Kana's adept with computers too. What do we have? I don't know if any of these are really. So we've been fretting about it since yesterday. He was going, I don't know the password, taking his beanie off and putting it on. Suddenly I looked at So's hands and was struck by how clean he kept them even in these circumstances. And then I had an epiphany. That there might be traces from the password being typed. So I figured out the password from finger marks left on the keys. Back to a new statement. Oh. We could just give her the stun gun, see if she knows... No, just just give her a stun gun for fun. Why not? It's... You saying it like that makes me think I'm wrong. <laughs> you can give her a stun gun. I, I, 
I like giving cute girls very dangerous weapons. I've learned that yesterday from Kizzy. <laughs> Sometimes it's the solution. I'm pretty sure they don't. What password could it have been? I heard that I can only think of the password to start at the laptop. Hmm. There's no reason to not extract from everyone, right? We don't have much time for discussion. How about you explain everything yourself, so? I am explaining. Explain what a useless girl Kana is. I'm talking about be like tools, goddammit. See, these ones aren't in conflict. They work together. Mm hmm But I feel like the versus thing is the only thing. Like, we gotta draw those two statements together, right? Interesting choice, right? Mm -hmm. I... Intriguing. Kana, <laughs> you're right. Could it be that you didn't use the laptop to hack? Or rather, you solved the password for the laptop itself? Yes. I see. Before the laptop was handed to So, it, I was the last one to enter the password. And my fingers left marks, little bits of dirt from when I pressed the keys. How dirty are your hands? When did you solve the password? It was before the trading phase began. Hold on a sec. Don't you think that sounds funny, Sarah? Is it? Is it? I wonder what's so tee ha ha about it. Because if they were able to get into it sooner, they would have been able, or they would have done it, right? Because I had to enter, no, the password had changed. It does sound suspicious. Right? Because they needed me to open it. They needed me to, Don't it was my. Hard about this one. What? Don't think too hard, okay? Oh, am I? It does it. Uh, just, it doesn't sound suspicious. It doesn't matter. Just choose something. Oh, God damn it! Yeah, girl, wash your hands. Does it? And so shared the laptop with us so we could learn the password, didn't we? According to you, you peeked inside before sharing the laptop with everyone. Yeah. Then there was no reason to join forces. That's wrong. So what an opportunity to reconcile with everyone. Kana, I'm sorry to say there was another reason. Huh? Why did so share the laptop? I wanted to be the Sarah folder. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Sarah folder had a separate password, which is the name of Sarah's mother. You gotta be kidding. So you accepted my deal without saying nothing about this. Huh? <laughs> what of it? Why are you? Hold on a second, what deal is this? <laughs> don't sweat it. It's just between us. I don't think so. That was strange from the get-go, but it seems there's a deal going on behind the sharing of the laptop. I mean, yeah, obviously, the vibes were fucked. I'll tell you everything about this suspicious deal. Oh, you know everything about this now? Thanks for sharing. Oh, yes. oh, I'll have you tell us everything. Okay, that makes more sense. Because I was like, huh. When does so asking him to share the laptop? No surprise, Guitar said he would give me his tokens in exchange. The two talked to each other, separated by So's bedroom door. Anna heard it too. I mean, I had a responsibility, you know. When the token gathering subgame started, I gathered more tokens than anybody to survive. Even the laptop I managed to get my hands on, I handed it over in exchange for those tokens. I was possessed by the need for tokens back then, you hear? Is that really the only reason? Uh, obviously. You think so blackmailed me or something? There ain't nothing. Blackmail? Why? No one was saying blackmail, buddy! I'm surprised Guitar said he would give me his tokens in exchange. I didn't intend to hear him out, but Guitar was so serious, I just couldn't turn him down. It turned out to be a good trade. Don't give me that scary look. You benefited from getting to see the laptop for free, right, Miss Sarah? The two talked to each other separated by So's bedroom door. Kana heard it too. So said, that's not a bad deal. And he also said, maybe we'll reconcile, so Kana got really happy. Kana still believes in the goodness of So. Like, I feel like this is relevant 
Oh, this is the blackmail. Isn't it? Look at me go. You got it. Because I was like, I was like, this has to be something that So is holding over his head. And then I was like, wait, yeah, we did just unprompted bring up blackmail. Was there really no opportunity for blackmail? What you saying? We acquired a certain video. Footage from the first floor of security cameras. I didn't know there was such a thing. It was all clearly pictured. Yutaro placing the roll cards. And So seeing him do it. If this isn't blackmail material, what is? No way. Kutaro was the one who placed the cards? Muscle Gorilla was a traitor? No. A traitor? Is that really the case? Or was there some other circumstance? Ironically, it's because of my improved intuition that I don't understand. How could someone like Kutaro be a traitor? It's like, uh... I always think Kutaro seems unlikely to, but I do think that at this point, he's... panicking. Why do you do a thing like that? Can you get the cards, Kitaro? Please say something, Kitaro. Security cam. Wow. Wow, you're pulling it together all of a sudden. What do you mean? Huh? We should have searched every inch of the first floor. Did anybody find any security cameras? The footage is proof. Whether we discovered any or discovered any cameras isn't what's important here. You were caught on camera. That's the only proof we need. It must be a puppet show. Yeah. Puppet show. If you think about it, we've been getting tricked left and right. Yeah, which is kind of a thing that could happen, but you've become incredibly confident about this. Fake Reco, fake Mishima AI. Kidnappers can move around fakes of us whenever and however they like. You mean... Looks like you got tricked, Sarah. Script by the kidnappers, actors are fakes. You fell for a fake movie put on by dolls. I don't know what you guys saw, but it was all a trap, I tell you. Learn your lesson. But... Talk about a disadvantage. Preparing fakes to trick us with my... was a stellar move by your enemies, huh? Can't take Yutaro lightly, either. Looks like you've been talked down for once, Miss Sarah. Anyway, I told you about the deal between me and So. Okay, so something else is... Hmm. I think you are being blackmailed, but maybe just not by that. But, mm. Anyways, after we all looked at the laptop, I was passed out the whole time. There's gotta be someone more suspicious than me. <sighs> Hold on, why'd you pass out in the Room of Rubble in the first place, Kitaro? Well, I don't remember. No way. Who? Got no memory from the moment I entered that room. When I woke up, I was in the main game. No, that's a rude awakening. So surely someone else knocked him out. We should find who did it, Meow. They've gotta be a villain. <laughs> Last time I saw Kitaro healthy, wasn't it when we were looking at the, sa or the laptop? Then, after the sacrifice was passed to me, I started to panic and ran out to get tokens. Right, I didn't see Kitaro after that. If I could determine everyone's actions at the time... I right, gotta talk about what each of us was doing then. When we shared the laptop, there were six of us in the lobby. Me, So, Kana, Sarah, Keiji, and Reiko. After Sarah suddenly took off running, we stayed and looked at the laptop, but there wasn't much else. After we were done looking at it, Kana went to deliver the laptop to So. Apparently, a policeman stayed in the lobby for a while. I wasn't feeling well and ran to the bathroom. I talked with Miss Now on the way back. We talked with So about our plan to hack the fake Professor Mishima. I'm searching the pitch black first floor, meow. So I can verify their alibis. Any other questions, cute little detective? High and high spirits? After we looking at it, Kana went to deliver the laptop to So. So was talking with Now in the ruined corridor. About what? S sorry, Kana just gave So the laptop and left right away, so... She was worried about Sarah, so Kana went around- or looking around for her alone. Also, because the text box is here, does that mean it's impossible to, like, for any of the people on the bottom to have a reaction that we can click on? Mm -hmm. No, not necessarily. We shared the laptop. After the sound of the trade and you leaving, Sarah, I went back to searching too. I'm down to KG in the lobby, went to the room of rubble, and then lost consciousness. I want to say I couldn't move all of a sudden and bumped my head on the wall, but... I wasn't feeling well and ran to the bathroom talked with Miss Now on the way back. Specifically, we talked about her hacking plan. Kana came to the laptop. I thought about having Kana join the plan, but she promptly went off somewhere. That's my alibi, pretty much. Pretty amazing, I could knock out Kitaro. Stun guns are... We're gonna circle back to you, because we haven't discussed that stun gun yet. 
I did almost give it to a child, but it was already used. So. So I'm looking, we sort of split up, we're searching here and there. I don't have a whole lot of alibi or nothing, but I ain't the culprit. The talk was so better plan to hack the fake Professor Mishima. I think it's because that plan went well that our escape plan could progress. So it was really dependable then, and yet. So she's in the pitch black first floor now. I think I go back to the third floor, but there's a nuisance in the way. <laughs> Laughing doll Sue Miley, it was scary. So Gin was on the first floor until I reunited with him in the Room of Lies. And we're gonna save, but I'm pretty confident that we're gonna wanna show the stun gun to. Uh. Yeah, you're not supposed to know that. <laughs> you know the weapon you use well, so... Huh? I quietly took the sun gun from the scene. So only Gin and I knew that Kutaro was attacked with the sun gun. The only other person who could know is the culprit. I'm not saying I'll be mad. Look, cat. There's only so many clips I can give you guys. Also, Papa, aren't you impressed with me? I'm doing so good. I'm proud of you. I haven't had to do anything. I know, except for trying gaslighting me a little bit. <laughs> eh, I don't need to gaslight you here. You do it to yourself. <laughs> I kind of, I really am my own worst enemy with this. I will, this is why I like Dongarumpa, because Dongarumpa was on a level of unhinged that I was always usually on pace with, and this one is not. He messed up, but also... Mm, if he stole... Okay. It's possible that he stole all of Sarah, because someone stole all of Sarah's money, which means that somebody was making a plan from the start. And I think that so would be the most likely to do that. But uh, if so stole the money, he could have used all of the remaining chips that we had, because we had plenty, to give the sacrifice to Sarah at the beginning, be suspicious as shit, and then just take it back from her at the last minute. Although that seems a little bit... Mm, it's hard to tell what... He, he keeps turning over new leaves. Use the stun gun to knock out Kitara, damn it, so... I give... You found me out so easily. <laughs> so! Sorry, I didn't mind anyone getting in the way of the hacking plan we were preparing. When he suddenly entered the room, I went and used it without even thinking. Where'd you find a dangerous thing like that, meow? Hmm. Can't seem to recall. Meow? Something feels off. You'd really have to be at your wit's end to use a single-use stun gun. But there's something more going on between Kitaro and So. That's enough. Just knowing who the culprit was is enough. That can't... It might be pointless to push further. So he's got no intention of explaining himself. For now, we should spare time for someone else. If we're going to suspect one another or each other, we have to do it now while we have time, huh? Even if it's hard to say, we have to say it. You mean doubting so we can trust? That's right. Be brave and talk, everybody. Let's discuss if there's anyone besides So who's acted suspicious. Hmm... Sorry, let's check this really quickly. I want a second one or No sexting on stream, I'm just kidding. I'm not. Somebody just left a comment and said, this and is like when the writer says, and it was all a dream, immediate. You're a fucking, you are so dumb. <laughs> like, lying to someone in a study is not the same thing as it's all a dream. God, I can't stand people. Come to think of it, I was wondering how Nao has spent most of the first half in the room alive, no sexing stream. You can't tell me what to do. You don't know what I have or haven't done on stream. Don't worry, he's not doing anything like that because I'm here. I mean, what? <laughs> there's this video I've been curious about, so there's a certain someone I suspect as well. I was searching the dark first floor, I saw a weird video now. I'd be curious about Gin's actions myself. Why do you know how to get to the first floor? Guy with glasses and something like an axe swung in his head. Then he said Big Sis Sarah's name. Yeah, Papa, Papa is doing what a mandatory meeting does for all the OnlyFans girls and gays out there. Oh my god, you're my mandatory meeting. I am. Of course, I don't suspect you. I've been revealed. Anything. Yeah, you've been exposed. This is a whole elaborate plan. I got scared and left the room right away, but I'm sure that was a victim video meow. I have been curious about this. Someone I suspect a little. This video, when I first watched it, I was too scared to look, so I used the fake Professor Mishima's monitor to play it again. What sort of video was it? Well, possible is just faked, right? So I don't want to say anything irresponsible. I won't know unless you tell me. Oh, look, it's that video I watched with you before, Sarah. I wonder what happened now is spending most of the first half in the room of lies. Maybe it was just tougher to stay in the room because of the fake Mishima. So you know what? Inspecting if we don't know the reason, isn't that right, Sarah? No other reason, then sure. I'm pretty curious about Gin's actions myself. Why do you know how to get or how to get to the first floor? 
Him noticing the secret door just by searching the room of rubble had me tilting my head a bit. You need a better nose than a police dog to do that. If Gin has a sense of smell of both a dog and a cat, then... Just as a reminder, Gin's a human. This is it! Now, you're talking about this victim video, aren't you? Ah, the one I dropped! Yes, that's exactly right. There was a woman tied up by chains, and this terrifying device started up. And just like that, the woman died. Doesn't It pulls her apart, right? Like, that's the chains all tighten. There's a man in front laughing. From behind, he... He looked like the... Oh, right, yeah, he does have that piss yellow hair, because I remember that was what we said in the stream when we saw that first. It was like, hmm, yep. who else has that color of hair? To me, it looked like he left the woman to die. Huh, a shocking story. But it could always be a forgery. Why don't we ask? KJ, is the video video real? Or do you deny it? I'm doubting you so we can believe you. God damn, what a bitch. I'm saying nothing. You need to defend yourself. Miss Sarah, it's looking like it'll be faster if you press the issue. Eh? I'm sure even KJ will open his mouth for his dear Miss Sarah. Suppose the true colors he's kept hidden for so long. I'm counting on you. Suppose KJ by my own hand? Oh my god. Oh my god, you're so handsome. I don't want to fight you, Sam. Can't let him sleep. I'm gonna grab him. Choose words I can refute and talk back. Let's discuss the victim video now, Saw. How about? None of us have heard what your first trial was yet, KG. Please don't lie like so! Boy, well, yeah, that's a shocking comparison to hear. Sorry, sorry, I'll reflect on it. Unfortunately, I also watched it with her once in the monitor room. There's no mistake, KG. So I see. No, I can identify you even from behind. With golden hair, no one can imitate it. Pretty sure all our enemy need is a wig to imitate it, actually. In fact, we even got doll fakes, how can you prove it was the real me? I know my blonde men. I know them from any position. It's not strange at all. That was that. This is this. Believe me, it's convenient for you. Can't make sense of that. That was a bad answer. You're both police officers. You're a policeman too, KG. Is this just a coincidence? I give up. Oh. Well, okay. That was fast. I give up. I can't beat you, Sarah. Please, tell us everything, KG. The video is real. The victim video that now saw. And it was also my first trial. The woman's name was Megumi Sas er, Sasahara. She was my boss ever since I joined the force. <laughs> I take it back. I prefer him to have his blonde, his piss hair. It's blonde. This is awful. <laughs> This is like when I- oh fuck, I wish that my, uh, stream deck was connected right now so I could go to my brown hair. It's just like how that looks so long. Ugh. Actually, is, where is the cord for this even? Hold on, let me you see. Un you unplug your stream deck? Everything got unplugged so I could do the Just Dance stream. Oh. Yeah, it was fun. I moved the stream deck over there specifically because I was like, hey, I might need to, like, mute myself or something. Uh, and then the mute function didn't even work. So I was like, okay, cool. Um, let me just see if I can connect it real quick and we can do the mute function. The mute, M-U-T-E. I love the mute function. The mute function is a different function. I don't do that on, on Twitch. Oh. Why is the cord right. somehow shorter that. right now? You do that on the Food Network, because you have your own show, Cooking with Viv. Yes, exactly. I'm such a good cook. <laughs> We're going a long way for this joke of getting the stream deck to work so I can maybe go brunette for half a second. Also, why is this... <laughs> this cord should not be this short. Why is it, like, not able to reach? It Like, it was literally set up like this before. Is it tangled? No. 
Oh, whatever, it's fine. We'll just have to examine it. There we go. That should be the brown hair, right? Yes. Brown hair is active. It's not worth it. Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm Keiji Shinobi. I've been assigned here starting this week. It's good to meet you. Good to meet you too. I'm Megumi Sasahara. I suppose this makes me your trainer. She's so pretty. Also, we do have Papo mode. Well, well, very or pretty impressive for your age, Shinogi. Yes, man. Me mode. Yes, you mode. But you might be a bit too serious. Even if you have stamina, you have to think about how to spend it, or it won't last. Um, I heard you were rather elite, Miss Megumi. We have three hair colors. We also have the red one, which you are. How would you serve as a trainer for the likes of me? <laughs> I wonder indeed. I have high hopes for you. Yes, ma'am. But then came the day of my nightmares. Oh. I shot a person. We should maybe be more serious now. I'll get rid of the red hair. Criminal in a certain case. Miss Megumi. What? Why am I not being punished? I've... I've killed a person. Oh no, the unofficial Gashu. <laughs> Oh no. We already have the official Gashu. It's hi, hello, how are you? Oh my god, do you have the same mustache? Yeah, do you have a crab mustache? Is that what makes you unofficial? Is that you don't have it? In self defense, yes. But the criminal wasn't even holding a weapon. That's just what the law says. You've done nothing wrong. Miss Megumi. I heard you make a backroom deal. So what? There's an official- Yeah, the- The guy who's running the killing game right now, I think, is the official Gashu. His name is Gashu, if you're not familiar with this game. I thought that was the joke, I thought you were- Because I remember somebody was in- When I played, uh... Fucking, what was it? Um. Uh, Disco Elysium. Someone came in named the unofficial Kujo, I think, because Kujo's a character in that one. I thought this was the joke. It's even funnier if <laughs> it's not intentional. Anyways. Yeah, I want to know who it. I want to know who your name is after, but yes, continue. Yes. Get back to your duty, your police. I. Mm -hmm. She's the benefactor who protected me. I'll never forget it. I owed her the worst kind of debt. Left her to die? No, I... But I killed her, Megumi. <laughs> Mr. Policeman, get a hold of yourself, meow. Sorry for keeping quiet, everyone. Truth is, your friendly policeman's not a policeman anymore. Eiji, I'm surprised. What a dangerous individual we've had lurking in our midst. We had a Even fucking so. murderer. Shut up, Oh, son. I see. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And we're... Okay, I was... Because I was like, if that wasn't intentional, it'd be an excellent coincidence. I'm surprised, what a dangerous individual. Yeah, yeah. If you vote for me, I won't complain. No. Um, everyone? Speaking of voting, I think it's about time... Wow. That was fast. Meow? No way, that was way too quick. Well, you need time to work out the card trades this time, you see. Precisely, choosing a victim without a satisfactory discussion is not an outcome we desire either. Okay. I'm sorry I ruined the joke by making you explain it. What do we do? I don't want to suspect, but Kitaro is so cagey. You think you're pretty sketchy. Hold up, don't we need one more person though? Troubling, huh? If it's down to three options, I'll make your choices that much narrower. And the crab stash, man. Hell yeah. Gotta suspect someone again, Wolf. Then maybe it's better to think of who to leave out from the final vote. That's a good idea again. Really? If you aren't chosen in the preliminary vote and are dropped out because you can no longer be chosen, there's no need to lie anymore. That might be one of our greatest allies. Of course, if you're the sacrifice, it works against you. God, let's talk about who we want to leave out. I think Big Sister should be left out, Meow. Because she's super dependable for reasoning. What? We should leave out someone with lots of tokens, like Kutaro. How about we leave out Gin, since he doesn't have any tokens? We shouldn't be selecting Gin or Kana. Sacrificing a kid's no good at all. Love that. There's also my first time playing through it, I guess, although we're a little bit in now. So should be left out. I mean, didn't he say he was the sacrifice to start? 
I have to say, I'd be glad if Sarah was left out. Watering the stream, thank you for the hydration check. Maybe someone out. I think I'd say I miss Sarah too. Because you're so darn cute. What do you think I was going to say? When her escape failed, it looked at you and had a thought. She's acting kind of strange. You had this desperate look, as if you were the sacrifice. He read me like a book. Maybe he, oh, I mean, it is possible that he didn't trade me the sacrifice originally and he made the guess after. And on top of that, the last minute trade right after our escape failed. Just a tad suspicious, isn't it? I don't know the truth about you, Miss Sarah. We don't have anything to prove that we like lost our wallet, unfortunately, which would be what I would do. Also, I should probably save in a minute. Shouldn't be like them getting her con, sacrificing her kids don't get her all. I ain't trying to look like a good person. I feel like once we lose our sensibilities, we're gonna turn into demons. If it's gonna come to that, then pick me, Sarah. Pick me. Pick me. Mm, pick me. I have to say, I'd be glad if Sarah was left out. My reason? Um. Because you're the one I want to live most. No matter what. Oh, okay, well. We should leave out someone with lots of tokens like Kutaro. There's been a bunch of card trading this time. It's possible Kutaro with all his tokens was involved in at least one trade. And him giving his tokens to So, that subject could really influence the discussion. We should leave him out to. When did he give his token? Oh yeah. No, when did he give his tokens to So? I should be left out. I mean, they say he was a sacrifice to start. Yeah, so is the sacrifice he's saying such rotten shit. If that's suspicious stuff and loses our trust, you can get us to vote for him. Leave him out and his heart should calm down. But I wonder if just leaving him out will really make him say what he's really thinking. For an ally, he's a real pain, huh? A lie. A lie. I believe out Ginsu doesn't have any tokens. Just listen, the best person to leave out is someone who's very likely to have the sacrifice. If the sacrifice comes around to you, you have to trade it away if you have tokens, right? But Gin has zero tokens. If Gin had the sacrifice even once, he wouldn't be able to trade it away. So there's a high chance he's the sacrifice? Big Sis Sarah should be left out. No, so I swore to protect Big Sis. Aw, Gin. I believe in you, meow. Still wholesome. <sighs> I don't think if any of this is particularly relevant, but I don't think it is. I mean, I guess that would maybe indicate that... Kutaro, is something the matter? I'm gonna trade just before the main game. Is that true? Yeah, it's true. Because he... Oh, right, yeah, because... I mean, I thought he would have already looked at his tablet. Means... Yeah, just maybe. Figure out he's got the sacrifice. Meow? What? How could you possibly know that from what we just... Kitaro. I know, everybody listen up. I felt that I was doing like a southern accent for him for a while. Disclosure. He master. You were originally the sacrifice. I'm daring to say it before voting. What's this is all of a sudden? I can't tell where you're going with this. I didn't say that, huh, Sarah? Huh? I'm sorry for taking the key master from you. Was you, you little bitch? What's he mean? The sacrifice card you got sent was mine, Sarah. It's Kutaro who sent me the sacrifice? You still got the sacrifice now, ain't that right? Fuck, but I have a commenter now. Kutaro's making a false accusation here. You really think I'm the sacrifice? Yeah. Then just leave me out of the vote. Don't be the misled, guys. The sacrifice gets two votes. She puts those two votes towards herself, she's getting selected. In other words, if I'm not selected, there will be proof. Either way, nobody vote for Miss Sarah and we'll have proof. I'd like that, but... By the time we proceed with the vote. Wait, please, can we decide on such an important vote with so, or so much still unclear? <sighs> we can't just sort it out in such a short time. We do, the victim's gonna be one of the ones we nominate, remember? We really should discuss some more. You sure don't want to give up. Time is up. Please select the four who will remain for the final vote. Enter your votes, please. Please choose who to vote for. Who are you voting for, Vivs? Hmm. Who's it gonna be? There really are only eight of us, huh? Mm -hmm. Fuck, do I have a time limit on this, or can I just sit here and think for a sec? No, there's no time limit. Voting for myself would be very funny, but if I won't... Actually, mm, 
If I voted for myself and only got one vote, I feel like that would indicate that I am not suspicious. There's no time. That makes it sound like the opposite. Okay. So is just fucking throwing caution to the wind. I think there's a very good chance that he threw the sacrifice card to Kutaro while he was unconscious. Then who has Keymaster? No, because if... Kutaro wouldn't trade away Keymaster. So, uh... I think so might be the key master right now. Someone here is the sage. Kutaro's role could have been the sage beforehand. Because uh, somebody else has been given the sacrifice card, and I don't. Kutaro wouldn't voluntarily trade back with us again. Like, he, he wouldn't want it back. I so did mention hacking it, and it's possible that he did send that card to somebody else. Which means he might get killed here. Because that is a discrepancy. That was cheating, and Kutaro didn't have a chance to play fair if he did do that. I don't know. I don't know who else would really be, like... Kutaro also doesn't want us voting for Gin for either of the children. Well, he didn't say now. Did you say now and Gin? He only said no, now and I said Kana. The, I said the children. It was Gin and Kana. I think I only oh, said I thought children. you said now. No. But he said he didn't want us voting for the children, which means it's possible that one of them has Keymaster. Wouldn't surprise me if... Mm. I feel like Gin would have mentioned that he had it, though, to me. Kana is doing whatever Kana's doing. She's kind of hard to read, I feel like, in that sense, because, like... So... Oh, so could be the Sage, though, couldn't he? But then why bother hacking? Hmm... I think it's possible that Kutaro, because he had a shitload of coins, he took Keymaster from me, gave me sacrifice. Come on, let me, let me like write this down in the notebook so I can try and figure it out. Okay. We got the notes. That's Sarah. We've got fuck, how am I blanking on your name already, KG? KG, we've got Kana. Who's next to KG? <laughs> we got Q. We've got you. So, oh my god, I'm top four from Jack Race. Q's black scent is entering the chat. Oh my god, the man with the least of a black scent of any character I've maybe ever seen in fiction. Uh, anyways, uh, Reco. Not this. Oh, the fracking. Oh, the black scent. <laughs> this is not. This isn't. Good jokes. Anyways, okay, so and then we've got now and we've got Gin. So we know KG started out with the keymaster, traded that to me, and then that was trade one. The trade between me and Qtar was trade three. Because trade two is a question mark that happened while me and KG were together. KG. I said there were six trades in total. So there are two more trades in between here. Four and five are the ones we don't know about. And then six. Was Sarah or someone to Sarah? Someone traded a commoner to Sarah. The only person we know who has had one 
was cagey. Hold on. Just realizing this is like incredibly dead air. Let me just make it a little bit more appropriately frantic. Hopefully that helps. Okay. So. We don't know who might have the sage. And they're not going to reveal themselves, but they would be trying to protect someone. I think you might have traded somebody else for the sage. Oh, Gin said that his mission was to save Sarah. Like, he made that point specifically. As did Kana. Multiple people said they wanted to protect Sarah, so it's possible. Trade 2. If Trade 2 was between... Fuck, was it now or was it Kana who said that they needed to protect Sarah? Because mm. Gin was one of them. Gin plus... I feel like it was... I want to say it was Kana. I think maybe also the song is in it. Do I have other... I have other 999 ones, right? The Ternary game, whatever the fuck that is. Oh, this one. This one's chill. I don't really use, don't use this one in videos. Anyways. Okay. So... What I think is possible here... Hmm. <sighs> Maybe the trial. I appreciate the lack of spoilers. I also recognize I'm probably on the wrong track, but I'm thinking that two... What if, if trade two was cute again? No. Or would they be trading? Trade two was cute again. Q had sage, which meant he, or he knew that I had keymaster. And he didn't want. And that would mean Gin had sacrifice? What? Yeah, okay, wait. Gin had sacrifice. So. Q knew that I had Keymaster because he. Uh, the first trade happened from KG to me. I became the Keymaster. So. One. Trade one. We know that one for sure. That one was KG to. Sarah, and he started out as a commoner, or as the uh, key master. Sorry, I uh, look. This anyone who wasn't here for the zero escape streams, this was the experience of the zero escape streams. Me staring at a notebook, trying to be like, "What the fuck's happening here?" Mm -hmm. Okay, so then trade two. Q two. Gin. Q had sage. Gin had and, and what? Sacrifice. Trade three, that one we do know about. That one was Q to Sarah. Mm -hmm. Sacrifice for Keymaster. Which he could do because he knew. That's why he was talking about like, wait, do I have he was like, was there another trade? Who could it be? But he knows I don't have any coins, which I'm guessing is why he's... Oh, because we didn't realize we were missing the coins until that happened. That oh, was part okay. of the plan. Kutaro stole the coins so that he could make sure that we wouldn't be able to trade it away. Which is why he's so confident that I am still the sacrifice. Interesting. So... Because I think that what probably happened was that... Because he was also saying that he wants to protect the children. 
And why he might be doing that is because if Gin has the Sage card, then that means that he can tell the truth about who the Keymaster is. And that might be his plan from here. But then the sacrifice has been given to somebody, we don't know who. Trade four, five, six. Six was somebody to Sarah. And she had the sacrifice, and it was someone with a commoner card. I think that one, it's possible that that one was KG at the end. Although KG was busy taking down Rubble. God, I like that they were like, hey guys, time to vote, no more discussion. And I'm like, that's cute. We're not going to do that. Rush me that. Okay. Bananas and bananas. Love that. I, I don't know. I like this game's music a lot, but in moments where it's silent, I feel like it's better to just have something playing. But yeah, okay. So the two that I'm like... Because trade two happened while KG, Sarah, and Gin, I guess, were on... Four one. One F. He got back there sometime before that, and then had a very different attitude. He had to come save me, which would make sense. He had to come help me because Keymaster. That might be his vibe. God, this is. I don't even know how long that was. How long is that? That's a five minute song. I'm just still going. I should be better at this stuff. I feel like. My problem, I think, is that I don't know when to stop thinking, or it's like, I don't know when to land. Anyways, KG, Gin, and Sarah were all there. We don't really need to worry about what happened in trade three, because we know that one. Trade four, that was while we were at the dollhouse? All storage, and there was one other one, wasn't there? When did that other trade happen? Fuck, what was the order of this? Oh no. Um. Cause Sarah, Gin, and now we're together for at least one of these trades. And Gin has no money, so he can't really trade. Kyutaro might have just been trading back and forth with fucking everyone, because if he stole my coins, or if he stole my wallet, he has a shitload of money right now. Reko, I feel like I've kind of left out of this, but I don't know what... It feels like she's probably a commoner. But she also might just be laying low as the sage. Or maybe she got the Keymaster somehow. Oh, wait! She might have had the coins. She might have taken Alice's. Hmm. Because the only ones that we know for sure are... We don't know... I don't know. Okay. I need to vote for somebody who I think isn't the Sacrifice. Nobody else can get into the... Because we had Q's... We had Q's tablet. And he couldn't have initiated a trade. Oh, you don't need to use that. You just need to use the coins. Can you... Wait, can you transfer somebody else's coin? Like, can you make a trade on behalf of someone else? Because I thought it had to be you to somebody else. Like, they wouldn't allow you to be like... Like, Sarah couldn't call in and say, Hi, I would like to trade uh, KG's cards with So's. This isn't even the hard part to decide. Am I thinking about nothing? Oh no. This is going to be a vote that goes the same way no matter what. <laughs> I spent 10 minutes worrying about this over his... Oh, oh. Oh, your silence is scaring me. He's going like, to come back in five minutes and be like, Oh yeah, I went to the bathroom so you're taking too long to decide. And it further on, so... Okay. I think that the sacrifice card got sent back to you. But I just don't get how that would be possible. 
Don't want to vote for you. I'm voting for KG. All votes have been received. Displaying results. I like that I basically didn't acknowledge KG for most of that, but then I was like, you know what, we'll just vote for him anyways. Okay. So it was 3 KG, 2 Kana, 2 So, 2 Mao. Huh. I think it's interesting that there was, like, a surprising amount of agreement on this. The two votes for So. Each of these people... Okay, also, I guess I can pause the music now, because we've moved past this. Papo, are you still there? Did you die? Are you okay? No, I'm still here. I just had nothing to add. You're just still here. to let me lose my mind for 10 minutes. Always. Because I just like hearing what you're thinking. Oh, God. Okay, so, I do think what's interesting right now is that each of these people has at least two votes, which means that we can't... I'm guessing that... Because we put our vote on KG, which means that any of the other... These four were locked in, basically. If I'd voted for Gin, Q, uh, Reko, or myself, then it would have still been those three all with two. Which means we can't tell who the sacrifice is from that. But now getting two is suspicious as all hell. Because why vote for now? Okay, let me make a new clip here. Hold on. KG. Kana's also a weird one. I don't really get why she got two. Okay, fine. Let's just... Our four are an interesting pair because I really thought that Utaro first vote is over. And it wasn't chosen. Leaf. I can feel my strained nerves loosening. But why these four? Sarah, you... It's just like I said, I'm not the sacrifice. I'm a commoner. Or we'll advance to the final vote. So Hiyori. Kana Kazuchi. Keiji Shinogi. Now Ego er, Egokoro. Why me? This isn't right. I know this to spare myself. You can't want to have a conversation when you feel like this, which is why my role to inspire them, like KG did for me back in the first er, main game. I'm um, Doc Kara, Sarah. Oh my God! Wait, what's happening with the buildings in the background? Lift your heads up. We've always done it, or er, we always done what we had to do. No matter how cruel it is, you can't stop. But Hana, we're not your enemies. Even if someone is the sacrifice, we move in the same direction. We talk and we advance the discussion. Sarah. <laughs> Right, you are. The real battle begins here. Everyone, those of us who weren't picked should start. Incidentally, my role's commoner. Got that? Okay, so. Let me just write this down really quick. Because. God, my pen is like overflowing with ink a little bit. It's a little concerning. Oh, no. uh, uh, commoner. Now, I think Kutaro doesn't know what card he has is the thing. Because he hasn't, he might not have checked his tablet, because there was a vote. Right. So we've had our vote. Our top four have been decided. Are you Team Aquaria? Are you hashtag Team Asia? Are you hashtag Team Eureka? Or are you hashtag Team Cameron? Sound off on Team Cameron. Sound off online and let us know who you think should be crowned America's next drag superstar. Uh... And my goes all the way. Baby. Um... And... Reco. Okay. So at this point... Team Cameron or Aquarius. Okay, well it's Cameron with a K. Big fan. But also... I, can't, I think I didn't. I think I like begrudgingly liked Aquaria at that point because I was very Ms. Cracker that entire season, and unfortunately, it was just like, ugh. unfortunately, she is kind of eating him up. As Fossil would say, she is boring. 
Anyways, okay, so we know Sarah has a commoner. Reko has a commoner. Not time to shuffle up. Let's remember the card trades in order. I should put this on the same page. So there are still two. Three commoners left in the game. Aside from the ones we already know about. Please grasp your fate, or grasp your fate with your hands. May you not all perish. Now we're going to proceed along digging into the details of the trades. Fix this record. Got it, meow. Gashu quietly sat in the chair again. There are four trades. What? But he, he, he doesn't know. He forgot about one of them, but I don't think he was unconscious for two of them. What, or how long was he knocked out for? I guess one could have happened there. Uh, probably the last two, no? Maybe? Maybe that many. I'm gonna comment the whole way. Woof. Oh, okay, well that... How much time did I spend saying, Oh yeah, Gin is 100% the Sage. Trading cards required 50 tokens, so only so many people could make trades. Gin has no reason to lie about being a commoner unless he promised something, right? Who would he have promised? The person who gave him sage. Oh. So, like, someone else could have made a deal with him or something, but it wouldn't make sense for him. Kutaro, I think, is very... Kutaro thinks he knows what's going on. I mean, we know why Kutaro is behaving that way, because he thinks that he gave me the sacrifice, and that's why he was so confident in knowing what was up. And now he's saying that he doesn't no. And we can also safely assume that the sacrifice is one of the top four, right? Unless it's Q. And also presumably Keymaster, because no one's claimed Keymaster yet either. Well, yeah, mm, I guess So did claim to be the sacrifice, but So does weird shit all the time. Anyways, let's start extracting from some people. Four trades made in total ain't that many. It's all a mess in my head. Glad we got given more time to sort it out. I'm a commoner the whole way, didn't even get traded once. I was pound, or pounding, wondering when I get past that card. My world didn't change up to the very end. I made through all five trades. Am I imagining an extra trade in here somewhere? Token I ranking think 59. I six. I said six. Gin saying five. Gutaro saying four. Gin might have left his... Oh. There might be six. Gin maybe left his... Gin might not have had su or Sage to begin with. But he might have had Commoner to begin with. No, wait, my theory still works. It's possible that Gin left his iPad up top when he went downstairs, so he wouldn't have seen that that trade happened. He wouldn't have gotten the alert, he wouldn't have known it happened. And he might just not have checked his cards again, because, like, why would he? Unless, wait, did he say? Mm. I was powdering one. Yeah, so he never noticed himself getting it. No, because that wouldn't have made sense, because then Q would have had to have traded with him to get... Yeah, no. So I think that theory is bunk. I mean, you and now are near the bottom, right? God damn it, my theory sucks. I spent so much time thinking about it, and it just instantly gets proven wrong. That's why I didn't say anything. I can't stand you. Ugh, oh, you love me. Not really gaslighting. Muscle Gorilla, wow. that's wrong, Meow. What? There were five trades. Well, wait, uh, by my memory, there were three. Then I heard there was one just before the main game. But you misunderstood, Kitaro. There were two trades while you were out. One of them don't make sense. Okay, so there were only... Were there really only five trades, too? Am I actually, like, this dumb? That I just, like, invented an extra trade? Sorry, but no one's giving me an explanation. That's on us. Kitaro, when was it that you passed Sarah the Sacrifice card? Actually, you have Sacrifice from the start. No, that ain't it. First card I had was Commoner. Hmm. Huh. Okay. So, Somebody second round. The truth. I mean, why would he lie at this point about this? He's already out of the contention, so if he is the sacrifice, he has nothing to gain. If he was the key master, he'd just say that. But I don't think he still is. So the second trade was... Q, commoner, and someone else with sacrifice. And that was how he ended up with it. 
I get it. That tells me most of the trades. I don't have a clue. Why is that? Because your friendly policeman made the first trade. Well, who'd you trade what? I gave Sarah the key master. Yeah. Uh, then what card did Sarah start with? No reason to lie, but... I was a commoner. Get a key master for commoner? I think Demon Dark Trust doing it. Let's do a little sort out. Yeah. First trade. KG went from key master to commoner with Sarah. Second trade. Someone sacrificing Kutaro's commoner. Exactly. Someone sacrificed was swapped with Kutaro's commoner. And in the third trade, yeah, Q gives sacrifice to Sarah as key master. Yep, that's what it means. He was unconscious and we had his tablet for the last two. So he couldn't have made any additional trades. So he should have been key master unless it was traded away from him. But he could still. Oh, that was why he. Mm. Maybe tell us all the details of the third trade. Does it tell him who traded it to? No, it wouldn't. It would just say it's anonymous. At the time of the third trade, I was searching the first floor alone. Oh, I guess you could still be down there. Third trade happened while everyone was sharing the laptop. These trades, I better keep them sorted out in my head too. So for trade three, Gin was still on 1F. Oh, is it gonna... Top row of this table is what everyone had to start with. Oh, Because he wasn't given a roll, was he? Rolls weren't distributed until after he died. Well, that was after... He was gone, yeah. Oh, I don't even have to, like, manually do this? No. It's... You just have to think about it. I mean, you don't really have enough with the information. Well, we can say have. he had commoner after the first vote. Technically. Oh, it's just not going to put it in there for some no. reason? No. Okay, that's no, fine. No, no. That's what I was saying. It'll, it'll just do it once you have your info. Okay, so the black one just means that, like, no chain. Because for us, it shows every card that we had each round. So he th thinks he still has Keymaster, but we don't know. This is what they're claiming. trade I was searching the first floor alone now. I was doing all this stuff by myself. I wanted to see the laptop. What stuff did you do exactly? It's not relevant right now. Mm, that's concerning. Third trade happened while everyone was sharing the laptop. Why you acting strange, Sarah? I think you've been traded the sacrifice. Damn, you're going to make that trade on the spot and then act all innocent. What's strange here? Kutaro... Wait... Mm -hmm. Kutaro, did he maybe leave his tablet open? No. You can say that about anybody, really. Because, yeah. He wasn't in the room, or he was in the room when that happened, but he didn't do it. That was what So did. So went and did, used his or his tablet to make the trade. Don't you deny it, Kitaro? You know, bring a box to trade. If you use one on the spot, shouldn't we have seen him do it? Oh yeah, I forgot that. It, I thought you could do it from your iPad. I'm dumb. What could he be hiding? Oh god. Uh, I don't have hands for I'm... Ah! Stuff is falling over. Oh my god! What were you doing with your hands, huh? huh? I was trying to move my notepad. Mm-hmm. Sure. That's why his hands are Oh, busy. God. Surely that's enough, right? I'd say so. We did it. 
for sure. Thank you for stopping by, Aster. Really do appreciate it. Also, thank you for the Prime stuff earlier as well. I hope you have a good night. Yeah, the VOD will go up on YouTube. It should be up by like 9 a.m. tomorrow morning, my time. So, good night, Aster. Hours. Yeah, good night. It sounds as you want. It's no use. I spit it all out, Taro. I meant to cooperate with Sarah. With everyone. I got used for convenience. I'm pathetic. A pathetic adult. The third trade. My sacrifice being sent to Sarah. It wasn't me. It was So's doing. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. So knew. He knew I had the sacrifice. What? When everyone was sharing the laptop, So wasn't going to use the toilet. He went to use a ring-up box to trade my sacrifice and Sarah's keymaster. I don't know a thing about that. Okay, so you can't just trade other people's shit for them. Okay, that makes this all so much more confusing. Wait a second. You, you chose two other people and made them trade? You can do that? It... Must be possible, huh? Yeah, but again, I keep thinking it's the iPad. That's unrelated. You can say that with confidence. So, isn't it about time you confess? Tell us your real reason for sharing the laptop. <laughs> Such a deeply suspicious individual, KG. Hmm? <gasps> Battle time. Ooh, I like these colors. Yeah, these look fun. His hair looks better like this. I think to come to an agreement. I want to hear the truth from your mouth. <laughs> the what? In the same as these two give, I should affirm correct ones or deny incorrect ones. Now we can do the third trade. He was with us. Just how did you know there? How did you know the sacrifice? It's rolling on ahead with the assumption I knew, huh? So didn't have access until later. So not directly. Guitar's intent was to negotiate with So. As a condition of his trade, he showed So his sacrifice card. It's natural to think that. Such an act of imagination, Miss Sarah. I would use that imagination to consider what their negotiation was like. Yes, even So's already recognized that fact. That's right. How did So react to er, Guitar's proposition? He didn't let him in the room. So was on guard. Kutara had taken the laptop from him once before, so wouldn't let him in the room, no questions asked. Did they make a deal through the door? Not amusing, I just thought of a way. I said exactly, that's what Kutara did to propose his deal. So must have been fairly wary of Kutaro, who could best him using force. But Kutaro informed him that he was the sacrifice in advance. Not vocally, but by showing him his tablet. So, you would get another objective- you- I thought the original rule with the card is that you couldn't show people the cards, but I guess that's not the case anymore with the iPads. No, they also said that the things change. Yeah, I guess. Because that instruction was on the back of the cards, and this time there's no instructions. I guess the first time you'd want to do it because they don't know what those cards mean, so you don't want them to give away their game too soon. So you had yet another objective on top of tokens in the Sarah folder to control the sacrifice as you wanted. You got it! After the second trade, me and Connor were working on the escape plan. Then I heard Kitaro through the door. Want to make a deal, he said. I didn't care to listen, but he slid his tablet under the door, and there I saw it, the sacrifice. How brave of him to go so far as offering up info just so I'd share the laptop. What do you know? Sarah. You saw that first floor security footage, right? Well, it's the truth. I haven't discussed my first trial, have I? It was one absurd trial, I tell ya. Again, I kept on meaning to do a southern accent for him, then I kind of forgot. They told me, set up the props used for the death game. Then it's true, you set up the cards. Yeah, of course, I didn't know what they meant yet. Once I found out, I knew Kate, or Kai's fate was set. It's like I killed him. Kai took the sage card, I just placed it random. But I at least wanted to get Kai's laptop back one more time. Such an emotional story. So that's what drove you to gave me a whole hundred tokens. One hundred, meow? No shit, that's enough for two trades. But you left yourself enough for just one trade. How cunning. Pretending to risk your life but not forgetting to protect yourself. What a dirty adult you are. Eh, interesting. All told, you left yourself an escape route. If you were in a pickle, you could pass the sacrifice away from yourself. That's why I decided to act first and send the sacrifice to someone else. Miss Sarah, always thinking of her allies. Is that the truth of the third trade? I was hopeful it might make you tear off your sheep's clothing. Why does he do all this to me? But you went above and beyond my expectations. Eh? The fourth trade was you, wasn't it, Miss Sarah? Um, what are you talking about? I mean, the sacrifice is what killed Joe, yes? 
I didn't have any tokens. I didn't even have enough tokens. I couldn't do any trades. No tokens? That's hard to believe. Quiet, Loner. I was with Big Sarah, or Big Sister Sarah for the fourth trade. Okay, oh, yeah, so that was the dollhouse. Dollhouse? I'm just calling it the dollhouse because it's easier. Oh. I, it keeps on making me think of the Pretty Little Liars dollhouse. I know it's like the doll, like the back of the doll warehouse storage thing. Uh, Gin, Sarah, and now we're all together for that one. So was I. Sarah didn't do any trade then. It must have been an ally who did it for you. An ally. Okay, you took the sacrifice from me, Sarah, didn't you? What? What's the meaning of this? It's really very simple. The two of them were accomplices. <laughs> KG had no idea what the- how- I don't think I even saw KG really much between when I got the sacrifice and left. You didn't. Oh, he's- to achieve victory in the main game by way of said sacrifice. They schemed to escape by working together and having KG win the vote. I suspect the fifth trade that followed was Miss Sarah and KG making a bluff. They picked two random commoners to have trade. And the sacrifice is KG? That's all a wild fabrication. I mean, the sacrifice I had was taken away by the fifth trade. Those writing nonsense lead everyone by the nose. If my reasoning is correct, Keiji is the sacrifice and the sage is... Miss Now, perhaps? I'm the sage? Yeah. So may well be fine... Er... May well be fine to have Miss Now die this time. Wait a sec! At the start you said you were the sacrifice. Yeah, that was a lie. I'm a commoner. Okay, well... We knew that. Well, the lying part, not necessarily the commoner. The only one he hasn't... He has very deliberately avoided claiming sage at any point. Which I think is interesting. Maybe it's the sage. That's the thing with so you can never fucking trust him. Like, yeah, he's he could say he's whatever the fuck you want. Because I don't think it's now. Because frankly, I think for them to reveal who the sage was early on, that would be a bit difficult. Um, so we don't know who the sage is. We don't. I don't really know for sure who the Keymaster is. And we have... We have... Two more commoners up for grabs. So is claiming to be one of them. Would you be in the same boat as me? So you guess choosing anyone but Keiji is the same in the end. What's up for Kana since she's the least valuable? Oh. Enough. Hmm? It's been a long time since I've hated somebody this much. Here's a friendly little police report. I long since used up all my tokens. <laughs> you want me just to believe that? So, you're just dying to say I end up being a sacrifice, aren't you? Keymaster. Interesting. Mm -hmm. He's fingering us. God damn it, not the yaoi hands. <laughs> that, that finger could reach all the way up into your small intestine. Jesus Christ. That was a long ass really hand. Hmm. Okay. So we've got... So is claiming to be a commoner. Kitaro hasn't said what he is because I think he's wrong. AG is claiming to be the key master. Uh... So we don't know where the sage is at. Kutaro would have previously been... So I guess Kutaro would be the other commoner now? Huh? What are you saying? The key master is Kutaro, though. Looks like we got him good. Wait, what? Were you two... Interesting. Hmm. Kitaro's the sage. Ridiculous, that's impossible. Possible, all right. And as the sage, I make an announcement. Heiji's without a doubt the key master. Hmm. Can't be true, that's all. You're on the right track to think accomplices. But it wasn't Sarah I teamed up with, it was Kitaro. Let's tell the truth of the fourth trade, shall we? The trade between Mr. Policeman and Kitaro. Ooh, this music. The music's getting intense. Do you have tank here? God. Only time I've ever envied so. Okay, so. So 
so then Q. Be a key master to KG. No, that doesn't work. What? When would you have gotten the Sage card then, bud? Whatever would happen, I proposed to Kitaro that we team up. So in the fourth trade, KG and Kitaro's cards got traded? Fourth trade, sure ended up pushing the loner now. now. Oh, Kitaro, weren't you passed out during the fourth trade? KG didn't trade himself, but yeah, he hasn't worked out his logic. Gave all your tokens to KG. Remembered that? Because I fucking didn't. I mean, I mean, he did say it. Well, I mean, I know he said it, but I forgot. Just making sure nobody's having a reaction. so interesting to see if so facade break so much this round. <laughs> it's funny. What? Oh, I think that's the contradiction that we need to point out. Did you give him all your tokens, Meow? Sure did, and it seems like that landed way outside the ballpark. Shut up! Wow, he is getting flustered. <laughs> if you need to sleep, go sleep, Gushy, I promise. But also, ugh, those late day naps are rough. We're in a leeway, are we? I still got doubts. I can't be convinced it's just that. After all, Keiji, why were you able to know about Kitaro having the key master? Isn't there a way to do that during the main game with the Sage's power of clairvoyance? Oh, so you still don't know. Okie dokie, let's resume the discussion. Yeah, no, there's no way for you to have got- where would you have gotten Sage from in here? You're a commoner, then there's... The trade here- no, that can't be right. Hi, Onyx! There's commoner. Commoner. This is honestly less- I was hoping that I'd be able to, like, mark things down. I think they're doing that intentionally, though. I'm gonna constantly make this trade. Like, isn't it clearly the- hold on, I'm gonna turn on the volume, maybe we'll hold it too loud for me to think. Keymaster traded one- like, traded here, then the trade here was how he apparently got the sacrifice, or he had the sacrifice. He was given sacrifice- wait, what? Someone else traded the sacrifice there. to him, is what he said, right? Mm -hmm. So he was commoner, and then in round two, that was his trade. Round three was his trade. Round four was also one of his trades. And then in round five, someone else got the sacrifice from me. 
and how to be a commoner. Well, I don't know. Sorry, it was Sage. Yeah, Sage thought, shouldn't have showed up here. Because there was no point at which he could have traded away for that. You don't mean. Yeah, Sage is clairvoyance, of course. The sage could use clairvoyance even outside the main game? That's what the tablets are for. You intentionally didn't mention it! Grab all the mysteries now. I should prove it. Mr. Policeman used clairvoyance to see Kutaro's key master, and I made the fourth trade to swap Kutaro's key master and my sage. No, you didn't originally have sage. Someone. Small BS. He he had the sage at some point. He must have, and he didn't know that he could use that power. I think that's why he's mad. Um, oh, sorry, Joshua. There's no need to discuss the fifth trade anymore. Convinced of your victory earlier, you confess. I'm a commoner. Any other questions? It's all about Cage's story. It'll become clear if I look back at the trade so far. Saged Kitaro. I was like, you're thinking so hard, you weren't even talking. It's the Sage card. Sage is out of place. Keiji should have been a commoner this whole time. So, why did Keiji have the Sage at the time of the fourth trade? He's lying about having Sage now. His first card was a game master. It wasn't. He had the sage all along, so he. Fuck. Oh, he didn't. He didn't have it. Oh. KG was the sage to begin with. Okay, I was looking at the wrong side of this. So, KG had sage to begin with, so he knew who the key master was. He took it from that person, gave it to me, and made it look like. Oh, he's a fucking sneaky old bitch. And then that meant he could keep the sage, so he knew where the key master went. I don't see you the key master from the beginning, which is why in the first trade you can make me trade with the first person. Hasn't he been lying this whole time? Yeah, he has, and I'm wondering why. I mean, at the end, he could have forced me to vote. If he held on to the sage, he could have force traded it back. You're really gonna vote for so. Now? Something's not right, we should discuss this a little more. Don't be stupid, you're a candidate now. If the discussion leads to you getting picked, I'm afraid too, but I just get a weird feeling. Are you sure so is really a commoner and that Keiji's the key master? Still mysteries remaining. In the fifth trade, why did someone trade for the sacrifice that I had, and the other party was a commoner? One we can ignore. We shouldn't need any more discussion. Keiji? Digging up old conclusions is just going to make us more lost. It's your turn to die, so that's how this will end. But watch it turn out that the two of them have been conspiring since the very beginning, and so has the sacrifice. No, we can't do that, Keiji. As long as we have time, we should seek the truth. Alright, let's do it. We'll discuss the roles of the four who are in the final vote. Literally Kaito versus... oh my god. The yeah. parallels. He said that... they keep saying the title, it's so exciting! Alright. How many moves Sarah sacrificed via the fifth trade? Okay, who would have known that she. Can I. I wish I could click on that right now. Please, the master so Connor, and now she can sacrifice, right?
Wait, no, what? Okay. That would have to mean that both. What do you think? What do you think? This music is so loud. Okay. You can tell. You can tell that he's thinking so hard when you stop talking. <laughs> I wish that this would allow me to like draw in here myself. Miley was talking to someone, but we don't know who. It was like Kevin, like so or something. I just saw your Fugi react. Did I get it right? What? As soon as I said, was she talking to so your Fugi immediately lit up? And one of you were like, oh. No, I'm, I'm muted my mic for a second because I was moving. Oh, okay, fair enough. I wasn't even listening. <laughs> you are thinking too hard about that. Look, I'm very suspicious. And everyone's are. betraying me. And so we really have no idea about now. Oh, no. We don't know who key, who had key master at the start. But it was somebody like I I don't think KG just did what he did with the sage just to help me. Like just for the sake of doing that. I think he did it because he didn't trust who had the key master, which makes me think it might have been so who had key master to be. Yeah, that would make sense. <clears throat> so then it would be because I don't think he would take it away from Kana. Gin has been pretty. Nobody has contested that he's just had Kana the whole time. Now has been weirdly quiet, and we don't know what Reko started on. But Reko, I think, would say like, "Hey, I was the key master at the start, and someone traded it away from me." So the only people who wouldn't. Because we mentioned the first trade repeatedly. Only reason to not mention it would be because you knew kind of what the trades ended up being. Yeah, I don't know. Someone, I think they intentionally left Rekko out of this because, you know... Oh, Rekko was going through her own thing. shit. Yeah, and I guess that would have made it confusing. But so was also working really collaboratively with now. And I don't think in a way that would reflect that like there was something bad going on there, right? Maybe. But I thought it was just the laptop thing. Not necessarily. Yeah, it was the laptop and an escape route, and I think so genuinely meant that there was an escape route. And when would they have traded over to now? Or do anything with now? Because now was with you. It would have to have been somebody who knew that I had the sacrifice. And who so who knew he had the sacrifice? KG and Q both knew I had the sacrifice and uh Okay, so KG, Q, So all knew about where the sacrifice was. Because So traded K or Q's sacrifice to me. And Eiji would have been able, like, even if he didn't know any immediately when he started working with Hugh, he probably would have mentioned it. So they knew. I don't think Reko did, I don't think Now did. Gin's been doing something else this whole time. Hana and So have been close, but there's no way that they're doing this again, right? There's no way that Kana has fallen for this a second time. Although if the sacrifice card did get thrown to her last second by So, with the goal of making her look suspicious. Or just making her be the throwaway. But then... The and sage is dangerous. Away this whole time. Like, that fifth trade is just... So wanted to be in control of the sacrifice all along. 
and I think he was more than they realized. Because yeah. right, he knew that we were awesome. frantic. He knew that things were clearly not good for me. So he might have taken the sacrifice back. Damn it. That was not seeming very persuasive at all. I was convinced the whole time that Sarah traded away the sacrifice. So fell for KG's trick. The location of the sacrifice on any other card, even though one look about the truth. He stole my tablet when he knocked me out, maybe he could have learned my card. He kept it on me at all times to avoid just that, kept it tucked beneath my clothes. Some of the tokens made it to the final vote, yeah? So, Orkana. Is there another key master? There's nothing change here. This was sent to someone else at some point? Dark Sage Power. The possibility is zero. Him not being able to refute anything is weird. Maybe he's actually accomplices with Bucket Girl and putting on an act? Okay. Because I do think it's relevant that I have Qtaro's tablet. Good job. Yeah, Qtaro, you're saying you had your tablet on you at all times, yes? <laughs> yep, take a look, it's right here. When you woke up, where was it? On the table in the last supper room. On the table? I'd call that being off, you meow! <laughs> As I thought, the tablet Qtaro has now is the spare. This tablet I picked up was lying near you when you passed out, but we don't know that was Kutaro's tablet either, necessarily. I would assume it's Kutaro's original tablet. The question is, why was it lying on the floor? So his toe took the tablet from Kutaro. What? But they're locked by fingerprints. Yeah, he was knocked unconscious. But I passed out by simply pressing the finger to Kutaro's fingerprint. So we arrive at an outrageous truth. What do you mean by that? Depending on when So looked at the tablet, he might have seen through our entire strategy. What? Worst time for it would have been after the fourth trade. That's when Kutaro had the Sage Eyed Keymaster. So I thought then he could have used Kutaro's Sage Power. No, but he didn't know that that was a power. Or at least if he did, he was yeah. really. Those have been acting really bad. Yeah, see, now he's trying to pull it back. Or not. Whenever I'm acting right now, maybe I'm telling the truth. No! Not good. Now there's a possibility that So has to sacrifice. So as it stands, there's no way we can vote for So. That doesn't mean we can just vote for Connor now either. Well, let's resume the discussion, guys. Let's discuss who it's safe to vote for. Gotta find the one with the least chance of having the sacrifice. So it's an absolute no-go. He'll most likely he's the most likely to pull this kind of trick. Between Bucket Girl and Big Sis now, is there any real difference? See, but that's the thing, is that I guess if you're so, you wouldn't want to have the sacrifice card yourself. You'd want to give it to an ally, because you know that everyone is suspicious as shit of you. Like, unless. I think the only way it still gets voted out is if we know for a fact Sacrifice got knocked out in the first round. How am I supposed to keep track of the tokens? Can I choose now or... Like, yeah, I don't know where I'm supposed to see all of the tokens that are still left. I think you're supposed to know. Okay, let me just... Tokens. Gin and Sarah basically had none. I know they mentioned it at some point how many tokens people had, but that was so long ago. We know that Kutaro had the most, but then he apparently gave all of them the KG, but held on to 50. Which meant so, KG had 100. So well, that's so hard. Oh wait, no, yeah, Kutaro gave his tokens to So. What? Kutaro gave 100 to So, and then he got 50 or something. Unless, I don't know, which part, whatever part he was lying about. Or if he is lying, I don't even know. Wait. If it would let me look at the like I haven't seen that in ages. What is everyone else saying? Oh, 
Oh, I made this token now. But I had a lot because now only had a little. But that's not necessarily true. What do you mean it's not necessarily true? Okay. Missing tokens as of right now, I think. Because we don't know what happened to Alice, and we don't know what happened to Sarah's. Somebody had however many tokens we had, they were able to use those if they wanted to. But it also could have just- I don't know. Nobody's reacting, are they? Okay, thank god. That was a bit of a shock. I was gonna say, don't, don't... Well, it's only don't two who are mentioning hard. the tokens. But yeah. I, I don't know. I, like, Gin says, now hardly yeah, had any tokens. Don't overthink this one, Viv. Now the one with the least likelihood? Wait, please. This isn't right. Big says now. Least likelihood. Are you gonna kill me with such vague reasoning? Please, have another discussion. You're right, we can't end this discussion. You? What are you saying? I just remembered something. Oh, of course you did. There's a way anyone can get tokens. Miss Sarah, you know it too, don't you? I mean, my stolen wallet. Well, there's a possibility that you just misplaced all your klutz, Miss Sarah. Okay. Tokens from Alice. Fine, whatever. Fuck you. Fixes now wouldn't do such a thing now. But it's true, when I went to check the body, the tokens were already gone. And now was closely inspecting the room of lives. I think just now we could have done it. Couldn't any of us have gotten those tokens? In other words, everyone had the potential to possess the sacrifice. It all ends with a game of trust. And that last action is going to be the key. What were each of us doing at the time of the fifth trade? Hope we can find the sacrifice. Now to determine based on Sokana's and Nao's actions right at the time of the fifth trade. But I'm serious thinking. You were sitting with Reko, weren't you? No, we can believe that one for once. Yeah, and there's a voting booth right there. So was in the winner's room. Now... Plus Reko... Stairs... Kana... KG was at the rubble. And you came back and saw me. You can see those three now. How's that all searching? Yeah, yeah. There's a smartphone on the stairs. I don't even make all those uses for escape. You had that smartphone. Hiding something. Uh, I'm to think of it. I feel like you were the only one I didn't see around then. Really, where were you? I mean, I was looking for something I dropped. I mean, we're gonna extract everyone else's, but. I'll bring a box right in front of me. What do you think, Miss Sarah? I can't take this claim seriously. Can anyone react to this? No, you didn't. You didn't pass by me once. I know what now was doing in that time. No, I hope I'm escaping. Man. Also, you weren't on the stairs by the time we got there. I don't think it's true. Sarah, please save me. I almost exited the window because I'm dumb. Okay. <laughs> So Reko left. But she says she left now, but we didn't we didn't walk past her at any point. We didn't mention that, and we would have had to have. Um, 
I mean... Connor was in a smartphone you lost. How did you know? Fair enough. But it's the same smartphone I found in Connor's first trial room. Again, tell me, where did you pick that up? There's ways down the stairs now. How clumsy. She must have dropped it while we were all climbing the stairs, surely. Are you protecting Kana? That's not it. Think back for me. When we were climbing the stairs, So and Kana were walking in front. If she had dropped the phone then, everyone would have noticed. In short, this was only dropped after we all climbed up to the exit. Kana dropped it while descending the stairs. What did she descend for? Why are you trying to hide this, Kana? Because, thanks to Sarah, there's a message on this phone now. Alright, that's what Kana's sister. I love you, sister. It's Kana's turn to protect her big sister because that's how Kana can atone. So she's the sacrifice. Mm. That last trade was her running to protect her big sister. How she learned that... Mm, Thank you, I love you, sister. Now it's Kana's turn to protect your big sister because that's how Kana can atone. Please give that back. Did you write this, Kana? Kana's big sister's already dead. Could it be the sister in this message is... No way. Her sister in heaven? No. Sarah? Oh, uh, sure <gasps> not. Oh, no. Is that right, Kana? Your sister here... is me. Yes. I know it's strange, but Kana, to Kana, you're... So you wanted to save Sarah that much? Yes. Hey, Kana. Was it you who traded away Sarah's sacrifice? To avoid using the ring of box in the winner's room, you returned to the third floor to trade. Hey, now you're talking like Kana's... You're saying she took the sacrifice to protect Sarah? That's so... It's inconceivable. No, I don't want to conceive of it. Deny it, Kana. What worth this reasoning? It's all a load of... No, it's all correct. You idiot, don't say anything! Kana did the fifth trade. She won't hide the truth anymore. Kana... He's panicking because that means he knows he's it. Because the he's only others left... Yeah, it's the key master, it's the sage, and it's the sacrifice up there with him. Or no, the sage isn't up there with him, because the sage would have been vulnerable, but Kitaro is not anymore. So now is a commoner. Hmm. Anna did it. She really did it to protect me. She took the sacrifice for herself. This is just the worst outcome. Self-sacrifice, Kana. So you caught on at some point, didn't you? That's why you're trying to move the vote towards Kana. Uh, since there's no other way for Kana to survive. Please wait. Do listen carefully to what Kana has to say. With the fifth trade, Kana switched her card in Sarah's. When she knew escape wasn't possible anymore, she had no idea what to call. Oh. Then she looked at the phone. Seeing her sister's words calmed her heart. And she came to despise herself for not being able to do anything. This whole time, Kana had just kept betraying her sister, the others, Sarah. Oh. She just had a feeling that So had sent the sacrifice to Sarah. Kana doesn't get the complicated trade talk. She can't even reason out who gave who what. Even so, she was certain of just one thing. Because Sarah is so kind, she couldn't trade the sacrifice to any- Oh, well, we were trying. Oh. Kana. Kana. Kana! She didn't want to let Sarah die. And also, she didn't want to make So a murderer. <laughs> well, oh. Well. I mean, I guess he's not going to be a murderer. That seemed more painful than her own death. So she traded her commoner for Sarah's sacrifice. Kana. But... The card she received was a common. Was there a sixth trade? Was I right all along? What? What's going on here, Kana? Kana doesn't understand either. She should have traded cards with Sarah, but it wasn't the sacrifice. Okay, what is Kana saying? 
she sent the sacrifice to somebody else, didn't she? By accident. So she thought she'd oh, received yeah. a different card. Anyway, we have to talk about Kana's statement. So who did you give that card to then? I can't believe Bucket Girl. She's lying, trying to confuse us. And the mess up who she's trading with? The unique situation caused the world to just disappear. Is it possible, I wonder? Can't trust electronics for shit. That's how the error in the trade got messed up. I wonder if so hacked the bull cards and he did say he had hacked the bull cards. Can't see really the truth in their hearts right now. I have to find the objective truth, the truth. I bet he saw her trying to trade the sacrifice to herself and block it or something. And he made her send just, it to someone else. Either send it to someone else or just deleted it as a sacrifice. Like maybe Ooh. just remove the sacrifice card altogether. Intriguing. But they also did say early on that the icons had changed, the appearance of the cards had changed. <clears throat> so maybe so it changed what the card looked like, but not what the card actually was. So it's hardly saying anything. I can't read his thoughts. Maybe Khan is just messed up who she was trading with or something. I don't know how the ring up boss should work, but if you're just saying names with the receiver, there could be mistakes. Yeah, my sacrifice definitely moved. I think Kana's mistake, then. Maybe the floor master purposely changed the destination, something like that. Gosh, you changed the trade? I'm trying to think. I'm really talking about some transgression. Mm -hmm. Oh. That is true. Not a lot of convincing. Shh. The card didn't end. Is that even possible? Because I mean, there isn't anyone but so who could cause an irregularity, is there? This is fun. I do like this trial a lot. So... It's a think funk. What? It's making you think funk. It is. Because I do think it's notable that... Now hasn't... possibility. Something separate from So's hacking. And an irregularity definitely occurred. The transgression by Floor Master Gashu. Yeah. Say what? Yeah, because fucking Watermelon Milkshake Lady didn't say a fucking word when we called her in. Remember what Miley said before the main game? Gashu, are you listening? You've really gone and mucked things up. You made a flagrant transgression, one that shakes the very core of the main game. And despite being such a huge transgression, it hasn't shown itself at all thus far. And now, there's a logical movement of the cards that's tormenting us. Could this very issue be Gashu's transgression? We believe Kana's our only explanation. Saying the coot tampered with the card movement? To the floor master, what would, merit, uh, what would be the merit of doing that? Some sort of merit. That's why Gashu pushed us through the argument. His goal could be made clear, maybe we'd know who he moved the sacrifice to, that is. The double negative is given way to a proof positive gash, I'm afraid. Quite the off the mark inference. Is it alright for you to be using your time on this? Gosh. If you haven't engaged in any misconduct, then promise us. Hmm? I know the floor master's code. If we can expose your transgression, this main game won't count. We demand a second attempt 24 hours later. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you just know everything, don't you? That's to be expected from Miss Sarah Chiruin. Promise or no promise, I will simply carry out my duty as per the code. For real? 24 hours, we can make another shot at escape. But are you certain? If you cannot prove it, you will not, or you'll only be losing time to spend another reasoning. Okay, this new possibility we've spun. This theory wasn't being directed at Gashu. So please tell us the truth. 
The other possibility is that you did some sort of hacking to the roll card, so if we can or if we know whether that claim is true or not, we can fight. So I'll combine forces to win an extension. Connor. Yes? You really don't have the sacrifice? It's okay. Kana really doesn't have the sacrifice. Let's see. I didn't access the roll cards! I didn't do any hacking to them! So, that's the truth, Miss Sarah. No lies, no tricks. Alright, let's quit deceiving each other. Let's work to expose Gashu's turn. No, you hacked and you know the rules as well as I do. That's what I wanted to hear. This is a turning point in our destiny. A path we could have never reached if we were trapped by endless suspicion. A path of us all trusting each other and battling the kidnappers head on. Together, we'll expose Gashu's misdeed. See, I don't know if I believe okay. that. Although it does sound pretty optimistic right now. Yeah. Oh, God, Gosh, what's something to gain from tampering with the trade? I think if the sacrifice go to someone he wants to kill, or else you think someone else who Gosh didn't want to die. See, that's the they want to protect Sarah, but I don't understand why. Answering the clues we have left. Fundamental issue: maybe the sacrifice wasn't actually sent to anybody. See, that's also probably true. Chandra's are making the sacrifice vanish. Seems unthinkable, sure, but it's just one possibility. There's something curious about the antagonism between Gashu and Mylan. Answering the clues we have left, the evidence we've seen so far is anything related to this transgression. I haven't... I didn't... If it's Kana, then so did it. If in reality, Gosh is an ally. Oh my god, ally! That's why so you put a stop to the main game. Is that too unthinkable? Seeing if there's any reactions real quick, because I didn't really look at that. There weren't. There weren't? No. I feel like we've gone through all of our items. I kind of told you what to do already. This is some new evidence that hasn't come up in discussion. I don't see any leads. Yet unused evidence. Everything has been used that we have. Except for, I mean, I guess... Are you sure? The tablet has been used, stun gun has been- oh. Is the stun gun the- What are you talking about? We did we talked about the stun gun, didn't we? We talked about the tablet, we never discussed how he got it. We did use the tablet. Remember? We used the we tablet remember. on him to figure that out. But we didn't use the mm -hmm. stun gun on him, did we? Oh no, we used the stun- never mind, that's right. We used the stun gun on So to be like, hey. Mm -hmm. You're on the right track. Someone still has the sacrifice card. There were nine votes. Gay dance in the meantime, because you can figure this out. Oh god. That's scary. Also, hi Danny, thank you, I'm glad you enjoyed the video. Is it a bit of, actually, wait, yeah. keep, that's reminding me, I should check the comments really quickly before I forget. You're, also, you're on the right track. 
Yes. Someone just left a comment and said, Oh wow, you definitely are a Somber man. I can't believe you trick random players into rank this morphia with a bronze take. You'll be judged at the pearly oh gates God. on Life Weaver's chest. I think it was a compliment. I think they meant because it was a very. I think they meant it as a, a compliment that I tricked them so well. As a question, always the same compliment. I want to be able to point out that, like, I don't know if this is right, but, like, what are you thinking? No. That does disprove your point, though. The sacrifice was sent to some, or had to have been sent to someone because there's nine votes. That's not what the problem is right now. You're overthinking. What was the question that we're trying to solve currently, Viv? What was Gashu's motive? And what was Kana talking about? A piece of evidence that hasn't been brought up yet, the four papers? Is it the one that we haven't used, talked about yet? We talked about the victim video, we talked about- yeah, so the four papers would be the one that we haven't talked about, right? I don't know, is it? God damn you told me. You know I'm not gonna tell you. I got enough clout. <laughs> I don't really get how that works, for sure. Well, likely it hasn't been used yet as this roster. Looks kind of familiar. This is like the torn paper I found on the first floor, meow. What use can this have? Why... why do you have that? Oh, okay, that's... Oof. Miley... Cursor. Handing internal documents to participants. Internal documents? Gosh, just what is this roster? <laughs> what indeed. Found the fact that I don't know what this means. You did good, Sarah. Huh? Gash just made a slip of the tongue and freaked him out. Whatever could you mean. Kai was a whole lot better at playing dumb, huh? Many of these papers have, I can't even guess, but there's value in solving the mystery. Right, let's talk to anything suspicious about this roster. Who's absent from it? Four bound sheets, four names on each sheet. Besides their names, a bunch of names I've never even heard. Most of them seem to be sorted by name. Looks like there are participants whose names aren't on this, huh? The roster, it's reminding me of something. Keiji, Kana, Tana. So isn't on it. Maybe we found that out earlier. So now is on it, right? Uh, now is not on it. No, now is it? Could be a fifth one. Never even heard it. Gromada, Hayasaka, Kanashi, Sugur, or Surugi. Uh, Sun Bayansi. 
Thank you, Danny. No worries if you have to head out. I know it's busy. But I do really appreciate you stopping by, and thank you for the kind words on the video. And other people, I don't know. It was that in the first hall before they could meet us? It might be it. Mmm. Do they match up with the roster of people that we saw before? Fuck. I mean, I did write down the names of a couple of those people. Of 16 people. I think we are missing one sheet. There's too much of a gap between Alice and Mai. Because we're also missing Joe. Joe wasn't on this list. Was and Kai on there? I also wasn't. So that fourth list, or that fifth sheet, if it exists, could be Kai, Joe, So, and Kana. And they would all between, be between 6.6 .6 and 7.5, I think, because that's really the only gap that's... Oh no, we, we added this up. This adds up to 100, doesn't it? Mm. Hmm. So if that all adds up to 100, what would that mean? Does that mean that those four aren't meant to be part of it? Or that they weren't part of this roster? And we know that about Joe. Someone has mentioned that. Because they said that, like, don't bring him... Like, to Kai, they said don't bring him along or whatever. Or if we think in math terms. Bess, you've seen what I do with math. You've seen the charts. Alice also isn't... Wait. Actually, okay, well, okay let me too. look at all the people who aren't on there that I have names for. Anzu. Anzu is on there. Uh, Kana is on... Or Kana isn't. We know that. Gin is... I mean, no, Kana is on there. What am I saying? Kana is... Uh, Alice isn't. Uh, Kugi... Are they not on there either? So there's also... Kugi... Sarah is on there. Joe isn't... Now. Now isn't on there, we already figured that. Or, wait, no, now he's on there, right? No, what? Why did I... Oh, I think I fucked up and wrote down Kana when I meant now. Okay. Now isn't... Nako is on there. Maru. He's on there. Kai. Joe. So. Alice. Now. And then someone named Kugi that we don't seem to know about. Maybe you don't know who Kugi is. He. That name appeared on the list on the blackboard. Oh, Alice I'm is on there. Sure they they mentioned. I'm pretty sure they mentioned who Kuki is. But I won't say just in case. Someone's real name? Nope. Well, it is someone's real name. I'm gonna check something first before I continue that statement. <laughs> like, I need to make sure I'm gaslighting you in the right direction here. I mean, either way, even if we know that... Even if we have met that person before, they're not in here. Was he one of the people in the victim video? No. Yeah, technically. Technically. Oh no, actually no. No, you didn't see a video of that, did you? 
Oh, okay, so this is relevant. So I already have a list of people who can. Can drink. Alice. Hi. Okay, so I was right about Kuki. They're not on this list, and I had that- okay. This is important information. Is that useful now? I'm just gonna say it's not important. You're gonna say what? You said it's not important. Um, do you mean the five people I've figured out? I wonder. So what did you just say? Huh? There are four people's names missing. Now, Kai, So, Kugi, Joe, and Now aren't listed, so that's five! I guess I rushed and miscounted, sorry. Kugi is your real name, then, isn't it? So, hey, no. do we really need to worry? Oh, is it records? <laughs> Anyways, it's not no. important. Do we really need to worry? Don't worry about Kugi. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Okay. Do we really need to worry about little mistakes right now? That mistake isn't just a trivial issue. Why would so get it wrong? That's what's important. Gosh, tell us how many dra participants were dragged into the death game. That would be 20. There are 16 on the roster, plus five who aren't. Doesn't that add up to 21? And too many. What's that mean now? There are exactly 20 names on the blackboard. Well, let's compare the names on the paper roster with those on the blackboard. Blackboard names are like this. Five listed, or five not listed on the roster are Kai, So, Kugi, Joe, Now. Let's remove those five. First sheet. Second sheet. Third sheet. Sumiki or Tsukimi is the only person not on the board. We've derived a 21st person. Is that So's real name? Who the hell is this? One of us. Calm down. What does that mean exactly? Alias? Someone's using an alias. Let's see. Shin Tsukimi is one of us. Maybe we wrote their alias on the blackboard. No way. <laughs> Interesting, if you follow that logic, Shinsukimi has already been identified. Say what? Sarah, let's work this out. If all the names on the paper roster are real, there's someone whose real name hasn't been revealed. There'd be someone not on the, the roster. Mm -hmm. People not on the paper roster. Kai, So, Kugi, Joe, or Now? There you are. My real name. Professor Mishima always called me Miss Now. Yeah, now is crazy. Real name. It was written there at the prize exchange, right? Kugi is the yeah. name. Oh, okay. That's why I didn't want to say it because I'm like, I wasn't sure if they said it was her sister. Yeah. The girl Joe was using her fake name. They said Sarah would have figured out right away. This is fucking. Guy's name is on the laptop. There's some email logs. It should be his real one. If you want to check the roster? Come tell Mr. Policeman anytime. Yeah, that's why I didn't tell you. I was like, I'm, I don't think it's important, but that's her sister. I saw him flash. They didn't use names, they used photographs. What's the matter, KG? I was impressed by how calmly he could lie. Hey, Kiva, yeah, the music is great. Why? Sarah, recall the prize exchange. The prize exchange? Huh. Remember, there were photos, but no names anywhere. 
Is that right? I must have had it wrong. So, what exactly are you afraid of? Right, so is... You said you'd tell the truth, right? To defeat Gashi together. We're your allies. Try trusting us, so... No. Shin Tsukimi. So is Shin Tsukimi. I want to trust you all too. But I... Oh, he's trying to say something. In that case, I'll draw it out. Let me put down my notebook. Oh god. Oh, no. Things are falling over again. I'm glad that missing doesn't come with like seemingly a bunch of penalties. Because I'm kind of just praying and praying here. In fact, there is a an auto click mode. Oh well. I'm pretty good at this. I know. I'm it, just saying. It's Undertale. Oh no. This is the moment <laughs> to reveal your true self. I. My real name is Shin Tsukimi. I'll tell you everything, even the secret of that roster. You know about it? Yeah. Because that's exactly the same as what I got in my first trial. What do you say? Tell us what the heck does this thing mean? It's the victory rates for the participants in the death game. Weird percentages on the left, right? I mean, yeah, that that felt pretty obvious. But I wonder if that means they've run through this a few times with dolls, based on our personalities. Or maybe we're also dolls, that could be the case too. But, I mean, that would explain why that machine can remove our memories. We might all just be dolls. Dumbass, how would they figure that out? They tested it with AIs. These AIs have run tests. Wait, they ran simulations of innumerable death games, all done entirely digitally. Oh, okay. They explained at horrible length to me how accurate this data was. I saw my own percentage. Zero percent. Certain death. I absolutely can't survive this death game. That's why I had to abandon myself. I don't want to die. I can't stop shaking. I'm going to be killed. Everyone will vote for me and kill me. I don't want that. Hey. Hi. A shadow illuminated by light spoke to me. Just a random question, but you know what a majority vote is. He talked to me and cornered me. Okay, then let's go. It hurts. Stop. Strength in numbers. You're a helpless sheep who will be eaten by the strong. If you don't want to die, you change. I... <laughs> I threw Shin Tsukimi away. So, oh. Dear me, what a heart-wrenching tale. The time has expired. My time? Sorry, it's nearly time for voting. Hold on a sec, our discussion! Did you make any progress? It was all unrelated to my transgression. Revealing the truth of the roster. Did that make any progress? That's... Hey, so. Got any more info on the roster? If I did, I wouldn't hide it now. Sir, is there any other evidence that proves his transgression? Dolls don't bleed, yeah. But they did just run the AI. Okay. There has to be some evidence, right? <laughs> Every time I've accused you of gaslighting for the last few weeks, you've been like, oh, that's so unfair of you to say that. <laughs> I'm not even saying anything. I'm just making noises. You certainly are just making I noises. I don't know what you're talking about. Maybe I just want you to make your your decisions for yourself. I mean, the evidence should be in the fact that there was a card swap. And also, Miley literally said. I haven't played that. Let's so hear What would that be?
I wrong? Are you? The stun gun, we don't know how they got it. You think a stun gun is a transgression? How is he? Someone had to give it to him. Hmm. Interesting. Providing weapons to one contestant or another would be skewing the game. Mayhaps, mayhaps. There's nothing, no way. You're hopeless, maybe there's nothing else we can do. Are you giving up, Sarah? Was there nothing I was just, he was supposed to interrupt? You're going yes. blackboard and also. God damn it, I hate this. I destroyed my own monitor <laughs> in the monitor room. I told you everything just like I swore, so please save me. When is the next dungeon, please? Of course I will. So stress me. A real bond. Of course I will, Sarah. Sarah. Our last chance. Doesn't matter what. Find something connected to this transgression. Yeah, I know. Hmm. <laughs> this is why I told you. You need to make your own decisions. This I don't think it's important. The illusion of choice isn't a choice to begin with. Got it? Is Ross less this? Okay, hold on. Let me just... I gotta reply that so much. The music is also a bot. Fun. Chance of victory by running simulations with AIs, right? It's not like these sheets were still overlooking. The 16 names makes you wonder, right? If so is an alias, that means there's actually four not listed, right? Kai, Kiri, Joe, and Now are, not, are the four not on the roster. I'm curious how Sarah's chance of victory are the highest, huh? She's been overlooking. I don't know if everyone's real names, but. I gotta trust her. The occupations. So wasn't a job hopper then. He was self employed. She isn't. But she must not be because she can't drink. Are you looking at Kogi for? Not sure. Let's just extract some more. I use the words candidates and not participants. Not there's any difference. This term is distinctly the maybe. Who 
who got AI as better? Good. There's a Mishima one. So both of those have been broken. There's Sarah. There wasn't one for Joe. There was one for Kana. Or no, who else who are the There wasn't one for Kai. There's one for Alice, there's one for Rico, there is one for for Gin. There's one for Kitaro, because we won't talk about drinking. Um there's a cagey one. to start and there were only nine monitors, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. They didn't have Joe and they didn't have Kai. Mind you, there was 11 to start, but then they added in Atlas. There was a Kana one, but there... No, was there not a Kana one? No, there wasn't a... There wasn't a now one, was there? Was there? I should run over the Oh, okay. Well that makes that easier. <laughs> Trying to fucking like I mean to be fair. I, I did remember it correctly. Mishima and Sos were broken. And Joe and Kai were killed, but now... And it's who survived the first trial. Can you piece together what's going on here? I feel like I'm getting further away from it. Because if there isn't one for now, that means she wasn't supposed to survive and Mishima was. What is... Mm, no, I'm not gonna... Mm -hmm. No, you'll figure it out. Just keep playing the game. I'm not gonna push. Just think, think about why it's relevant. That is all. at the overthinking phase. Well, because, okay. Yeah, what are you thinking? What are you thinking? What, what I is think your mind at right now? Reckless point about the dolls isn't a bad idea. Right. Now and... might have died at some point. No, that wouldn't make any sense. I that... well, would now have died at one point. I mean, now could have just always been a doll. Perhaps. Or she might have killed herself at some point in the first game when she was losing her mind over the professor. Perhaps. Or... I'm guiding me towards an answer, and I don't know. I'm trying to tell you it's not the right answer, but keep going. Okay. I don't want to say it because it'll make sense once you just keep playing. Just 
think about why now is relevant and what we were trying to solve. What answers don't you have yet? Now is not a real candidate, is she? Is she? Is she now? Hand it to survive. Look at you go. I'm so dumb. <laughs> Look, but there are 10 alternate universes where this game was made differently, and I did solve all of those. So, like, uh, I'm winning this game across the multiverses. Uh, okay, so what was your chance of winning this game, huh? My odds of winning this game? Bitch, it's the same yeah. as... With We've talked about my odds of Survivor are, I'm either going home first or I'm winning. I think that's my odds in a death game. I'm either fucking up mm. first and badly, or I'm going to go all the way. Doesn't it kind of really the same? <laughs> Participants, those are the 20 people who were brought into this death game. What are the candidates? Those left in the final vote. What? What are the candidates, Viv? There you go, because that's why they're percentages. In mind, if Gashi was first loyal to the organization, were to make a transgression. He'd try to kill a non-candidate. One of us didn't have a right to victory, a non-candidate. Mm -hmm. That's why he gave it to- Okay, yeah, so I was right about the fact that, like, it's weird that nobody's acknowledged him now. Who here is not a candidate. Joe was a non-candidate because he wasn't supposed to be here. Mm -hmm. Kai was a non-candidate because he was a betrayer. I don't mm -hmm. really get what Kugi did to be in that position. I couldn't tell you. I'm sure that it'll come up at some point later. I told cool. you not to worry about Kugi. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. And so now is the only <laughs> person who has the possibility to be a non-candidate. So the goal was to eliminate all the non-candidates as fast as possible, I'm guessing. They were the sacrificial lambs. Now, yes? You have the sacrifice, don't you? Uh huh? This roster lists the name of the candidates, those are qualified for victory. Even Shinsukimi, with a 0% chance to actually win, is listed. But now, out of us survivors, you're the only one whose name is missing. And in the monitor room, too, there is no AI of you. No, there didn't exist now AI to begin with. Because you were an outsider who didn't meet the qualifications to be a candidate. And so Gashu tried to kill you. He sent the sacrifice with its high risk of death to now. That was your transgression, Gashu. <laughs> fantastic, simply fantastic. Well done, Miss Sarah. Such a rolling mind power and all your cooperation, your unity. You solved it. You solved Gashu's shoddy quiz. Yes, indeed, you are the chosen one. It's over. All the energy is leaving me. A long, long discussion. At the end, we earned it. Victory. A moment's survival. I'm sorry, everyone. I kept quiet about the sacrifice the whole time. When I thought about what would happen if we weren't able to expose him, I just couldn't say it. I wish you'd been brave. I mean, it isn't her fault. At the end of the day, like, there's no reason why she should have had that card. No one tried to give it to her except for them. It's not your fault now. All the fault lies with Gashu. Answering Gashu. Candidates, this death game, what's all of it mean? I will say but one thing. Everyone, have you ever harbored doubts about your upbringing? Huh? That is my first and last- what the fuck? Don't you just love cryptic messages? It's not even a message. Last, Miss Sarah Chiduin, you've overlooked something important about the Floor Master's code. About the code. It is written clearly. Or, if there is misconduct during the main game, it either proceeds with the transgressor's death, or must be retried in 24 hours. Huh? And I promise you I would fulfill my duty as per the code. Oh! 
Yeah. I take responsibility. It's an or statement. Well, I just thought it was weird because they made the. It was because of how she read it earlier that was throwing me off of that. Because they said like, "Oh, tr participants die, four masters get killed." No, like maybe there's translation error. I can't stop everyone! Please earn victory. Wow, healer's like, yeah, I'm fully just gonna shoot myself in the head. We're gonna keep going. No, wait, this is. Oh, he's all gas you. No, no. It's impossible to be over. Why? Why this? Who's gonna do this from the start? Why? There's a day's extension. We hung on stubbornly and put our lives on the line. And gosh, you casually threw away his life. It's just assumed. Yeah, see, that's, I, I think you're right, Nisio. I think I. I assumed it was a translation error. But this game, like, hasn't had many of those, so I don't know why I assumed not. Maybe the cable sent He's a demon. A demon! And that shouldn't have. Blin. Please, it's an emergency, right? Suspend the main game! Can't do that. I can only act as a substitute. No. You're really gonna continue? This is all within the rules. If I refuse, everyone will die. Right. This isn't right at all. I'm begging you. It doesn't have to be 24 hours. At least let us retry. Sorry. I'll do anything. Anything. Just please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ugh. Now. Now is the sacrifice. No one will vote for her. And we need to choose two. One of the commoners. So or Kana. the sacrifice i'm the key master we can only vote for so arcana i guess it's clear who to vote for oh. don't forget to save yeah i know don't worry <laughs> that was what i've been saying with every sentence in this game let's talk now sacrifice my vote for arcana i mean everyone um, don't you vote for kana it's clear who will vote for. I'm tired. As much as I contribute, everyone's gonna choose me, right? Oh, may someone save me. Or now is just fucked. Yeah, now is just waiting for her execution, which is brutal. I was gonna say, I don't know how I didn't notice before the 11037. Why don't you I don't know what to do about any of this. <laughs> oh, this one isn't really clear. Do you want? Is it? I put these two versus each other, or yeah, yeah. That was kind of what I was gonna. Yeah. That was what I was planning to do. It's not very clear that you're supposed to, because they don't really relate. The other two just don't do anything at all. Huh? Mm -hmm. What are you? Please vote for Kana. What are you saying, Kana? I'm sure, you understand. Between so and Kana, which of us isn't necessary? Stupid! Don't say that. Kana already intended to die from the moment she tried to trade for Sarah's sacrifice. Kana. Please, this is about the only thing Kana can do. No. In exchange, I want you to believe in So. Because he's really not a bad person. Why can't I say anything? Kana's throwing her life away to protect So. I'm just gonna watch in silence. Kana. Don't be ridiculous, Kana. No. Oh. Self-sacrifice? That's worthless. You really are a kid, Kana. Thoughtless kid with a backwards notion that if she dies, it'll solve everything. My feelings won't change. Be quiet, Fauna. Guys, we have our conclusion. Hurry up and vote! Sarah, you hated me from deep down, right? Aren't I awful? You won't get another chance like this. So, Kana doesn't have any wisdom and can't even hack. <laughs> Poor baby. <laughs> I told you to shut up, Kana. Please remember the first main game. We all chose Kai as the victim. For our survival, we didn't choose by feelings, but logic. But wasn't that a mistake? Real failure is wavering. Not trusting your beliefs is weakness. Not it. And this time, the right thing to do is choose logic so you can escape. You should choose Kana. Yes, stop it. Oh. It's time to vote. I cannot wait any longer. Touch your voting tablets or everyone will die. Got it. That's super reason. Just voted for Kana. AG. Thank you very much. It's not a joke. I'm ashamed of you, KG. Sacrificing the kid for the sake of adults. It's a demonic choice you can't make. I'm voting for so. 
They're gonna tie the vote. Alright, Kitaro. Now is gonna say she's giving one of her votes to each person. I don't think is a burden at all. My vote is for so. I mean, now if we just vote for ourselves, that's three to two. Game should be an easy choice for you to make, right? I do hate the loner. I feel like I wanted to die. If you don't choose me, I'll use you next and get you killed. Wow. Save again. You don't have to take responsibility again. This is sad. If you vote for Kana, it'll be tied 3 to 3. Your vote won't cause anyone to die. And Big Sister, your vote will. It's okay again. I'll take responsibility. Oh, yeah, I guess now could also vote for herself, but like, there's no reason for her to. There's no point, because it would just end up even no matter what. Yeah. Unless you wanted to screw the votes, but there's no real point in doing that. It's just me. My vote will decide everything. It'll decide it all. Uh -huh. You did it, Sarah. Now? Do you remember the conditions for the sacrifice to win? The sacrifice wins even if it's a tie for first. Oh, right. So has three. Kana has three. And as a sacrifice, I can vote for myself twice. If you vote for me, that's three votes for everyone. I can win by a tie for first. Let's return home together, Sarah. Makes it Sarah, you wouldn't do that, right? I mean, obviously, we're not going to do what she's saying. I'm sorry now, but, like... Just know that there is an alternate ending if you do choose to. I know there is, but... <laughs> what are you going to choose? If I voted for Keiji, those two would be tied. Do they both die? Uh, I don't know if the game will let you do that. I don't think the game lets you choose Kishi. Because it stipulated the rules for a, or for a tie earlier. If the key master is tied, key master takes priority. But if these I, two are tied, they're, they're not key tied? master. They're not key master nor sacrifice. I know. I'm saying like the only rules they stipulated about ties so far, I think, were that the key master were relating to the key master and the sacrifice. So you want both of them? You want three people to die? Viv. How could you? It's Kana's wish. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, no one died in the tie? Oh dear. Thank you, Sarah. Why didn't you choose me? I'll never forgive you, Sarah. Sarah, before I go... Um... You give me a hug? No. <laughs> You're warm. Well then, I'll announce the results. The key master was Keiji Shinogi. The sage was Kitaro Burgerberg. The sacrifice was now Egokoro. I see. So this is your answer, Sarah. No. Strange. It couldn't stop shaking from fear, but the moment you decided, that stopped. I'm glad. I'm glad I didn't have to betray you all. No. I'm glad I can. You saying that? If you weren't around now, I. Thank you. No. I wonder if I'll meet the professor over there. Oh. oh. I wanted to finish that painting. I'm over almost six hours, holy shit. Well then. I mean, we could have done this in three hours if I wasn't so fucking bad at figuring out problems. But anyways, time for the execution. <laughs> Wait. Miss Sarah, take this. Oh, not again. It's an instant death switch. Unless you want her suffering to be long, you just have to press it. What is... What's happening to her? He's getting crushed. I don't want to die. You're dying either way. Let me just end it. You know this game won't let you do that. 
It'll only drag it out longer. Uh, now expired. I really love they keep making this Sarah's fault. Oh, not this scene. Oh, Professor, I'm sorry. The presents I was going to give you, I still couldn't finish it. That's all right. We have plenty of time now. Yes. Oh. Mm. And that's only the first step. Uh, couldn't push. The, okay, well, to be fair, I did push the button many times. No way I could push it. Once again, I couldn't protect them. They died again. Ugh. Next is Kana. Wait, stop it. Please, Zephyrin. Where? Th oh, right. I guess we did kind of just forget there was a gun on the ground there. That's Gashu's. Come near Kana, I'll shoot. It's futile. Kana's execution won't be changing. Why? Ain't you different from Gashu and Miley? You carried out her execution with such a pained look. You don't really want this, do you? You don't understand, do you? I've always been your enemy, you see. I'm coming closer. Oh. Gun letter to click. Yeah, there will only be one. It was empty, I see. Damn you. It's fine now. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Sarah. Anna, please take care of so everyone get along together. Activating collar device. The human flower. My neck hurts. Just now, human flower seeds were injected by your necklace through your body. Stop, stop. What are you doing? Please be at ease. She won't suffer like Miss Al. The roots will spread through her body, and feeling a comforting numbness, she'll die beautifully. Now they will bloom. My god. Not the hearts. Kind of expired. This is how the chosen one meets her end. So long as the flowers don't wilt, her body will always be preserved beautifully. I'm sorry, Kana. We needed so to escape. I chose logic, the worst possible choice. I... I don't know why I defended him. Kill you. Yeah, you're mad. Worthless, it's all worthless. Poor Master Sarah, <laughs> another riffraff. Well, every one of you who killed Kana. That's right, and first will be Sarah. Okay, well... Cool, I guess. Good luck with that. Whenever so is. Search around my mind days. I can save now or Kana. I don't care, I don't want to look at that reality anymore. For now I'll look for so... I don't... Oh, it won't even let me save here. Oh. Yeah, no, you won't. Yeah, I gotta have to play it out. My feet moved as if guided by something. Some sort of premonition is calling me. I don't like this. How bad is it about to get for me? Oh. Oh, is this? Oh, it might get bad. But if it's then, if it's the part I'm thinking of. Okay, we're going to turn down the volume a little bit and cover up the screen. Hi, Krim. I do need a hug. I may have killed a child, but now I'm going to get scared, so I'm the real victim. I wonder what it is. Gaze at the screen absentmindedly. Oh, hi, Joe. Yo, Sarah. So kind of joke again. With a familiar face. The face of my best friend who I always saw at school. Joe. Inconceivable. Another hallucination. I've finally broken down. There shouldn't be an AI of Joe. Also, I've turned down the volume so much. Probably if you're going to talk, you might have to yell. Or at least for them to hear you. I'm not right now. Joe, is that you, Joe? Yep, this looks like you've been well. You murderer. Yeah? I should have understood this. It's a hallucination, a false joy created. Wait, I... 
shouldn't respond to it. Let me hear it. Who'd you kill this time? I didn't kill, but I ignore it. You voted, didn't you? You sacrificed someone weaker than you to survive. No, what's wrong, Joanne? This isn't Joe. Sarah, you really changed. I don't like it. I can't breathe. I'm being killed by my hallucinations. What's your excuse for this time, Sarah? Ugh. Neither of these is a good answer, is it? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Uh -oh. No. No. Joe. Don't show yourself to me, please. Just give me a break. Forgive me. Can't do that, Sarah. You know how much I suffered? I'll show you once more. Yeah. Oh. We're going. Yeah. Last thing I want to remember Joe's end. Uh. Sarah's kind of struggling a little bit. I wonder if maybe the simula- Oh! Sarah! Are you okay, Sarah? KG. Are we past the bad part? Thanks. Yeah, that was the worst of it. Oh, that was really not that bad at all. Okay, I thought it was going to be a whole lot of- That's fine. I, I, I couldn't remember if there was a jump scare in it, though. That the, was the thing. The thing is, for me, like, body horror stuff- Like, I love, like, Mortal Kombat-style shit. Like, that- if it's gross and violent, especially because someone we've already seen. Okay, but also there have been times that Joe has just shown up randomly and you got scared, so... Well, yeah, but this time Joe was there. For... In front of that video. It's been an AI of Big Bro Joe right now. Fake Joe, someone set up at a malice. Sarah, don't worry about anything it said. What are they talking about? Um... Uh... Hey, G. Who is Joe? Your turn to die, chapter two, end. Uh oh. We continue in the final chapter. A hollow heart, complete chapter two, part two, with still alive and kinda dead. Hey there, can you hear me? I don't know if I want to answer I think that. This is, I think this is the beginning of chapter three. Okay, we might just exit out here know. then. Because this, I'm assuming, is like. This is that chapter two, end? So I'm assuming that chapter three starts with like like this is the recap but i don't want us to do the I recap till next time yeah well i mean if, if it does the recap it'll just start over you know what i mean like you know what i mean i'll just do yeah. the thing i don't know i want to see we just I... don't we just don't have to go through it because you get to do the trees at the beginning so yeah i think i might close the game now or sure. just so because we, we, we're not going any further than this tonight because it's been almost six hours jesus christ yeah, we're going to do that, because then next time we'll just come back and we'll start Chapter 3. Chapter 3 and say, oh, wait. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, that's how you do it. What's up, Jesus? Nisio? Are you doing okay? Actually, I, guess I was going to reopen the game so that I could have the music, but the music is very loud, so we might just leave it like this. Nope. Okay. You know what? At least you know where you're at. Yeah. <laughs> I guess that's what, wait, I turned off the volume, right? Yeah, I did, yeah. I think that's where we're going to end it for tonight, because it has been a pretty long stream as it is, and I'm also getting tired and kind of hungry. But yeah, it was a good stream. Also, if you haven't yet, be sure to check out the video that's in the pinned comment. Uh, what was I going to say? Uh, yeah, check out the video in the pinned comment. Be sure to stop by for the rest of the week because we're going to be playing a bunch of Inescapables, which is going to be a good time. And making fun of it will be a good time. It will not be good like this game. It will be good in other ways. Good in ways that are bad. And then Friday will be Overwatch. Next week there will be a new video. If you're a channel member, make sure to go vote. It's past midnight. Also, thank you, Puppo, for being here. It's very yeah, fun to of have course. You. I love gaslighting you. <sighs> I love that you only admit kidding. that you're gaslighting me when it's over. <laughs> you're like, no, I never do that. I would never gaslight you. What do you even mean? I love being here, though. I appreciate you having me. So thank you for having my little gaslighting ass with you along with this journey. I hope I have, oh, Jesus, I kept you up late. Okay, I think we're going to see who we can raid out to. Uh, um...
I think. Yeah, we can read out to uh, Jinx. He's still going, I think. He's been going for a while, but he should be going for at least a little bit longer. Where are you in here? Somehow they've made this, like, find someone to raid things so much worse. So, are you okay? Are you, like, alive? You're so quiet. Me? I've been yeah. talking this whole time. You're... Yeah, I'm fine. Anyways. I just hope I'm not keeping up too late. But thank you guys no, very much for I'm watching. Fine. Okay, as long as you're fine. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. What are here for some of the stream, all the stream, bits and pieces, etc., etc. I really enjoyed this. I hope you have too. Uh, and yeah, sorry, I'm kind of losing words. Honestly, I think that the Kana death has uh, been more impactful than I thought it would be. <laughs> Anyways, I will see you guys soon, okay? Say hi to Jinx for me. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you again, Popo.